Actually, I need to get focus of the game. There we go. It might be a little loud on my end. I might have to fix that. There is no new game plus. I'm really surprised by that. And I'll, I'll skip the dialogue and everything. Like, we've already done all that. We've already heard it all. I don't think there's, like... You can definitely 100% this game in one file, one attempt. There is no, like, missables, it seems. Because even if characters die, you have a guy that gives you the items they, are, the they give you. Dawn. Yeah, this is sounding a little loud. But I missed one nun. I missed three cherubs. I, I was pretty close. So I'll do it again, because I did want to play it at least twice. I don't know if I'm going to have to do a mace run, because I'm hopefully going to find everything this run. I'm not sure how I want to go about the uh, collectibles yet. Like, maybe mark them all. There's another one of those uh, infinity symbols right there. Okay, we know how to do that. But, like, right on his coffin, there's one of those. There's only one route still. Okay. So, I'm thinking, like, I'll mark what I find on the map. And if I collect it, I'll use, like, a blue gem to indicate, like, I've collected it or something. I'm not sure yet. Okay. So I'm taking the, like, the daggers. Yeah, this is still a little loud. Got my parry. Confirm. I'm worried about reducing the audio a little too much on my end, because I do want to listen for those nuns whispering. Because I don't remember where they are. It's just secret walls, basically. And there's the first boss. It's called, like, the faceless one or something. It's only got two attacks. They ha could have more. Maybe I just never saw them. And now I know that you don't die to spikes, so I can be a little more risky with my platforming. Wasn't there a secret here? Nope. Okay. Terrible start. Lost precious seconds. I'm surprised there's no uh, speedrun mode for this game, too. That would have been nice. I feel like all Metroidvania should have that at this point. Oh, yeah, and you can't touch the, uh... Can't touch the wheel. Learn that the hard way. All right, I don't have double jump. I'm so used to it now. Just lay into him. Yeah, I'm so used to having double jump and air dash. I don't think you can parry any of this stuff too. There is an achievement for killing a boss without taking a hit after this one. So I could do that in this run too. I'm thinking on the priest boss. So if I take a hit, I might just restart. Get that achievement out of the way. Okay, a little cinematic here, I think. Yep. Can we skip these? Yes, you can. Unfortunately, he doesn't collect the blood in this game. Like he does in the first. Okay, we got the mark. We can't upgrade the weapon until we get to like the next boss almost. Or like the second boss. I forget. That when we talk to that girl. Not this girl, though. See, this entrance for her during the cinematic is boring compared to the entrance and exit she has later. Like, watch this. Actually, wait. Skip all this. Here it comes. No. Skip all this. Once you walk away, her exit is so cool. Her entrance later is the same, which is just even great. Okay, ready? Oh, so cool. Okay, game starts now. I got my daggers. Dashing is the fastest way to go. Until I get double dash and then I can just do whatever I want. Sacred thrust. Actually, does it not cost anything? Get as much cash as I can at the start. There's the XU. I don't remember. Okay. I don't remember the sword having any alternative. It doesn't have a dash tag. 
And I gotta remember that I am don't have much health anymore. This isn't late game penitent one. Okay, I might as well mark what I can on the map. So I'm thinking I'll start with red for roadblocks, blue for collectibles, green for collectibles I've collected. I'm, I, I don't know, something like that. So I might as well just start marking it all off the map. There's the fire. Okay, I know how to do all this. I will put a gem here to indicate collected. I don't know what I feel like doing yet. That could have been better. But I gotta remember, I, my flasks aren't as good. My heal isn't as good. This isn't late game. And now I know these are always ch marks or cash. I did get the achievement for buying everything in my first file. Ow. Ow. But no upgrades for daggers for a bit. Until we talk to that one girl. I think we meet her in the, uh... In the first dungeon. Ooh. No good parries yet with this weapon. Oh, first cherub. Now what I'll do with cherubs, I'm thinking, oh, I can't do, okay. I'll mark the cherub, but I'll use a green beside it to indicate I've collected it. Or maybe a skull? Yeah, maybe a skull. Just indicate collect, like, I don't know. Oh no, there's a cherub symbol, I forgot about that. So, if I put these down, I might get confused by which ones I've collected and which ones I haven't. I think the best thing to do is just ones I've collected, I'll use a skull. I think that's the, I don't use the skull for anything else. Actually, that dash attack is a good chunk, but I have to do it at the right spacing. I do have the bounce, too. I might as well start collecting. Until I get a combo going. I don't have a combo for this yet. Until I get like the rapid fire and stuff like that for it. I think the best thing you can do is dash jump, dash jump. Just to not have to deal with the recovery of the dash. I'm just here for a statue, nothing else. Welcome to one of no we know what he says. Go out and collect stuff, I know. It is now the I'm pretty sure, like, this one gives you, like, 10% boost to everything anyway. Yeah, just increased damage. May the and the first, uh, bead you get increases your defense. Like, it's all around just a good starting point. And I do have an achievement related to this guy that I'll have to cash in. Here comes the scream. Not sure what that screams from. There's nothing big that even screams like that when you're in here. Whoa! I, I probably could have taken that hit. I don't need to be afraid of anything. How long does that take to kill these guys? What hit me there? Oh, his arm. Okay. Make five bucks off each urn. And it's okay to just fall to my death, like, do Leap of Faiths. Because spikes don't kill you in this. I'm not doing great parries here. Just doing a little exploration, see what I can find. I, I wish I had the sword for this. Make it a lot faster. I think this is a dead end. This is the ed exit, isn't it? Yeah, okay. Yeah, I think this is the best way to travel. Until I get double dash. Ooh, thought I'd reach. 
I can't dash over things yet. But I do need the cash. Okay. There we go. I can't go that way without the mace. And even if I had the mace, I would still need the daggers to zip across. Oh, I don't want to go this way yet. I want to explore a little bit more. I don't want to deal with the puppet man yet. Okay. Her, that doesn't do any... Actually... Did she ever talk at the start? Sleep. Oh yeah, she did talk. Okay, that's the only time she ever talked. Oh, I can't even go this way. Okay, we gotta fight the puppet man. Might as well set up for it. I know how to fight him now, it's just annoying. Look at him burn. I don't have double jump, that's right. I'm so used to evading that attack. Here she is. Okay, we know what she says. Yerma's her name, here's an upgrade. Allows you to get abilities now. Tutorial of how to do it, I think, right? Or not, okay. Uh, use the cross guard last second, that's the parry. Unleash a barrage. I only got one. I'm going to try this just to start the new mechanics. Okay. Wall cling ability. Yeah, we know this. I don't know. I feel like a lot of games should have like, oh, you this. Is this your first time playing or not? And if it isn't, just skip animations like that or tutorials. Like if you have any, if you're expecting the person to replay, give them the option to not have to watch the same stuff over and over. There we go. I already forget which way I'm going. Can't go that way. Okay. And this is the old lady. Okay, we've done this. We can put it on the, there. We're using the map opt to, to like full extent of the map this time. Just gotta remember which way is which. Oh, jeez. I thought I would get the stun. The lightning is pretty cool. Lights up the HUD and everything. Oh man. Whoa! How long does the lightning last? Yeah, I'm going the right way. Oh, I guess it lasts until you're hit, okay. Aw. I need my lightning back. Burn them all! Okay, there's the mark. I'll avoid his fists while he's swinging. Oh, I can see the gauge fills up. Okay. So it's pretty much exactly like the sword. Oh, the lighting's so cool. As soon as it engages. Actually, the damage output's pretty fast with them, too. Wow! That's really fast. Aww. Like, that's dying faster than with the actual- with the sword. There's a collectible over here. I think the return home abilities here, yeah. Okay, I will mark this on the map if it'll let me. Yeah, green will be collected. No point using that elevator yet. Lightning doesn't even turn off until you take a hit. That's too good. Okay, this is a trap. I don't have much health though. I have lightning though.
Wait, I have dash. Okay, that didn't do much. I think that was a vase or an urn. Yeah, they don't even get a turn. Lightning's amazing already. I think there's a vial upgrade. Yeah, there we go. I think this is going to be a fun run. One point into daggers and it's already looking amazing. Uh, I guess I'll give him. I forget what you get for giving him. Uh, nothing, actually. I think he just gives you a story. This no. Yeah, nothing. Okay. Until, at least until the statue's complete. Then I gotta fill up guilt and give it to that guy. Three thousand bucks. Probably need at least one more statue. There's a oh, okay. Mark it off. I think skeleton's the best thing to indicate you've collected it. Even because if I do have to wind up comparing to like a map to see a guide of where all the cherubs are, if I'm missing the one needle in a haystack. It'll just be easier to compare with the skeletons. Open on so no. But yeah, this run we'll just skip all the dialogue. Bring me. Like maybe with Varan, Varan, I forget Varan, I forget her name. But when she's alive, if I'm using her in fights now, then yeah, I'll let her talk and I'll see if she's got different dialogue. Store isn't open until you come back later. Oh, humbly allow you never know what. Forget if he's got statues. The object has your just one statue. Uh electricity. Yeah, I'm not gonna buy it yet. There's no bon there's no benefit to buying. He he doesn't like never show up again or anything. He just travels. He'll just have more for me later. I am going the wrong way, actually. You have to go up first, don't you? What's this way if I... Hmm. I forget. Uh, am I going the wrong way? No, you get to the warp. For the sake of that 30 minute, like, achievement, I think I've already screwed that up. But for the sake of everything else, I think I'm okay. This is a dead end, yep. It's a trap. There it is. It's the little guys, aren't they? Oh no, not yet. No little guys yet. There they are. Oh, these guys are hard with, that, with this weapon though. There we go. Eternal, how's it going? Yeah, it, game was fine. I mentioned like what I didn't like during the credits and it mainly just came down to like how they simplified the game. Like the art style being one thing, how they uh, didn't have the main artist. But I just felt the game was a little easy. Like I finished it in like 13 hours and I feel when I do, like by the time I 100% this game, I don't think it's gonna be as much time as I put into the first one. Like, I checked, I put like 52 hours in the first one. I think that was just A, difficulty for one thing, and B, just how long it is. Like, I remember dying a lot of times to each boss until I learned their patterns. Most of the boss in this game, I kind of beat in the first try. I feel like I'm, I'm still going the wrong way already. <laughs> But this weapon with these guys is really annoying. Actually, can I even reach this? No. Okay, uh... I'm gonna indicate blue. I thought I could reach that. Yeah, that that's it. Once I got double jump, I was like, oh, sky's the limit. Like, a lot of stuff you didn't have to worry about once you get double jump. 
Like the big guys with the maces, especially. Yeah, I don't want to go this way. Ooh. Really wish I get that parry upgrade. Oh no, my lightning! Almost died. Oh, the stupid puppet guys! The fact they can parry too! There we go. Uh, oh, we're done. People were. Oh, yeah, I know people rage quit. And oh, the fact spikes don't instantly kill you blew my mind. Like, I avoided spikes for the whole game, thinking, like, oh, I'm gonna die. I fell in some, and it just sends you back and lose some health. I got achievement for it. I was like, oh, spikes are worthless in this game. <laughs> Oh, I didn't parry. I got didn't even bother tagging. If confirmed, they'll be around. Yeah, like I know you mentioned they making DLC. I hope they're making. I hope they're making DLC. But well, I don't like games. Like, let's say the DLC came out in a year. I don't want to come back to a game and not remember how to play and anything like that. Like, I want to play the full game so I can experience the whole thing. Not like. Oh, let me come back, play two hours, then drop it again, kind of thing. Plus, the other reason the spikes were hard is because I felt ladders were really hard to work with in the first game. Like, they feel really... they feel like normal ladders in this. I did not like them. Actually, sec, mark this off the map. Uh, let's see. I'm gonna mark this. Put a roadblock. I played Blasphemous 1, like, right, right after the DLC came out. I think. I don't remember. But it was the perfect timing. I think I just beat the game, and the DLC was released, like, a week later. Oh, that one that jumped high. Yeah, I can't even see him. But I had the full experience on that game. Well, I guess I can just burn them. As long as they stay in the fire. No, I didn't get the good end. I knew I was going to get the bad end. Because you know, there's always something you have to do to get the good ending in these games. Well, that wasn't a parry. Price of blood. I'll mark it on the map. Just to indicate that I've collected it. Er, yeah, okay. I don't know how I want to do this yet. But I'll get the ending eventually. Like, we're going for 100% completion. It might be this one. I got 99% of the map done the first playthrough. I'm pretty happy with that. I know where the missing percentage is. Yeah, I think I know which ones you're referring to. I put one in a specific slot and it started glowing. I'm like, what is that about? And I noticed like two, three of them had cloth on them. And I was like, this is suspicious. I didn't have the fourth one, so. But I started to piece it- oh jeez, heal up! But I started to piece it together. Like I was just experimenting with combinations, then I noticed, hey, that one's glowing. Look at that lightning fly. Oh, he got me! I thought I would get him. But no, this, this run, we're doing it faster, we're doing it better. 100% completion, hopefully 100% of the map. Looking for cherubs. Because it might have just been, a, I missed three cherubs. And I feel like I wouldn't have missed them if I was marking them all on my map. Like ones I saw but couldn't reach kind of thing. Come on, take him out. There we go.
Got my lightning. She's got Beyblades. But no, we're less than an hour in, and this lightning upgrade is so fun. There's the warp. Oh, right. I want to use it to get the other areas lit up. But yeah, I felt like if I found the three cherubs, it would just domino and get me the other everything else. Uh, do I want to come back this way? What am I doing here? I don't really need anything. But no, I just feel this game didn't have the charm like in the first, and I think it's because easier, for one thing. Pixel art cinematics are gone. Uh, and they, it felt too, too Metroidvania for its own good in the sense of double jumping and air dashing. It just doesn't feel right for this character. Burn them all! If it was some like you only get air dash with a certain weapon, I feel that would work better with the character. But I shouldn't have a giant mace and bouncing around the screen. Oh, he's not dead. Whoa! Like, they were trying, but I feel double jump and air dash just seems like day one, no unique... Like, it's just like, okay, we're making Metrovania, shove it in, like, it's somewhere. Like, you're not thinking outside the box when you're bringing those mechanics in. If it was like, the dagger gives you dash, the sword gives you double jump kind of thing, maybe. Oh, wait. It's a little guy! Oh, let me heal up, actually. Like, they said they wanted to put more Metroidvania into it. They did, but I think they did it the wrong way. Oh, jeez. Whee! Can I break this? Oh, right, you can stand on it. <laughs> What'd I get? The veteran. I'm not even gonna mark those on mine. I don't think I need to mark statues. Do I? Yeah. Oh, and the other big thing, not enough big bosses. All the bosses in this game were human. Or human shaped, I should say. Or human size. If it was like, if they all had a, okay, here's what they could have done. If they all had a human form, that's fine. Like let's, the spider silk one, the big guy, the water guy, all fine. But if it was like, you kill them, they get a second phase in a giant monster form, I think that would have been better. I'm not even gonna deal with those guys. Oh, there's another. They're all over the place. Like I could think, I think there's, I would say there's only technically two big bosses in this game. I'm not even gonna. I'm not even gonna include the final boss because that's just a gimme. That's so cool. This is a trap room. Oh man. I thought we were starting with Beyblades. Oh, it doesn't. Okay. Crap, 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 crap. Did he cancel my. Oh no, I just dealt that much damage. What the fuck? I did terribly here. Yeah, that was terrible. Yeah, they could, like, there is DLC. I gotta, like, hopefully there is DLC. 
Hopefully this game doesn't turn into like uh high fire rush and just gets dropped kind of thing. Jacktron, how's it going? I'm not sure who you're referring to, but yes, I am in Canada. I need my lightning. Okay, just burn him. There we go. Yeah, there's lore. They, they can use lore reasons, but like, just, just give me big... Like... That's what got this game famous, was the pixel art and big bosses. Like a giant be baby that rips you in half, and uh, uh, the dead corpse, like stuff like that. Like coming off of Blasphemous 1, it just, there's a little less to it. The, 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 the wow factor isn't there. Oh, same. Okay, I thought you were talking about a streamer. Yeah, I don't know the rest of this, the wrestling scene. I'm gonna get that just for the heal now. They just run at you. There's three of them. Burn them all. I don't have air dash. Look at him go. Keep him off of me. This weapon's terrible for him. And then we got Beyblades. Definitely gonna heal off that. Dang, I got a kiss, okay. Oh, no, it's not shit, it's like... It's more cinema, yeah, the first one was, uh, no. The first one just had a bigger impact all around. This game's not bad, it's just too, Met it's too Metroid for its own good. Like, if they, I, it could have been better if they didn't try and be more Metroid. and didn't take into account people's complaints. Like, the game's hard. Don't dumb it down for everyone. <laughs> it's like, I don't want to fight giant bosses that have two moves, and it's just like, oh yeah, I that beat them on the first try. Not to mention the de like length of the game is affected by it. Uh, do I want to go left? Do I want to be here? Oh right, the ghosts like dash at you. And they have an aerial attack too. Didn't know that. I know there's a cherub like right here. There we go. Mark it on the map with a skeleton. I'm not going that way. I don't like that way. Going down. I think I know which Mexican theme you're... Which game you're referring to. I saw a trailer for it. And just the art style of it, I think I know which one you're talking about. Melissa, how's it going? You made it again, eh? For the midnight stream. I think I'm going to go heal up. Weren't you already a sub, Melissa? What do I want to do here? Oh, I can't even go this way. Okay. But no, all around this, I'm glad I'm playing it. I wish it was a little more unique. Yeah, I think I only saw the trailer. I don't know if it came out. 
Like I'll play Met I'll play Blasphemous 3 whenever that shows up. I just hope they took the negative review the negative comments this game has in relation to the first and just clean it all up. Yeah, it's we were I was mentioning to you what game this was yesterday, Melissa. We'll probably be playing this for I'm thinking I'll probably be playing this for at least like another week. Depending on the achievements. Right now it's just 100 percenting the game. I don't know how many replays it's gonna be or how many items I miss. I feel like I could have dodged that. Oh crap. Nope, that was bad. Just get out of the corner. Ooh, okay. Uh Let's heal up. Oh yeah, another another aspect of this is there's not enough enemies. There there's some color change, some sprite color changes in the second half. But like, how many times do I fight this little candle guy? How many times do I fight the big guys with the mace? I'm playing this on PC. Since I found a sale for this for like 10 bucks. Like 10 bucks and I still had like digital currency on a wallet for some random store. I was like, yeah, I'll buy this now. Just play, basically I'm playing just all these backlog games I had on Steam that I never got around to. Palette swaps. What did I, what did I say? Did I say like palette skins or something? <laughs> Cause I was like, I'm not saying the right word. What am I thinking of? I should not be here yet. Ah, whoa! Different color schemes, yeah. No, that's not the word I was... Three of them again? Burn them all! Perfect. That was a good one. This lightning is so good! Have I, I think I've heard of Gorebox. I think there was a video I saw recently of that. Like someone playing it. Two is more hopeful. Big jump. There we go. That hit me? Come on! Yeah, I think someone was playing it. Like, I saw a YouTube channel that mentioned it in the title. Oh, he got me too. I can't wait to get parry again so I can teach this. Okay, heal up. Oh, right. I could fight her now. I'm not, no, I can't. I don't have the sword, actually. But yeah, the plan is 100% dagger run. Like, I'll use the sword and mace when needed, but we're going just daggers for the main weapon. Because I do need to kill 300 things with them for that achievement. I do have to do that for the mace, but I'll probably just do that, like, end of game after I've 100 percent of the game. Like, just get it out of the way. Like, come here and kill... Kill, uh... Mummy birds and just farm it. Whoa! But I'm definitely doing root differently this time. Like, I'm already feeling it as a different because of... Yeah, here they are. And you may die Since I start with dagger, I have the opening paths. Before my very we don't have to lead to listen to this. Now, sit down. Welcome. It is a great... What does... Yes. If only I could... How do you do not... Okay, put people on the map and just keep going. I don't have the items for him yet. Uh, his first phase, easy as anything. Second phase, I probably died there more than any other boss. Uh, ugh. yes, I don't have dash though. Doesn't matter, got it.
Okay, I'm going to mark it. Yeah, that was the other thing. Like, I liked the idea where it's like, here are the markings. Zoom out. How do you zoom out? There you go. I like the idea. It was like, okay, you've been here. You go back, do something, and then a castle opens up right beside it, and it's the same area, but like expanded. I was okay with that, but I don't like how it handholds you saying like, go here, go there. At the end, it was just like one marking, you do it, go to the other side of the map. But yeah, it was very linear. But that's another problem with Metro with Metroidvanias lately. It's just like, go to point B, basically. Especially in Metroid Dread, the Atom, Adam just kept telling you where you need to be. I think Metroid Dread is like the easiest Metroid made so far because of Adam. Yeah, the sec second half of one was linear, but that was the sense of like, okay, you're at the the halfway point. Like once you collect the three bells or whatever and the door opens, it's just go that way. Uh, that's enough leeway into anything you've done, like, I dread. Yeah, like, but I mean, like, for a first playthrough, you're not gonna know, like, okay, I gotta cheese this. And Melissa, gotta watch out for the 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 emotes spamming because the stream lot oh, there it is. Yeah, they. I am sorry that the the bot is kicking is muting you there. For so I for some reason as much, I keep reducing the stream bot's like spam protection and it just keeps hurting people's emotes. Where it thinks like five emotes is enough to worth to mute someone for thirty seconds. Oh, I didn't parry. Oh, jeez. Now heal. Take the hit, it's fine. But even Metroid Dread, like, it had its it had its own other difficult uh, problems with difficulty. Like that game was easy. Like, every enemy drops rockets, every enemy drops healing, it's just like, okay, I don't need to be afraid of anything. And even if you died in Metroid, it usually just booted you back to the room before you were in and it's like, continue, yes or no. Even the Emmys, it's like, oh no, you got caught, here's an insta-kill, try again. Like. Oh yeah, this is my second playthrough. Like, I know where everything is. We're just doing Dagger Run now. The first playthrough, I got to 99% of the map, and I missed some cherubs. I was like, I'll play it again. Try again. And use the map optimally. Like, mark everything on the map. Like, I still have my other file. I could even, if I find those three cherubs, just go to the first file, unlock, get them, and then it's like, okay, 100%. But we'll see. I'm hoping I can just do everything in this playthrough, because so far these daggers are really fun with the lightning. I don't know, the industry just the industry just holds your hand on everything now. Like sure there's Dark Souls, but like It's like people still excuse me, there's people still need an easy mode for that game. It's like, okay, it's no, like welcome to the 80s or 90s. It's like, just try. Accept a bit of challenge in your life. Uh, I'm gonna call the game easier than one. Yeah, like one one prayer, you like, not only that, uh, like you had choices in the first game, sure, but not as much as this. But even then, it's like, I'm not playing the whole game with the mace. Where am I? 
Okay, connected the map. Yeah, th I, I would say this game is easier than the first. It's not an easy Metroidvania, but it's an easier Blasphemous. Uh, I could go to the boss. But I don't want to. I don't think I can until I get the sword. Uh, I can go up. No, I can't. I can't even go that way. I think I'm good. I think I'm just going to go get the, uh, the mace now. Where's the nearest teleporter? Downstairs, okay. Whoa! Okay, stop doing that. Uh... I'm, I haven't, don't think I've seen moon scars. Like, other than this, I can't think of any Metroidvanias I want to play until, like, Hollow Knight 2 comes out. Oh, no, sorry, no. I have Nine Years of Shadows. I did buy that. Because I found it for, like, six bucks. I might play that next. I don't, I'm not sure. What items did I collect? I'm, I've been distracted with talking. I definitely didn't have this spell the first time I played this early. Uh, I have these. I don't even need them. I might slap this on, just because I need more cash later. And Melissa, you should be able to talk again. The Streamlabs only mutes you for like 30 seconds. Oh, I have another guy I can use. Nice. There we go. Oh wait, this one increased the daggers. Perfect. Any combos? Ooh. Strikes can create chain lighting. Ooh, okay, I'm gonna try that. May the Is the music good? Okay. I got it. I have don't have it installed, just bought it so far. I can give it I'll give it a try. I'll probably 100 percent it. Any game I start 100 percent anyways. But no, if Silk Sock, if Hollow Knight 3 if Hollow Knight 2 came out at the same time as Blasphemous, I'd easily play Hollow Knight 2 first. I think everyone would. <laughs> There, games will not release the same week or the same two weeks when Hollow Knight 2 comes out. That game has too much going for it. It could be a flop. Like, we don't know. It could be like... Uh, Duke Nukem Forever release. Like, they could screw it up. Like, as long as Zote's in that game, it's great. <laughs> He's gonna multiply. There we go. Actually, you know, I haven't seen a single stun using these daggers. Uh, what was I gonna do? I was going to put some points in this. Uh, no, you're using that either. It's easy enough to enjoy the music. Yeah, I've I've seen two trailers for it. Like, I'll play it. Difficulty, I don't I don't care. Like. I feel like there's no game in the world too difficult to like not beat it. Unless it's purposely like you can't do it. Like I've played Battlefloads, I've played Ghost and Goblins, like I, I can do it all. Uh, I'm gonna put the parry in now. Or put cross slash. Damage lightning. Yeah, there we go. How did I do that spell? What is it? R1 in midair to form a quick cross slash. Oh, you have to have energy. Okay. That's fine. Just put a little indicator of a roadblock here. But if I start nine years, I'll play it until 100% completion, like everything. Whoa! Oh, he got me. Actually, I do have parry now. I also have spells. That's one thing I didn't use enough in the first playthrough, was just not, no spells. Also, uh, Eterno, the final boss, like the, fighting the child in this, too easy. 
Like coming off of the big boss. Like coming off of Eterno. Like if the game just stopped at him, I would've been fine. Ending it on the, the child and it being that easy, I was like, come on. Like it was almost a mini game of a boss. Just dodge everything and keep going. Oh, wait, let's mark the child with a skeleton. <laughs> now, I know there's a few things that I missed around here. I think that's all spikes below me. Yep, spikes everywhere. Oh, I missed. You try a cross slash. Was that three quarters HP? Oh, it uses your lightning. Okay. That is probably why it was three quarters HP. Turn around. <laughs> lightning is so good. Like, even before they get a turn. And I get... It's so much better than the sword. <laughs> like, one upgrade, it already is doing way more damage. At level one. Uh, no. Aren't there spikes around here? Beautiful. Oh, no, my lightning! There. Did this come with a comic? I do I remember a comic for this? I don't remember. Oh gee. I want my double jump. Look at that lightning fly! Beautiful. Then we got Cherub. Can't do anything with him. Like, look at that lightning go. Seems like a path down there. Five or six pages? Yeah, I don't remember. Wow, that... No, he can't even break through it. I have yet to fight a group of enemies to see the lightning chain off. Oh, there's the chain. I saw a little bit of it. The parries. Yeah, what time is this? One in the morning? I, yeah, I had a nap. I had a brownie. Like, I'm good to go for the rest of the night. See how far I can get in this for in like three to four hours. With these daggers doing all the work. It's a trap! I wish some other enemies would show up to chain this lightning off of. Oh no! Yeah, I don't remember the comic. I might have to read it like after this session. Okay, statue. Put it on the map. I think green will indicate. Wait, where am I? Green's gonna indicate that I've collected it. I haven't seen any missable cherubs yet that require some upgrade to get. Uh, what am I forgetting? Oh, wait, what? Up, oh, okay. I want my double jump. I want my dashes. I want all my mobility back. I'm going the wrong way. The parries. 
I had my lightning for a second. Ow! There it is. Might as well heal. But yeah, like I could play nine years after this, but I don't feel like I might be burnt out and I don't want to do two Metroidvanias back to back. Well, I have nothing else on deck right now. I'm still waiting to get my free copy of uh, uh, Elden Ring with the DLC. So I'm not going to play that game yet. Because I knew that game would get uh, DLC, so I just waited. We're going to go 100% 100 for, 100 for that, of course. Oh, okay. I thought that was going to touch me. Turn around. Oh, he did. <laughs> But I don't know if I'll want to play Elden Ring yet. Oh wait, these ones don't multiply. I'm thinking the later ones. Oh yeah, you can attack up with this. I forgot everything about these daggers. I don't know, I gotta see what I feel like playing next. I have no idea what I'm going to want to do yet. I'll even mark this off with a roadblock. I could just do back-to-back -back Metroidvania, maybe. Oh, jeez, right. Oh, landed on the right spot. Okay. Actually, they're all safe, technically. Look at that lightning! It didn't hurt him, but that was still cool. Yeah, they almost die to one loop. I got parries and everything, yeah. This is a good weapon. Does it not traverse on aerial enemies? What happened there? They die so fast! I'm going to put a roadblock here. There's a lot to do here once I get like double jumps and the mace. Wasn't there a cherub here? No, I'm thinking the water area. And now I got to deal with sand enemies that died to two shots. Those things took like four shots with the sword. Mark this down. I think the first nun is coming up here. Just a lot of roadblocks. Oh no, my lightning! Gotta charge it back up. That took a while. Uh, there is a cherub here. I'm gonna mark that off. Oh, jeez. The save point's right beside me anyway, isn't it? Uh, they still die pretty fast. Sword could not do that. Especially once you get the lightning go. Oh, there's another one? Oh, there's just one. Uh... I hear her whispering. Put a question mark for now. You need double jump for that one? I don't remember. I feel like I got that on, like, first visit here. There's the mace. And the only time I'm using the mace is for moving. Like, we're not using it to fight. If I do accidentally use it, I'm not, I'm not trying to. 
Yes, yes, I know how the mace works. Is there anything to the left? Secret cherub? No. Uh, I will put an item. Collected item. I, I don't know what else to use it for. You never use this set, uh, mechanic again in the game, too. You can't skip it. You gotta watch the sand drop. Yeah, I can't go up there yet. Oh! Dang, blades. I feel like I was able to get that nun the first visit I was here. I don't remember a double jump there. Yeah, we gotta reduce it again. And there's still one shots. The parries! Oh, I thought I could make it. Is that dead? There we go. Hey, get off it. Get out of here. And these little ones raise the sand. I'm thinking at least four bosses before I feel like turn it off for the night. That boss was an, that enemy was an accident. I just wanted to break the flask. Come on, I gotta build. Oh. Whoa! He got it off in time. Oh! There! 300 enemies with the dagger now. I thought that would take longer. That was some good parry in there. That felt like... that didn't feel like three. I know I killed like 50 in the first playthrough, but that didn't feel like 300 already. Oh yeah, we have to watch his drop. <laughs> that was fast. <laughs> it should always be that fast. <laughs> that was a bad parry. Any secrets? I got my lightning back. Okay, teleporter. Oh, the lightning goes pretty far! Uh... Alright, reduce sand. I have to open this path to get to, like, two items up here. I forget what these items were. I definitely got them late in the first playthrough. So hit this and run. There we go. Now there's like a lot of running here to do. Oh, 
Okay. Okay. Oh, can I make that? Yes, I can. Okay. One. And then do it again. With daggers now. Yeah. Oh, I could have done this one first. Okay. Crap. Remember that for the third playthrough if there is one. I don't think there's going to be a third. Oh, does the lightning die out? I guess it just takes a long time. He's gonna blow. Too soon. Surprised that didn't work. Oh, they have HP this time. They still die pretty fast, though. There's a save point, like, right above me. I think it's okay to heal. Now I gotta run. Or not. Okay. Made it! But yeah, now that I know where all the secrets are, I can get a lot done here in this area now. That was a lot of crits there for a second. Lightning activated. Just lay into him. There it is. Ah, uh, there's a... I'm going back, actually. There's a secret I can get now. Not a secret. There's something I can grab now. It's not a secret. Oh, it's just cash. One mark. Okay. You can probably upgrade the sword, the daggers now. What'd I get? Oh, I just finish it off. Okay. There's a lot of skills with the daggers, all right. It can reach underground! Amazing! It's broken. And it doesn't cost anything, too. You can't cancel it, though. Nope. Just run. Like, see, this is supposed to be, like, a little challenge room. It's like... It's not an easy mode, but it's not that hard. And even then, you have to wait here for a while. If it was, like, the skeletons that have HP that take a few hits, yeah, it might be a challenge. But the one-shot exploding enemy isn't much, isn't big of a threat. Where am I going? I think I'm just going back to the center room again. Secret? Nope. Not enough secrets so far. Ready to jump. D does like two hits. Three hits. I think it's three. Oh, but with lightning. Eh, little better. Oh, no! Oh, he got me. Well, that was a lot of damage. Chain lightning. Oh, I lost my lightning. There's a crit. Okay. Uh... Because people like me. 
Oh yeah, like these games are great, but the pixel art for this isn't as great as the first game. Because apparently like the lead pixel animator left, and so they just did animated scenes for like, they used the same company for the DLC animated trailer they used for all the cinematics in this. So I think there's that, there's that little bit of loss. And it shows because all the bosses are like human size in this compared to giant grotesque things. We're near the boss already, actually. That was an accident. I'm not purposely trying to use that weapon for kills. But basically, like, the main... Kill that guy. The main selling factor is just gone in this, I think. Like, sure, it's still pixel art, but it's not as impressive. Not a bad, just not as grand, I guess, is the word I'm thinking. I could have just jumped over him. Flames! Oh, that burnt him for a good chunk, okay. These daggers are going to be so good in the arena. With light, just lightning going off everywhere. I haven't I haven't heard much about that game. Like I I don't know what's I don't know what it's called, but I I'm pretty sure I know which one you're referring to, but I don't think I don't think it's wowing people as much as this. Like my first thought with it was just like, "Oh, a new guacamole kind of thing." I know it's not even remotely close art style wise, but my first thought was just like, "Yeah. Mexican Metroidvania guacamole." <laughs> I think it's going for more of a Wild West theme, though. Oh, it's Chalice. Okay. Uh, let's mark it. Green. Uh, I don't need to use that. Oh yeah, I, I pretty much play every genre. Once again. I got no genre. Oh, now. just a second. Is it your wish when I was but a girl and mirror the old I'll reflect and the miracle? As I've heard all this. Penitent one, we find us. Do you wish me to join you? Yes. There you shall find. Uh, yeah, I play pretty much everything. The only stuff I don't play is like Animal Crossing farm. I need farm chore simulator. I don't need any of that. I work full time. I don't need to come home to chores and do digital chores too. Like I, I hundred percented Animal Crossing on GameCube. I'm done. <laughs> Most recent RPG I think I played was uh, Sea of Stars. I already forget how this boss works. Whoa, oh, right, she shows up. That's a chunk of damage. Whoa! Okay. The lighting is so good. I forget what he's doing on this part. Burn him! Oh, he's healing! Completely forgot he can do that. Whoa! Okay. I am going to quit because I need that achievement for uh, kill a boss that's taking a hit. And you can see how far I almost did it on the first try there. I already put in an hour. I almost did it though. I just forgot about the glass there. Yeah, Sea of Stars DLC coming too. Apparently by the end of the year. Uh, 
for us. Is it your wish? When I was a million old, oh, and as I can it, we find. Do you wish there? But that's that's an example of what I was talking about. How like I played Sea of Stars, the day it came, like the night it came out, like I no, I played it like the stroke of midnight when it was released. I played it, I beat it in like I don't know two three weeks. 100 percent of it. But the DLC is coming out a year later. That means I gotta reinstall it. I need to. I have my save file still, but I just need to reinstall it, get used to the game again, because I don't remember what's what. I just like a full game's experience as opposed to come back a year later and remember everything. And if it's it's going to be free probably, but if it, imagine if it was like, here, $20, and it's like, uh, I got to remember how to play first. Billowing down the like, I just want the full experience, not tw four hours more experience. Already with the flames? Burn him! She shows up and just chunks him. Boomerang! He's already gonna transform. Burn him! Oh, he heals anyways. I probably could have killed him if he didn't heal. We got glass. Three waves of glass. That move's so cool. Oh, I made it. Burn him again. I'm in a mana. That's such a good, cool move. Where are my flames? Oh, she chunked him. There. Got the achievement. Oh, he was technically a zombie. He had guts. And blood. That was not just a skeleton. Uh, I don't imagine playing over a minute. If you were gonna, yeah, no DLC industry is atrocious right now. Shimigami. Okay, I played Shimigami. I got the collector's edition for thirty-five dollars on release, and I never played a Shimigami. I was like, oh, I'll try it. Like someone offered me thirty-five dollars. Like, yeah, I'll try it. I played it. I was like, I'm never playing a Shimigami again. I, from the start, I hated it. <laughs> I hundred percented it, but I didn't get that DLC. I know they released DLC later. Oh, no, that's a whole separate game. That DLC was just like an experience boost and like three extra summonings or three monsters. But start to finish, I just didn't like that game. But I'm never playing another one. <laughs> witness I even Skip all this. Oh no, th that game has stat checks hurts. easily. So it was. The die let the mirror. Yeah, and I know they re-released it for uh, PS5, not for the Switch version. A lot of people are complaining that it should have just been an upgrade, stuff like that, or like another DLC. But, but all around, I didn't like it. Not, the stat thing wasn't even one of the problems. But yeah, there's a lot of stat check bosses in that game. Penitent the fine. Okay, look at that exit. So cool. Yeah, this is like the first nun you can find. The sooner I get the teleporting save points, the better. Okay, let's see. What do I want to do? The parrot! Half health? Should be more. Oh, wow. He attacked fast. But no, yeah, that DLC it was just like, here's an extra, like, those rare monsters that spawn. You get, like, a boost of those. Uh, 
experience boost, monster boost. I was just like, come on. Like, you're just making the game easy mode. Not easier, just easier mode. Uh, I remember there was a little bit of a puzzle here. Oh, that does a little chunk of damage for stat boost. Or not the stat boost, the uh, lightning. Right, but I just remember the DLC, you got like a boost to them or something. Like more common drops or something like that. Too early! Oh, just made it. Uh, I remember there's some kind of challenge here. Oh, you worked on it? That's cool. Made it. Open all the extra paths now. Uh, let's see. Keep hopping. Ooh, made it. Oh, do you? Okay, that's cool. Uh, what do I do here? I need a platform, yeah. I got one friend who does, uh... I shouldn't say the company, but yeah, he does the Japanese work. Uh... I forget what his role is, but it's like... The Japanese translating... For... What is I can't speak tonight. The like negotiations and stuff, like translating to execs across overseas and whatnot. It is for a gaming company, but I don't I don't know if I should say. Uh well I need to ring the bell again, that's right. No, not a middleman, it's like I don't think middleman's the right word for it. I probably just can't speak just because I'm playing video games right now for the inner details of what it is. Uh, I need the sword here, so I'm going to put a roadblock here. It's more so just like if companies are coming. He, he, I, I, let's go with middleman for now. But I feel like that, that's undermining what his role is, but yeah, let's go with it. Oh wait, no, I need to ring the bell first. Rapid fire! But no, even like, like even without cheese, like I'm just talking first playthrough and I think I beat it like three, four times, whatever it is for 100%. But like, plot's terrible. I feel like by the time you start the game and you're a Nahobino, like, Three quarters of the story is already done. Like it happened off screen kind of thing. You fight Satan for your second mission and it's just a, like dead. That's it. And then it's just like everyone's fighting each other, but you don't get the full story from anyone's perspective. Almost. Like it just plot wise, I just felt like there are so many holes. I don't understand what's the reason for this character kind of thing. There's other re like what music. I can remember some songs, some monsters were just Palette swaps, like. And I know some of the enemies are just classic throughout the franchise, but I'm just like, okay, I've seen three versions of this thing tonight. <laughs> that and it's running on a switch, but I'm not gonna put that as an argument. Oh, did a lot of people drop out? Okay. I'm not sure what that activates. I really don't know what that does. Uh, okay. What do I want to do? I got a chair up there. I know there's a few things I can do. I could run through this area again and collect a few things. No, I did like the plot. The leveling up aspect and monster negotiations. I was just like, uh like the RNG aspect where they're like, I don't like you, and they just leave. It's like, oh, well, okay, I gotta do this again. 
I just didn't like it. And it's not it's not fresh in my memory, but there there are tons of reasons I didn't like it. Yeah, I heard that game I heard that version fixed a lot, but it's like I'm not buying another I'm not buying it again. I'll just I'll watch it if I'm got if I need to fill those gaps. No, the battle is like the battle system where it's like a crit gets you an extra turn. That was fine. The actual mechanics of the gameplay, I I have no complaints on that. The fusing of monsters could have been a little polished because that was kind of slow. Oh, and it also suffered from, and this, this I hate with most RPGs or just games lately, uh, it suffered from that thing where they fully voice act the cinematics, they fully voice act some scenes like in-game cinematics, but it does that thing where how to, they'll have dialogue. You talk, you go up to someone, you talk, I don't remember anyone's name in that game, but you go up and talk to them. You click interact. They'll say like, okay, in the voice, but then the dialogue is like four sentences long and just like put some effort into this. Like, don't, don't half ass it here. <laughs> or sometimes it'll be like, let's go. And then, and then the dialogue will be like, we shouldn't do that. It's like, <laughs> a lot of games do that. I know, but it's just, I hate games that do that. <laughs> Even in the Kakarot game, I was like, as good as it was, like, th that happened a lot. I remember one point, even, like, Chi-Chi even says, like, the voice says no, dialogue says yes. I was like, come on. <laughs> I don't think I need to be here right now. I'm kind of distracting myself with ranting and talking. We'll come back. I'm going to have to backtrack, but as long as I keep these markings up to date and don't get lost in the process. But the actual RPG aspect, that was fine, but the stat checking required sometimes trying to boost a monster's attack and just, it was very slow sometimes. Oh, I can get this one. Oh yeah, it's easily like a satanic Pokemon. But it's not the only game that does that though. That's the other thing. Uh, I can't go up. Do I have anything for, oh yeah. Might as well cash this in. Actually, there is no need to cash this in. He doesn't give me anything. Pray. I can understand why they did that with the main character. I'm I'm okay with that. May the hands of the. Oh, also, yeah, another thing with that game, uh, jumping. A lot of games lately, like a lot of these RPGs, they'll give you a jump button that's worthless. Nine tenths of the game. It's like, oh, here's a moment you get to jump a platform. And it's just like, okay, good thing I have an, a jump button. Like a dedicated jump button for these very rare instances where I need to jump. And even then, like Dragon Quest 11, 12, 11. How, you have a jump button? Even when you go up to an area that you have to jump though, there's an X button to climb. And it's just like, why? Like these, these worthless jump buttons that you don't need. It's just to feel like you have control and like some interaction, but it's just like, there's like, you can play without it easily. I think I can buy. No, I would say Come Final closer. Final Fantasy X-2 had the worst jumping. You are in my good you point. Because you get a jump button, but every time you get to a point where you need to jump, you have to press O. It's like a different button. 
I don't think I even need I need the knot. I will take that. I really don't need anything else. I can the seed, I'll buy it. I'm gonna wind up yeah. buying everything again. Plus, during Quest XI, you always need to narrow it down because someone could have played the DS version, someone could have played the PS4 version, played the Switch version, Switch version being the best version. Like, I have some friends who played the PS4 you know version, you know. like, oh, this game's crap. You have to mine stuff, then pick up everything you mine. It's like, Switch version, you could press once and it collects all of it together. And I told him to play the Switch version, but no, he didn't listen. But that's not his fault, like, it's... I don't know why they thought, yeah, make the player pick up every item they drop. It's not user-friendly at all. I don't know, I feel like I could rant about every game's problems lately. Uh, where does this go? I don't even remember. Like, no game is perfect. Like, it's very rare that you... Oh, up here, right. I'm gonna do this just to mark it on the map right now. Uh, the mu I have no complaints with the Dragon Quest music, actually. Like, it felt very like, yep, this is, this is Dragon Quest music. That was actually my first Dragon Quest I ever played. I was like, you know what? This game's big. It's the, the newest version. I wanna play something on the Switch. I'll try it. I'm glad I played it. I'm probably not gonna wind up playing. No, sorry. No, there's a bit of story to this. I don't care. I didn't care about Dragon Quest. I didn't care about Dragon Quest at all. And then I watched a video about a guy who grew up in Japan, uh, translated, I think four and five or something, and just talked about his life with Dragon Quest and how you're not meant to marathon it, meant to play like an hour here or there for the story and move on. I That changed my mindset with the game. And I was like, I will try Dragon Quest, and then Eleven came on Switch, so I played it, and I did play that style where I would do one quest a night, uh, like if a village is under attack or something, it's like, okay, this will be my, this will be my anime for the night, two to three episodes worth, so do the quest, cinematics, I'd eat my dinner, like I, it was an experience, and I did enjoy it, and I didn't have any complaints with the music though. I can remember a bunch of the songs too, but I didn't find any problems. And now that you're talking about the translation, I you you might notice this. A lot of people I was talking to didn't. I enjoyed how every village had their own way of talking. It's so like one one town talked in poems, one town talked in haikus, one had like a Scottish accent, and I thought that was very cool that they unique you made every town unique, in the sense like you can go to a town, talk to an NPC, and it's like. Oh, they're talking haiku. They must come from this village on the other side of the world. I thought that was great. And you find a book, you read it, and it, and it has that Scottish accent. It's like, oh, this book came from, this was written in this village. I thought that was amazing for a game. Like, all around, that was just a good game. Do I want to go this way? Another mark to upgrade the daggers. I can probably go to the next boss, actually. Some people I've talked to, they didn't like the game because it was too, uh, too much like Superman, too much like Superman and Dragon Ball Z, where it's just like, oh yeah, the person's the chosen one and super strong and blah, blah, blah. Like the Superman story. Like, they got to the first ending, and they're like, yeah, I'm done. I was like, oh, you don't have the full story. And they're like, that's fine. I saw the credits, game's over. I'm like, mm, there's a lot to the story still. Well, I, I, I was told... Oh, was this a bad idea to break these? Oh, no. I was told that it started English, and, uh... Like, they started with the dub with the script in English, and then it got localized to Japan, and a lot of stuff was lost. That's what I heard. I forget where that came from, but that's just what I heard. And I thought, like, I can understand that, because every town had that, like, differentiating dialogue. Where am I going? <laughs> I 
I'm getting lost with just ranting about games. There's a secret here. There it is. Oh, it connects over here? I guess this is fine. Oh, there's the reflection. Okay. I don't remember this area. I feel like there would be a cherub right there. Yeah, I remember because one because I heard one one way to learn Japanese is play the Dragon Quest games because you it's easily like the 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 language is so primitive to learn it. But apparently they had also advised like don't try and learn off twelve because the dub English was made first before Japan, the Japanese one. I think I'm going the wrong way. I am all over the map right now, I think. I can't even reach that. I need double jump. Uh, Roblox. There we go. Need double jump here, even. Also, there were no invisible ground secrets. Like, you have to hit the ground to see something. Look at that lightning fly. But yeah, I'm glad I played it. I'll play 13 when it 12 when it comes out because apparently they're going for a more adult theme for it. And I was like, oh, cool. It depending on how it looks. Yeah, I'll, I'll try it. Uh, which way am I going? There it is. Okay, I can mark that. With green. At least find a warp and then go to go the right way. I think I'm going the wrong way. At this point, we're just doing exploration. If I can find that clan, I can probably pay them and get me to the next place. To at least get two upgrades, I think. No, it's to get me to the uh, the shrine. The chapel, that's where it's going to send me. And there's... Cherub. You're free! Put the skeleton down. Just to mark it. Oh, can I fight this guy now? He's dying pretty fast. Lighting is so good. <laughs> Where is this taking me? I wish I could warp between uh, save points already. I think I'm going way off course. Oh, right, missiles. I think I get the upgrade for the dagger coming up too. Ow! I'm not gonna go up yet. First, just clear the row, then worry about ex Oh. Okay, I guess connect them. I don't know, I might have already found some cherubs I didn't find the first playthrough. Okay. Break that, and go back up. Next warp, I'm probably gonna go back down. Because I have to fight the... The seamstress boss. I don't have double jump for this region. I might actually, yeah, I might want to go back because I don't have double jump. I remember having double jump for this region. Scroll of the Elder. 
I'm gonna mark that. I don't know if I'll even find a warp here. I think I'm gonna wind up getting the uh, swords here. Or the sword. There's not plural. It's sort of the first upgrade, I forget. I don't want to lose my lightning. There we go. It's still three hits for him, even with the sword. Yeah, I definitely had double jump for this. Oh, it's because I switched my weapon. That's why I'm losing my lightning. Okay. I didn't even think of that. That did a good chunk. Can I reach this? No, I definitely need to come back with double jump. I shouldn't be here. I, mm, I'm gonna put it here for now. It's the wrong move, but I, I gotta get double jump. I need to leave this area. That was a parry, come on. Jeez, this, this, these cannot block a hit. There we go, that's better. Yeah, I need swords. I'm gonna roblox this. There's the sword. Could probably go back and just do a lot of unlocks right now. To be fair, I probably could have unlocked a lot of paths much sooner in my first playthrough had I known the sword is used to break those uh, branches. They did not, they give you that tutorial like three hours into the game. Yeah. It's probably like this is where you're supposed to get the swords for the first time. Is this about the time where I got that tutorial? I think the first upgrade for daggers is around here, though. Whoa! Okay, lightning is procced. Now everything dies, so I want to see how much this is going to hurt on bosses, too. Actually, it chunked the first boss pretty easily, and I just lost it. First, the first boss went down pretty fast with him. But now every path is open to me now. Until I get, well, ones with weapon-based ones. Oh no, wrong weapon. There we go. Got some poison. Okay. I will mark it off just to be safe. There's gotta be a warp run. I wanna leave this area. I shouldn't be here yet. I can't even get that. Yeah, like I don't have double jump. Totally different experience here. Oh, wrong weapon. Need my lightning. Oh, this might even be a problem now. I won't be able to do everything. 
Can I make that jump? Yes. If I can find the first upgrade without double jump, I think that'd be fine. Because then I can take out two more bosses with level two daggers. Oh. I can do this, but it's going to be actual challenge if I don't have double jump. I'm going to come back to that. I'm going to put a roadblock there. I gotta find the nearest warp. Uh wow, none none nearby. Okay. Heal up. Just to be safe. Oh, you're here. This move, the miracle cost your I don't think I can afford anything. Yeah, two spells. Uh, I don't need anything from him right now. Where's my lightning? Oh no, my lightning! About one enemy is enough to fill the gauge by half. It'd probably be easier to kill everything before I do this. I might have cost. Oh! Made it. Go back and kill everything, but no, we'll just keep moving for now. Yeah, I actually have to try in this area without double. There it is! Okay. If I keep going this way, I might get the upgrade, though. I remember it wasn't that too hidden. Can't touch the ghost though. Stop touching the ghost! Oh, I didn't even notice this. Oh, you can't even touch the trail! Okay, a little bit of cash. Oh, it's Mark. Okay. Stocking up for when I get to the level 2 daggers. Okay, I'm done here. I'm... I'm not ready for this region. Uh... Yeah, I didn't even find the... the pact in the forest to warp. And the warp would take me to... Uh... the cathedral. Oh, wait. I might be able to find it right now, actually. There's a shortcut I can make to get to... Oh, wait, I have to go up, though. Ow! I have to make the shortcut to go down, then I can get to it. And if I find the upgrade for daggers, great. I did not think that was gonna fail. There we go. That activates the elevator? Nope, just this one platform. Oh, I missed it. Soak these daggers up and just watch the damage fly too. That was bad. Jeez! Didn't think I was gonna die. There we go. The see the upgrades on the right side of this area though. I'm going the wrong way. It's like around here, I think. And I definitely want as much mobility as I can before the boss in this region, too. Hey, what was that? You can, cl you can cling onto that. I'm not holding the button, though.
There we go. Unfinished lullaby. Mark on the map. Uh, let's see. Oh, it's on the dead end? Yeah, just mark it on the map. It's collected. Right about here. No, that's fine. I'm just doing exploration. No big bosses yet coming up or anything. Actually, I might as well just finish this region if I can. Though I might die. I think I'm going back. Whoa! I don't need the warp. This will take me to a save point down there. Yeah, I'm trying to get to the Tribe of Shadows or whatever they're called. Yeah, I do have the Discord. It's all set up and I think it's in the description, all that kind of stuff. Uh, down to the left, yeah. There's gonna be one ghost around here, yep. His range is as big as the final boss, basically, with that sword. Oh, he's got missiles! I think the best part of these, this weapon is just waiting for the lightning to kick in. Every hit, it's just like, here it comes. Then you hear the charge, you're like, let it fly. Was it the ghost that hit me or the owl there? Yeah, it's like, t up left, I'm looking for. For this clan of shadows, or whatever they're called. You just message, okay. Now, uh, my, I'm in the Discord's in streamer mode right now, so I don't see it. Oh no! I'm okay. There's no music. I think the game glitched out again. Heal up. I don't actually remember if this area had music, <laughs> now that I think about it. Oh, I can do this now. I can actually get this thing early. Now that I know what I'm doing. There it is. If, unless I do it wrong. Come on, do it! There we go. Yeah, I'll message you when able. To your rev after see but the mirror. Oh, give me my statue. Thank you. Now I have to break this statue like who knows how many times. I think this one just increases your crit. I don't remember. There, got a shortcut to go to it now. Might as well just finish the region. Or the first half, at least. You have to come back here once you have the tribe completed. Pick up the ledge! Ow! There. Ah, I think the old lady has the goriest death in the game. He was just owls eating the corpse. I feel like there's a chair around here too. Like hiding in the brand the leaves. Okay. I thought I would have double jump by now, but I got distracted with my path changing and just wanting to explore. But I have the coin the coin gets you to double jump, basically. I just have to find where that horse is. Yeah, there's no there's there's a bug here. There's no music at all. 
All right, actually, I'm gonna save and quit right here and make sure. There it goes. Oh, and if you want to talk about uh, translation stuff, in this game during the credits, there's a few typos. Probably because it's going from like Spanish to English, but like it says additional voices, additional blah blah blah, additional, additional, and then additional with one D. I'm like, there's a typo. And the like, entire sections that are in Spanish like weren't translated at all. Am I going the right way? Uh, maybe. Oh, my lightning. Okay, that's bad. Here comes the lightning. There it goes. Beautiful. But am I going the right way? I don't have double jump. I can't go this way. Actually, I can go up here. If this takes me, I think this is it. First, I'll finish off this area just to be sure. Just in case of any collectibles. Why did I even bother with this sword? The ears are so good. I can't go up. Oh, where are they? Okay. I was like, they can... Oh, uh, crap. Like, they can try new stuff. Like, they've... They've solidified, like, okay, they, they, this is a cool company. But, I don't know, like... They, they kind of dropped the ball with this game. Not completely, but like, it just doesn't have that impact. Here we go, finally found him. Wave like figures. No. Like, you could argue it's because like, oh yeah, it's not the first time playing as you played the first game. No, it's like, they dumbed it down, they simplified it, they made it, uh, they made it not fit the atmosphere with the abilities you learn kind of thing. This is a nod, isn't it? Yep, okay. I'm just, oh, you can't even. Yeah. I think I can remember that I collected the item here. Ow! Okay, that should have been a parry. I'm gonna go left. Oh, I can go over here now, okay. Though I don't have double jump, but that's okay. I can do a few things here. Actually, no, I can't. I don't like it as a cherub. That's the only thing I get around here. I need double jump and dash to get to where I want. Yeah, this is the way I wanted to go. Probably get the warp, go back to town, get some upgrades, and come back. There's nothing here, right? Yeah. Just spikes. Even these things are hard to fight with the dagger. Just burn them. I'm not using magic enough. Come on, kill him! There we go. Got the bounce and everything there. Heal up. I don't even- do I have any upgrades out? I need two knots, that's right. Two knots and a seat and I have a kiss. Yeah, I need to go back and get some upgrades. Probably worth it after the double jump. I think it's- Right here, it connects. I should probably go back. 
That's that's enough upgrades to make it worth my time. That was a good three hits on him, actually. If you get the spacing right. Nope. And it gives me another warp. Yeah, I'm going back. Just to make this area a little less drama. Oh, can I go back? I forgot this is all collapsible. Oh, I made it. Can the, his floating rock doesn't count, luckily. Yeah, there it is. This is what I wanted. There goes the lightning. Hopefully nothing here can one-shot me. If there is an enemy I can one-shot, it's probably the like lady with the late this lady. No, oh, no, it doesn't one-shot. So cool. Ugh, 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 and knocked me around. Okay. I don't need to fight her right now. Also, I still have to play Lies of P. It's not from, from software, but I forgot that I still have to play that. Oh, don't, don't jump over her. It doesn't work. We got little guys. Yeah, I played the demo. It's it's just like a Dark Souls game. Give him the kiss. Little bit of mana. But you have to just be in the right mindset to start those games. Like, can't just be like, okay, play an Elden Ring game, play Lies of P. It's just like. Okay, I want to commit to this game for a while. I don't need to deal with her yet. Like, I don't think I could play, like, Dark Souls 3, then go straight to Bloodborne, then straight to Elden Ring. It's like, you want to get ready for those games. When darkness, it is there. My name is and I if you give, do you have Just give her the knot. Stop talking. You're now. now I do I missed one knot in the you first playthrough. I have no idea where it was, but this is the lightning, slightly increase. Okay, some of these are okay. The boss coming up doesn't use either of these, so no point. But for the sake of other enemies, yeah, slap on some lightning damage, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, lightning's fine. Uh, and then... I don't double jump. Okay. Nearest warp, though, uh... There's really no nearest warp. If I go to town, what can I do in town? I don't remember. Nothing worth doing. Okay. No! Get out of that. Actually, yes, there is. I have six marks. I am going to go and buy more slots for the, the carpenter. Can I get two? I can get two, actually. The figure... He's pretty cheap at the start. The old but he goes from like, when you get to four, it's like, yeah, pay me four, then it's like ten. It's like, it's quite the, the increase here, for the final slot. Okay. That's play. done. Open up. Here's the stun power. And striking with a weapon. Yes, slap that. I know that's going to break eventually, but that's okay. Fire damage. Physical, that's okay. Okay. 
Eventually that thing breaks. We go back to the, the wax man, the honey man. He fixes it. We keep letting it break, see what happens to him. Cause he's deteriorating every time it breaks. And we're going down. I have nothing else, right? Yep, okay. I don't know what else you'd call him, just, he's the honey man. <laughs> the parries! Yeah, but there's always things like that in those games. Like, I just go in those games expecting stuff like that. What was cool is how you can sharpen your blade, like, on the fly with his arm. I thought that was so cool. Oh, I thought he was dead. There. Like, I commit to those games knowing, like, okay, I'm going to be playing this for a while. Not in a bad sense. Like, yeah, it's a hard game. It's slow. I'm not trying to speed run or anything like that. Actually, did it already break? Oh no, it's still there. Oh, why are you looking the other way? Come here. Wow, it didn't even reach. One shots! Amazing! Is there anything these blades can't do? Oh, my lightning wore off. Oh, I couldn't parry. Oh, yeah, there we go. Did the game? Oh yeah, it does shoot you back. That's that's right. Hades, I enjoyed, but when you're going for 100%, it that game they screwed up on that game. Like I don't know. Oh crap. A sec, let me let me get in the right mindset before I fight that guy. Um, Hades was fine. Like you beat the game, you see the ending great. You beat it ten times, you get the real ending. Blah blah. blah. Well, an ending, but the 100% ending was le behind such fake grinding in the sense like you needed the nectars you had to give them to every character to level up the relationship but you can only give the nectars one time per run so if you have 10 nectars and this person needs five you have to give them one nectar start a run finish it or quit go back talk to the person give them a nectar start a new run quit or quit or finish it come back they don't allow you to just here here's six nectars take them you have to play five if you have to give them six nectars, you have to try six runs. And I hated that. And you have to do that per character, max out their relationships, and some characters RNG spawned, and it's just like, just let me do what I want. <laughs> the game was fine, but like, at face value, that game's great to most people, but if for 100% completionist, the game forces... It. That was the trap, yeah, the trap is the best word for it. It's like, oh, you gotta, it's like, there's hundreds, hundreds of hours in this game, it's like, well, Hundreds of hours because you force the people to do it. Like, I think I 100%ed that game in 99 runs. The, the other thing you can do is start a run and just quit and then give the nectars, but I'm not tainting my completion rate or my success rate just to give nectars to two people. I couldn't stand it. And then I, and Hades 2 was in early access and I checked and it's the same thing. And I was like, are you serious? Like they force that grinding on people. In two games, they didn't learn. <laughs> I couldn't stand it. Like, I'm talking to you, like, how do you hate this game? The ending was so good. I'm like, yeah, you didn't get the real ending. <laughs> or like, you barely put time into the game, basically. Like, getting the ending is just like, oh, crap.
Dix is that carry on jewel that you use. Was I'm not sure. I don't remember what you mean by the carry on jewel. Oh, that all connects. Okay. Oh, this guy again? Lightning really does help against him. Wow. Okay. I haven't seen any cherubs in a while. I'm worried about... Th There's the warp. Oh, and then this room. Okay. Wait. Those are bells that chime of which causes mystical damage. Okay. Need to go down. We're, all, we're doing this for double jump. That's right. Use the I don't remember the jewel. I'd have to Google. Like I don't remember a jewel at all in Hades. Oh, wrong way. Is this the egg? Okay, I'm going the wrong way. Oh, right. Dash attack kills them all. Oh, I missed! There we go. So cool. There we go. Oh yeah, the game was great. Like, I had no real complaints about that game. My All my complaints came from being a completionist. Yeah, he's just gonna run and bash into the wall. And then, lightning! It's so good. Here's the nun. I guess they only whisper if you're near the wall. They didn't whisper at the start of this room, because I knew she was in there. Oh jeez, bad position. Transit- oh, tr I... I was okay with Transistor. I felt the game... I don't- I wouldn't say suffer, but one annoyance I have- oh jeez! Just a second. Let me get my bearings. I didn't like... That game had a kind of the same problem that uh, Bioshock had. Like, everyone you talk to and everything happens off screen. Like, you're talking to a screen of the villain and the villain does something, but it's in another room that just... You're never seeing face to face with people, basically. It's all just off screen talking to people through a TV or a mo monitor. Similar like Bioshock 1. And like by the end of that game, I felt like, why am I fighting for these? Why am I fighting these people? <laughs> but yeah, it was very short. I think I finished that. I don't know. I hundred percented it, but I was that was basically like one week's worth of game. It felt like a un. It, not unfinished. It felt less. I can't think of words tonight for describing stuff. But if I had to take another Bastion or a new Transistor, I want a new Bastion. They're made by the same group, right? I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I'm pretty sure Bastion team made that. Same group? Okay, I was right. But I would definitely take another Bastion over that. Or like even a continuation, even though that game's ending is kind of sad.
And like, like spoilers for anyone listening about that game, but like you meet characters who are the villains and it's like, okay, this is their backstory and blah, blah, blah. And they're, they do this because of that and blah, blah. You meet them and they've already killed themselves and put their body into a robot, put their mind into a robot. And you're like, oh, we don't even get to see the person. Or they die off screen because they committed suicide or something. From what I remember, I, I could be completely wrong, but that's what I can remember. I don't remember what that triggers. What does this switch do? Oh, over there. Okay. I don't know. I don't know what time spinner is. Never heard of that one. Look at that lightning fly. Oh, he's looking at my... Oh, jeez, it's not dead. I'm overestimating the lightning damage on these things. Okay, open up. Can at least heal. Need that double jump. It's not, I'm not even Roblox, I just want that double jump for convenience. Time? Have I heard of times? I don't think I have. There's so many games out there though, like no one can play everything. Feel like I'm already going the wrong way. Here comes the lightning. Ooh, that was. Did the lightning cancel the dash animation? It looked like the entire recovery is gone because the lightning proc. That's about half health. Oh, come on. This one's not even looking at me. Yeah, I can't reach that. It's probably just for cash, though. And shall we? Yeah, there's so many Switch games. Oh, okay. Flips. Yeah, my physical backlog now is down to just two games. Like, I was chipping away at them for a while. One, one is Cyberpunk, but I was gonna play that. Okay, I was waiting for our all, oh, controller just disconnected. I was waiting for all of Cyberpunk to be polished and be considered a complete game. Then they announced the DLC. And I'm like, ah, crap. And I was like, oh, they released a complete edition. Complete edition doesn't even have the DLC on the disc for some. And I was like, ah, crap. And then it costs 40 bucks. And it's like, ah, crap. And then I was like, I got my copy for 10 bucks because it was in like the bargain bin. And so I just waited and waited. So I was like, oh, I can play it now. It's like, oh, the DLC. So now I'm waiting to see if I can get like a discount complete version with DLC, then start it. So that's one game. Second game is Sekiro. I don't want to play it until a friend comes over because he wants to see it. So I might just play that off stream with a friend. So I got to wait. But those are the two only physical games left in my library to play. Everything else is lately has been like PlayStation Plus free games or Steam games that finally went on sale or I found a discount. Like Blasphemous 2 and Hi-Fi Rush. Oh, another guy? Like nine years of shadows I found for, why do I keep jumping? I don't have double jump yet. Like nine years of shadows I got for like six bucks. I was like, yeah, I'll buy it. I've heard some things about it. I'll take it. Cherub! Everything has to stop. We need cherubs. Mark it on the map.
Wait, am I forgetting something? Yeah, the switch. There it is. Actually, while I'm here, I might as well kill everything. Oh, it's one shot. Yeah, currently I have nothing else planned. I might just go straight to nine years. Back to back Metroidvanias. Actually, some, one of my friends has brought that game up. If I'm, yeah, I think, I think it's the right game. Oh wow, made it before the door even went down. Here's the tree. Wait, why is it whispering? Is there none? Here oh. is where the first meeting took place. Is it the tree talking? Oh, is it the guide from the first game? Has not abandoned us. How much is this tree gonna talk? An achievement. I guess you had to listen to the tree. The whispering made me think there's a nun nearby. I guess kind of blasted through this room the first time. What's next? I can probably make a shortcut here. Nope, not on this side. Okay, do this, go back up, just to make a path. There we go. Demil, you made it! How's your Saturday, well, Sunday now? How's the Sunday going? You're, just, you're in time for the Blades only run. See how far I can get in one session. Oopsie. Okay, now I'm in a bad state for this. Oh, no! Half health, gone. Care uh, careful the emotes, though, Samil. Tamil, you're gonna cause the Streamlabs bot to activate, probably. I think five is the limit until it starts booting people. I really need to figure out why the Streamlabs bot seems to not like emotes lately. Even though I toned it down, it still happens. Oh no! No, I want to kill him. He's got to die first. Actually, a lot of stuff has to die here before I can start the challenge. Or not the challenge. Before I can start the goddess statue. I am all over this room. I'm in the wrong area. There we go. Open a path. But yeah, I don't think this path is optional. Like, if, I feel like you can do this whole game without double jump. But th the convenience of double jump is just obscene. Like, why not? I don't know if I need... Oh, yeah, I definitely am going somewhere else. Oh, there it is. Okay. Oh no! What have I done? No, get out of here! Danger! That's a dangerous room. Or dangerous floor, I guess.
There. Okay, that's all open now. All of it's open, actually. Okay. I can open every path in the game, basically, now. This takes me to the boss. Okay, I'm in the right spot now. Whoa! And then I get double jump, and then I should be fine. I'll put this as blue. Just so I'm trying to keep track of every item, Tamil. Just to make sure I collect everything this playthrough. There's the warp. Okay. Uh, did I collect anything worth going back to upgrade? Not really. This boss has like no special traits. It's just a physical damage enemy. So I have increased defense. Yeah. Okay, I'm good. Penitent one, is it your wish that I continue with this? Indeed, the lady. The reflection I've heard all this. The desiring that reflect as she looked at her reflection. I know who she's time, talking about now. She saw her face distort to the sound of a terrible tolling. Do you wish me to join you? Yes. There you shall find me, and in communion we shall fight. Actually, Jake, I'm going to see if the game you're talking about is the one I'm thinking of. Because I'm pretty sure I know which game you're talking about. Uh, Astalon? Oh, no, this isn't the... I've heard of this game. Yeah, I've seen, I've seen a trailer or two of this game. I, I thought it looked cool. Like, if it came to, like, if I wound up having it, I'd play it. I was thinking of something else, though. I don't know which game I was thinking of, but yeah, I've, I've definitely, uh, I've, I've seen it. <laughs> 13 Sentinels, that's the game where you can play with, no. It's like, let me pause. I got, I'm thinking of stuff. I don't think I'm right, but 13 Sentinels, is that the one where it's like Hades, where you can play with 12 other people? Or is there one called 31 and you can play with 30 other people? And it looks like Hades. I forget. I think it's one or the other. I think I'm thinking the wrong way. I remember how to fight this guy. This is such a goofy boss. Design wise, it's a cool boss, but I feel the spinning top just doesn't fit in the blasphemous world. Oh, made it. Look at that damage. Oh, too soon, too soon. Get out of the corner. Yep, okay. I remember. Again? No. He's up. He comes with the golden sword now. Ooh. I think he spins like five times. Whoa. Oh, no. Thank you, Verna. He's not even looking. Get him. There we go. Oh, it's a strategy? No, okay. I'm thinking of a different game. I think it's called 31. Where it's just Hades, but 31 players at once. If you also want to think about it, like, the first half of this game is more blasphemous than the second half. Second half, it's all just humanoid bosses. And very linear, too. How 
dark and uncertain, a penitent one. All that remain you return from you will have released the fire. Wake up now. Okay, bye. Yeah, look like Google like 31 player Hades and it should come up. The art style reminds me of like a 2D journey. Like the game journey. <laughs> we get double jump here? Yeah. Or at least all the little units look like the character from Journey. Passage of Ash. Just call it double jump and be done with it. <laughs> oh, right. Double jump. <laughs> right, wait. Check that wall. Nothing. Okay. You know, the combination of uh, knowing how all the bosses work now and the daggers, it's just, you just mow them all down. You're too strong with that. You're too strong with these daggers. And just wait till they're level two and see what happens. One cherub. Mark it with a skeleton. Crap. I'm also waiting for Bloodstain 2. Like when they finally make a sequel for that. And coming off of playing every Castlevania, like all the Metroidvania Castlevanias, Sit Ritual of the Night was the best Castlevania I've played. It had everything good about Castlevania they put in one game. It was so good. Oh, two, oh, right, I got double jump. I don't need to be afraid of this guy anymore. Okay, unless I fail the jump. I'm used to dash after now. There we go. Oh, yeah, even the 8-bit ones were great. Whoa. There. There. Oh, no. I want daggers. I don't need this. <laughs> though I did. I preferred the Symphony of the Night one, though, a little more. Bloodstain 2 was fun. I just. I just wanted more of the Metroidvania one. It was. It had a few areas that could have been polished up. Like, it suffered from a few things I find annoying in games, but for an indie, a quote-unquote indie, even though the guy just made his own company. <laughs> okay, I got everything here. I'm going to mark this. There's something below I didn't collect. Maybe I never collected this in my first playthrough. Oh, it's just a mark. Who cares? I'll care once I find the upgrades for the daggers, but for now, who cares? I thought it was an item I never found the first playthrough. Okay, where am I going? To the right. Oh, I guess- yeah, I guess I can skip all them. Okay. Seriously on the map? No, that's it. But basically that 31 player thing just looked like it was Hades, but it kind of just reminded me of like Gauntlet if you were to play with four players. It looks fun. Like I'm definitely going to play it. But Hades, wait, where am I on the map? Oh, over here, okay. Uh, 
done this region, I guess. I feel like I've missed some secrets. Oh no, there's stuff I can't reach right now. Well, I guess I can now. I got double jump. Nothing's out of reach with double jump. Like this cherub. Got it. Mark on the map. Couldn't find it. Okay. I'll look for it and then message you about it. I forget what it's called. Like, 13 Sentinels made me think of that one immediately, but I guess not. I feel like I, there's got to be more in here. No way have I found... Oh, my, mark that off. No way have I found everything. Finish. Uh... I can... No, I don't have dash. I can't do everything here yet. I think I just have to start going back to the main story. Wait, check that wall. That wall's suspicious. Nothing, okay. Oh, that's a dead end. Come on, get that lightning going. There it goes. I think the upgrade for the daggers are... The upgrade is in here. Way up. Yeah, it's in here. 100%. I just forget where. I don't even think I can do everything in the next area. Whoa! Yeah, the, this, knowing the game now and the, da the daggers are what's making it so easy. I was not expecting these to be so powerful. Ooh, I have another token for them. There you go. Figure. Now pray. I can do this part so earlier. Last time I did this at the end. Can get a few upgrades fast now. I have no idea where I am, but oh, I know where I am now. This is going to connect to the forest. That, oh, okay. Nope, this works. Like, first playthrough took some time because I, of course, was exploring, didn't know what was what. Some bosses took more than one try. Like, that blade guy I just fought took, like, three tries, I think, the first time. I can't make this yet. Put a roadblock there. But no, Ritual of the Night was so good. Like, they, they even provided, uh... What's it called? I forget what it's called. I can't think of words. Uh... An RNG mode where all the chests and items are scattered. And they had a time attack mode, speedrun mode, like all that they knew to just add to a Metroidvania. And the mod community, oh, made it even better. Like, put in the Symphony of the Night uh, font for when you do damage. Re redo all the portraits to be non, uh, to do not the backers, but Castlevania art. I was like, this is amazing. Randomizer, yeah, that's the word. I can't think of these words tonight. Like, replacing the art was so good, because they only had, like, six backers that paid enough for the art. So you'd have, like, four portraits in a row, and three of them, two of them are the same image. Whereas the art, it's like, yeah, we'll put every bit of Castlevania art in the game. I have double jump now, so I can do a few things here. I think I'm going the wrong way anyways. Yeah, I need to go down. I can't even do that! Okay. So much I'm still missing. What I didn't like with the randomizer is that when I was doing that run, a guy 
from the modding community came in and was just telling me to go download a mod for the randomizer so that it's actually random. Because apparently, like, the randomizer in that game was very primitive. But this guy was just like, oh, download this mod, install it, and tell people you're using it. I looked at the mod, he made it. <laughs> so he was just looking for free promo. Can I make this? Yeah, I can make this. There we go. But it, again, some of the unpolished to it was example of the the randomizer mode because they just little things just they didn't clean it up. I think it was just because it was a an indie game, maybe, but... It's hard to describe, like, I could sh Ooh! Okay, I got these early. Or in a different spot. Or maybe I'm thinking of a different upgrade. Okay, Max, the what do I get now? I have enough for all of them. Ah, uh, increased damage. Unlocks a second indie- Ooh, two! Increase the def gain of one of your blows. Increase the base damage. As I really finish with a powerful onslaught after the fourth hit. Press square repeatedly to finish. I've heard of Monster Sand. I can't think of it off the top of my head, but I that name's familiar. Yeah, I guess I can take this off. Uh, there's something else I think I can do. I can't do that. I'm going to put a roadblock there. I can do this, maybe? Yeah, there's a few things I can get with this. Whoa! I haven't seen any uh, cherubs in a while. Probably one hiding in those trees. I don't know. Yeah, I'm gonna just check more of the map. The next boss. Well, I have options to fight the next boss. I can either fight the seamstress or the father and child. I don't know what relationship they have. Oh yeah, I can just take this path now. I think it's just to one item. Oh, uh, it's a trap room. Okay. It's a little guy! I'm tempted to switch a sword just to take care of these guys, but no. We'll commit to dagger only. Okay, once the lightning procs... No nothing survives with this. Oh, you have to mash it, like, legit! What? It didn't feel like I had no HP! How far back am I? Why am I way over here? Okay. Gotta walk all the way back. I took... I, I didn't have full HP, but one shot from him was enough? Oh, I forgot to get this. So we're going to care to boost your sacred lunge. How do you do it? Oh, okay. Can I warp closer to it? Not really. No, get out of that. You don't need it. Just walk. Wait. No, I don't need you either. Going the wrong way. feel like a one like I knew I didn't have full HP but I didn't think he was gonna kill me with it that did half health to her uh, is there a secret here no okay okay wait what does this do 
Press from beginning to finish with a power. Oh, it's just a combo. Okay. I thought you had to mash on the fourth hit to get it to come out. It just means like do a four hit combo and you'll do a thrust. That's all it's saying. Ooh, that's very fast. Dan that's two hits now. Yell up. Feel like I'm two rooms away still? Yeah. All this for an item, too. So go in, pick up the item. If I take a hit, pick up my soul for a quick heal. Yeah, okay, so I'm not gonna pick that up yet. Oh, right, it's the little guys. I probably took a hit from these guys. That's where I probably lost my health. If they're gonna jump on a platform, it makes it easy. Okay, I'm gonna heal up here. I have double jump. There we go. He was the last guy, too. Okay, that takes one mark. Okay, that's fine. Uh, there's a path here. I don't know where it connects. Probably from down here. What is it? Which area is this? Yeah, it connects. You go to the shop that's around here, then you go up through the sewers, and then it connects there. There with the little guy. There we go. Okay, one item I haven't collected. Oh, the daggers are so good! Those guys used to take like three hits. Oh, my lightning! I say they're so good, then I have to deal with like the one enemy that the daggers are worthless against. Yeah, I forgot this item. Now I have double jump, so I should be able to reach it. There we go. Pilgrim! Which way am I going? I can go right. Oh yeah, that's nice. I do what I can. <laughs> oh no! Heal up! Plus I have so much crap to say about pretty much any game. I can't make that yet, can I? Oh, we can! Okay. Okay, kill her. There we go. Now, if anything, I want to do these arenas sooner. Just get the items faster out of them. That way I can just go and start collecting some items. Okay, uh, I want to double jump and break it. That, come on, double jump? I've, I've done this before. Do you have to dash? No, you don't. Okay, made it. And I did that for a mark. 2,000 bucks, that's it. Ah, uh, you're a good dude. Oh my, okay, that's nice. For that, yeah, just, just let me know what you have access to and I'll let you know. Uh, but right now, like, I, I'm still got, like, two games for backlogs. Or, no, sorry, I have nine years of shadows. And I, oh, also, PlayStation Plus, uh, Final Fantasy Crisis Core. I do want to play that. Because I'm waiting for Final Fantasy VII Remake to be complete. So I'm going to wait for PlayStation 6 and that game to be a trilogy. Because <laughs> who knows when that's finally going to be made. But I can play Crisis Core, at least, to set up. Yeah, I never had a chance to, like, I didn't have a PSP, I didn't have a chance to play it. But I'll play the remake on PlayStation, that's fine. 
I don't know if I want to stream it yet, though. That's the thing. Because, you know, I do, I do want to always have a game that off stream where I just don't feel like being on camera kind of thing. I don't know if I want that one to be one of them. Because I know that one, like, people like Final Fantasy. <laughs> but, like, I know people probably don't want to watch, like, Disco Elysium kind of thing. Oh, I know, like, the... Like, the PlayStation 5, I still think, like, some of the people I talked to, they still think, like, Ratchet and Clank is still the best optimized game on the PS5. Because it uses, like, every mechanic that console has. God of War, like... Okay, God of War 2. You play that whole game, the last, like, two hours, you start using the touchpad for things. And it's like, why? <laughs> I need three parts for that. I'm gonna fight this boss now. I think I'm good. Oh no, do I wanna fight this boss? I know, like good games on PS4. Like I I can't speak for Xbox. I I I am a non-Xbox house, basically. Like every console I've never bothered with those things. But I know like Game Pass, they're changing the prices. They're making it harder to own that thing. That and Xbox is shooting themselves in the foot like every week right now. With company closures and stuff. Oh yeah, I'm not gonna argue with that. Like, I think PlayStation 1 has some of, like, the best RPG library of every console. Because that was an era where they just were trying. Like, even Square at the time, or even just random companies were just trying RPGs. PS2, I would say it's the ones that polished and succeeded from the PS1, but PS1 was just trial and error for RPGs. Not in a bad way, just there was a lot. Like Konami was trying even. And just random companies and they're run one one off. Oh crap, it's lightning, right. Brave Fencer Musashi, one of the best ones I think I played. That was the first game I ever played on a PS1. And that introduced me to memory cards. I would always get up to one point and then I have to get off and it's like, oh I gotta replay it. And then I realized like, oh memory card, I have to go and buy one. So I had to explain to my parents, it's like, yeah, we need to buy this attachment. <laughs> then they made that Samurai Legend Musashi on PS2. And it wasn't as like, it was just almost like a remake, like a retelling of the story, but just wasn't as good as a game of a game. Can I make this? There we go. You definitely need double jump. Well, dash, I think, for that. The problem with Brave Fencer, like, I have a copy, doesn't have manual. So I need to find a manual. For the manual alone goes for like 40 bucks. I'm like, crap! I need a complete copy of it. Oh, okay, you definitely need dash for that. Yeah, Parasite, Parasite 2. I don't have, I have both. I haven't played them yet. Because I just want to be in the right mindset when you're going to go play like a PS1 graphic game. I'm surprised they haven't remade both of those. Okay, read all this. Ooh, give me that chalice. Increase the strength. Veredicto. Mystical damage. I don't know. I need to buy all these anyways. Go. Like, Parasite just felt like, oh, we need to make a- we need something to compete with Resident Evil. <laughs> oh, jeez, there's another one! Took my lightning. 
Wasn't there a path up here to go to the sewers? Okay, that took a while. Uh, yeah, it's right here. Right? Yeah. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, that's a shop. Okay. I was going to put the little person icon. Rat skull, don't really care about that. What do else do I need to do? I can't go this way until I get the climbing passive. Don't know what that roadblock is. What do I want to do? I can do that for an upgrade, but I might as well wait until I have two. I think I'll just go fight a boss. It's been a while since I did a boss. And Mega Man Legends is actually the only franchise of Mega Man or variation I haven't bothered. I haven't bothered to play. The whole, the look, the 3D aspect, I just, it didn't wow me. I've probably played every other Mega Man game, but I just don't like the look of that one. And I can't make that yet. And there's a cherub up there. Mark it. There we go. It's just like, oh, he doesn't wear his helmet. And <laughs> just everything at face value, like when it came out on an N64, I was like, oh, it's Mega Man. He doesn't have his helmet and it's 3D and there's no robot masters. I'm just like, okay. <laughs> You know, just well, you, a game you look at and you're like, yeah, I'm not going to play that. <laughs> How many marks do I got? Two. Okay. Uh, I'm going to go up here. What am I forgetting? Make that. One item. Oh, it was worth coming for this. Gonna mark it. Get a few upgrades. Oh, there's a cherub. Is this one of the ones I never found? No, I, I would have found that. I'll mark it. I'll check in my first file later. No, I recently just marathoned all... Well, I had the Mega Man uh, Zero collection on Switch. And I played all the Mega Man Zeros. So I was like, wow, these are good games. And that's an example of a really good collection, too. Like, everything's on the disc. Uh, wait, can I... No, I can't do that. The only thing I didn't like about that collection was there's the jukebox... You go in, you can play music on the main menu, but you can't choose music for like levels and stuff. That, it just felt like, I can go on YouTube for this. <laughs> Any game that does that, I'm just like, if there's a jukebox, let me choose the music for levels or menus or whatever. But don't just let me play music. I can just use YouTube for that. Only. Hi-Fi Rush, perfect no, example. You unlock a jukebox after you beat the game and you have to buy music. So you can just listen to it on a jukebox. Why not like choose the song and anytime I'm in the hideout, play that song. It resets every time you leave the hideout. Or choose what music plays on what level. It's just to bring me more chances. Put some effort in. <laughs> bring me Like Smash Smash since Brawl has been doing that with their jukebox, like choose the music. Uh Shen, I haven't played the Shen Moos. I know their history, and I know the recent, the most recent one came out, but I was waiting to, I don't know, I just, again, there's so many games out there, I just haven't had a chance to play them all. But I was like, oh, they're finally making Shenmue, and it's like, oh yeah, the story isn't over yet. I'm like, there's no way you're getting a fourth game. <laughs> okay, I had a major upgrade, I think I'm just gonna go fight a boss. Yeah, the boss is right here, I'm gonna go. Like Smash Bros, you can choose what song you want to play on what level. What's the percent chance of it choosing that song? You want to hear only this song in the main menu. Like, 
That's a perfect jukebox. And if you want to play the music, fine. If you don't have YouTube, go ahead. But every game that has a jukebox should offer that option. I don't want to just walk up and like, I want to listen to track seven, please. And it's, just, it's like, I prefer, let me play track three when I'm on this boss. Like, that's so much better. That was the only thing wrong with that collection. And then that Mega Man X collection comes out and only half the games are on the cartridge unless you need a code for. And that's an example of bad demo or a bad collection. What am I doing? I'm talking too much. I'm distracting myself. I need to go to the warp. Sorry, 3.30 in the morning. Ah, uh, I went too far. Oh wait, can I talk to the nuns? Can I upgrade anything yet? I found two. Three? Yes! I think I can warp back to the village with this, right? I think that's what you get. Yeah, okay. That works. Next upgrade's the good one. Okay, boss time. After how many hours? No, I did find a boss recently, actually. Oh, this is the exit. Okay, I have to go around. This boss isn't that bad. I would say the boss after this is a challenge. Actually, maybe not. Most of the bosses I understand now. Okay, here we go. I got better healing. I got more flasks. I should be okay. Her music's terrible. This is maybe the worst boss song in the game. Actually, you know what? I'm even saying that when one of the bosses glitch and didn't have any music and no audio, this song is still worse than just nothing. <laughs> I kind of forget what she does though. Whoa! Okay, don't touch her. Once the lightning kicks in, she's done. Aw, except I touched her. The parries! So fast, she's stuck in a blur. Aw, oh, man. Oh, this is new. Oh, what is this? Did she bug out and didn't do this the first time I fought her? Oh, jeez. Can I have time to heal? Yeah. No par- Oh, no parries. Ow! I have double jump. I can just attack her now. Oh, I have to crouch. There we go. She must have bugged out the first time I fought her. She never did that clone thing. And I killed her slowly the first time, too, with the sword. They lose so much HP once the lightning kicks in. It's so good. And then just skip all this. Just skip that. It has to be the ma the the child doing that narration there. It's either the child or the one-winged guy in the cage, 
or the glass. I don't know what you want to call it. There she is. She's going to have the cool exit again, too. Let's see. 3.30 in the morning. Two of the bosses done. Probably go up to when I get to the doves. I might call it quits. Okay, ready? Here she goes. Oh, so cool. Doesn't even look like it fits the world of Blasphemous. Uh, I need to go up and to the left. Whoa, that did so much damage to both of them. Don't fall in the hole. You want to go around the hole. Okay, here it is. I don't know what's in here. Oh, another trap room. Okay. These felt very rare in the first game. In this game, there seemed to be like every, like two in every area. Oh, I'm using the sword. That was an accident. Of course, I could use the sword for these guys, but oh, geez, they are almost killing me. One big guy. No. The lightning! It didn't chain lightning though, probably his shield kicked in, that's why. The alchemist! Oh, about over half- wow, lightning is so good. Uh, what can I do here? What do I want to do? I can probably- no. There's no point exploring until I have all mobility. I can probably just go to the next boss. I'm already nearby. Oh, so... No. Wait, what? It's a one-way? You even gain lightning for the dash attack, too. One shot. I don't want to lose my lightning. What else am I forgetting? I feel like I'm not exploring as much because I'm kind of just like, go, go, go. But at the same time, it's like, I can always come back. As long as I mark everything like I'm doing, I should be fine. Cherubs, I don't think I've seen a cherub I haven't, I couldn't reach yet. And I think I get, I don't get dash yet. I think I get dash when I'm looking for the the ghost boss, the ghost girl. I think you get dash attack during that fight. And I'm gonna I'm gonna two shot most stuff here. This I think this is my favorite song in the game. Uh, I want to go. There's a cherub there. I can get that one. And then loops around after. Yeah. Okay. That barely dented him. No! Why'd you touch that? I got no healing now. At the rate I'm going, I can probably get to the end of the game, like the point of no return, by like tomorrow, if I stream tomorrow. Oh, I still got hit. 100% wise, I probably would need to like two more sessions. Because I'm going pretty fast story wise. Oh, I love this spell. I have not been casting spells at all. I wasn't casting spells at all during that boss fight. Oh no!
There's a cherub to the left! No! Okay. Ch cherub and a healing point. There we go. Almost died. I thought colliding with him was going to be enough to kill me. I'll probably break half of the cherubs before the end of the night. Oh, did I put a roadblock here? I don't need this. Don't need that either. Okay. Good to go. I don't need... Look how easy it is with a double jump. Don't have to worry about all those platforms at all. Like, just, just fly. Just fly through this area. Ooh, it was enough. Okay, I can do this now, too. Uh, this is the one that needs to be up. Actually, no, I'm doing this wrong. Uh... Little wrong. With double jump, you can just make this so easy. No, go down. Then bust open a path. Oh, right, and then you have to... S I forgot it's a time challenge. There. Double jump makes that completely worthless. Mark it with the green. Good to go. I'm probably not even using the daggers to their full extent, because you can, like, proc the lightning bur burst and then just do tons of damage. Probably when I get to three marks, I can start doing that. I'll put a roadblock here. There's a cherub. Yeah. Mark it with the map. A little skeleton. Not going this way. I need to go that way, and I can't do it, so put a roadblock there. Okay, uh, loop back, and go up and fight a boss. And that'll be the first act of the game done, basically. If I can get to the ghost boss, I could probably do that tonight. I might be able to get to the water temple. I'll call it water temple. I don't know what else to call it. But I can probably get to the water temple tonight. And you got nothing for me. I'll buy you out. Just so I'll show up the next spot. Dash attack can kill? That was not even with lightning. And the chain lightning just... Wait, where'd my lightning go? I didn't take a hit. Oh, I did. I don't know who killed... Well, I don't know what hit me. Uh, I'll go up. And just don't have to wait for platforms anymore. This is the wrong way. The parries! That was probably enough to kill him one shot if he had full health. Okay, I wasn't even on the floor in an attack. Go. 
Okay, I thought that would kill him. I thought that thing's enough to kill. It clearly is not. Uh, I need this all the way to the bottom. I don't even have to do this, actually. I can skip it. I, I can, I'm pretty sure. I've skipped this before. I know I have. I've done it. I know I have. I'm doing it out of spite at this point. There, I told you you can do it. I'll still bust open the path. Oh, but I can't do this. Um. Okay. <laughs> Gonna save some time. There. Wait, no, that doesn't work. Yeah, okay, I didn't do long. Up you go. There. Activate elevator. Okay, here comes a boss. Is what's her name gonna be here? No, I don't think she shows up to every boss. This boss is fun. Second phase. Once the second phase starts. I already forget what his attacks are. I know he shoots fire everywhere. Wait, if he uses fire, let's let's fix this. There. Let's have anything better. Okay. Scorch Lily. Just wait till I get the lightning going. Whoa! Oh. Oh, I forgot. Look at that lightning! Ow. It was basic attack he's got. Almost dead. Okay, second phase. You shoot your own spikes at her. Wow, that fourth hit does a lot of damage. Throw your own spikes. Oh, jeez. Oh, my lightning! It still hurts her. Holy crap! This is the best part. Of course, unless I take a hit for free. Oh, I completely forgot about that attack. You didn't even get to do that last one. Oh, crap. Heal up. Take her out. She's the bigger threat. Heal up. I'm gonna heal. Wrong guy. One, okay. Oh, look at that damage. Whoa, invaded the whole thing. So much damage. There we go. A little iffy there on the healing. I didn't know I healed that much. That's a fun boss once you get to the second phase. That's the first fun boss, I think. Oh, right, the portrait. I was like, what is his death? There's the one-winged guy. It's almost four in the morning. What do I want to do?
Maybe go until the next upgrade, maybe? The full, the three right, I wanted now. to stop when I got to the doves. That's what I was gonna do. Big drop. And then it tells you where you gotta go. I guess I'll finish this area. There's the music. I was gonna- I was worried the music was gonna, gonna glitch out again. I need to heal up. Half health, okay. Oh wait, turn that off. I thought I was gonna get hit from me doing the final hit. There's so much recovery on that hit. You couldn't grab that? Come on. Yeah, going down. Cherub wise, I'm one away from being halfway. Technically two. Might be a cherub at the bottom of this, who knows. Map-wise, how much have I done the game? Already 53. So, 53% of the done map in three and a half hours. That's just a- that's a- I think that's a mark. Pick whatever this is. Unfinished- okay. Uh, yeah, there's a few things I can't do here right now, that's fine. I'll have to come back anyways when the castle's intact. Uh, I don't remember what this is. Oh, that's just... What is this? Elevated temples. Roadblock, can't do that, can't do that. It might be worth... Just taking the warp back. Which way's fastest? Up. Now, once I get dash, sky's the limit. Once I get the ability to grab the rings, that at least finishes off exploration upgrades that I need. But I feel that's not as important as the rest. Like once I can dash, I can do, I can do anything. Rings are just allowing me to 100% the game. I didn't know I was going Oh, wait, I can just use the save point. That's right. There. And marks. Sitting on four. I have one. I can't buy. Oh, no, it broke. Yeah, I gotta go fix that. I'll fix that before this session's over. I don't know how many times it has to break, but... Gotta take care of it. Oh, you got some stuff for me? Oh, just one? Okay. Okay, start climbing. There wasn't much on the edges here. Unless that changes. Like, maybe I missed an item. Like, right there! Okay! That is definitely a chair I missed. Oh, and there's something else! Okay, mark that. Uh, I fell a bit. I'll put it here. Secrets all over here! Oh, cash? 800 bucks, that's it? There's gotta be something on the left. Is it all on the right? Quick drop, just in case? No.
Elevated tank. Yeah, this is a whole dungeon. Oh, this is where they multiply. These are the guys that multiply if you don't kill them fast enough. And he's multiplying. I feel like I'm missing so many items since my first run. Oh, this, okay. Didn't know I was in this area. Yeah, I feel like I'm missing like two items and two upgrades. <laughs> Somehow that didn't hit. The demented one. Put it on the map. So my idea with marking everything with green is that if it gets to that point where I need to look up a map for like a missing item or two, I can just compare like where it is on the map. If it's a green dot, I got it because it's never like two items in one area. You know, because looking for items in this game it gets to become like a needle on a haystack. The parries! Half health. That's okay. I don't think I ever grabbed that. Yeah, I don't think I did. I don't know if I'm in over a pit or not. He's gonna multiply! There we go. Oh, I need sword. Blammo! I'm in. I'm gonna mark this, actually. I'm gonna make it blue to indicate I don't have it. Of every enemy in the game, I think that is the most, for like mid late game enemy, it's too primitive. Just like, here it comes. <laughs> Like, this thing at least has two two dashes. That did no damage! For using one of my marks? That did nothing! That did some damage. For using a mark, that was worth it. Trap room. Almost dead. Oh, you have to it use the mark even on a whiff. That's no good. I need to them to come to me. Oh no, my lightning. Oh, man. Okay, heal up. I didn't want to take a hit. I thought I could get under in time. Okay, I'm gonna go down first. Get everything I can done. I, I can, I guess I could leave him alive, but... There we go. Oh no! Oh, it's a purple one, okay. Oh, get away from him. The, oh, jeez. Burn him! There we go. I thought it was the red one. I don't think the red one shows up till like the end of the game. Oh, he got me. Oh, okay, get out, heal up. I don't really need this, but for the sake of 100% completion, just grab it and go. I don't think I'll need a third playthrough. 
Like, I can probably just have enough marks by the end to just cash them all into the mace and be done with it. I do have to kill 300 enemies with it. Can I knock him off? I want to try. No, I think he's stuck. I have to kill 300 enemies with the mace, but I can probably just farm that in, like, a starting area. I know how to get that now. Might as well just mark it on the map. I'm getting so many collectibles now. Okay, mark it. With green. And this... That's just a shortcut. I don't even need her. Throughout the whole game, I don't even need that shortcut in the end. That's just for finishing the map. One chair. Did I ever get this one? I had to, uh. That one's so basic. And this connects to the main room. Yeah, I don't need to go there. Is that half the cherubs? That's over half. 70, yeah, that's half. Okay, half the cherubs in under four hours. Over 50% of the map in under four hours. That's how short this game is. But also because of how powerful these daggers are. Like, this should be, like, lightning should be an end game reward using this. This is... They're too powerful for the first point you can put into them. Am I going the right way? Yep. Oh, I got hit. Bounce, bounce. And attack in the face gives you crits, and then bounce, 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 and he's dead. That's why I knew, like, I knew the daggers make those guys so easy because of the bounce mechanic. Heal up. Half health for one mark. Is that worth it? Getting two targets, that's worth it. That was definitely worth it. Aw, oh, my lightning. Bounce, bounce. Just blows up. That is not worth it. That was a waste. Is there a boss before you get to the, the coffin? I don't remember. Oh, my face! Too much health. Ow. I'm in a bad state here. Especially with no lightning. Oh, no! Huh! Burn him! That was a bad idea. For some reason, I thought that would kill him before he cast the spell. How far back am I? Ugh, that's... That's a ways. I finished the arena, that's what mattered. I know there's gonna be another one. Actually, the next arena has the doll men. So that's annoying. I could just jump over him. Chain lightning! He's dead, okay. Bounce. Oh, he got my lightning! Make it back easily. <laughs> Just blows up. Oh, right. They swing twice. They swing twice! 
<sighs> okay. Ugh. Just need my soul first. You can't cast fire in time before he... I have to go underneath him if I want to do that. But I have lightning now, so... There we go. Much better. Got my soul back. Is this how I get to that one room? It is! Okay, what is this? That's the knot I was missing. I definitely didn't pick that up in my first playthrough. I can mark that as green now. Uh, that, that can stay. They, even with lightning, they always have that one HP left. You again? Even with lightning, it takes forever to kill these guys. It's worth, maybe not even worth fighting, just leave. Just leave them. That's the warp. I think there's another fight room coming up. Oh, okay. Oh, can I get back up though? Oh, I got the shortcuts. And a heal. I was st oh, okay, yeah. This is where the doll guy shows up. No, this is where the first red doll shows up that can shoot the red balls at you. This is a dangerous fight coming up. See how good the daggers are versus them, though. I know how to deal with them now, but it's still annoying. There's a cherub. Mark it. Now I'm halfway. That deals no damage. Is there a benefit to doing it? What's the point of it? Press our mid to form a quick cross to slash with both damaging nearby. Okay, it's just an AoE, I guess. It's not good. Barely any damage. Compared to the final thrust there. It's not worth at all. Whoa! I lost my lightning! There, lightning plus the... Getting it on the final hit is pretty cool. Uh, what am I missing here? Oh, okay. I never did this, I think, actually. Put a roadblock there. Oh, I gotta break everything here. This is just a shortcut, though. Gotta take the long way, the whole whole way, basically. No shortcut. This is all to break the floor, basically, for one item, I think. Oh, there's the shortcut. Never picked it up. There. Oh, okay. Snuff out of life. Another arena to do. I maybe maybe I'll do those before the end of the session. Get a few upgrades. Okay, this is the annoying room. Once the puppet man shows up. Oh, so good. 
Chain lightning. He still multiplied, and I lost my lightning. Wait, no, it's it's the next one with the puppet man. Get out of the middle. You don't have my dash either. Chain lightning. So good. Oh, you can do it off the mirrors too. Oh, it's so good. Whoa, dodge that. There he is. I don't know why it didn't get to the other side. Okay, cast the spell, get to the other side. He'll cancel it. Then he does that. There, that's how you get, deal with them. If you get behind him, no bot doesn't bother with the spell. Top priority fighting him. That's so junk. Oh, I didn't dash. I don't have dash. It is not worth doing the cross slash. It is junk. Unless I'm using it wrong, but I really don't think so. It's just bare bones damage. Okay, turn away. Fine. I don't know how I didn't get hit by that fire. Just explore the rest before I start the next mission. Okay, keep checking this row first. I don't know where this is taking me. Okay, now I remember. There's a cherub right there. I can get that one on the way back. It's not much damage. Like until I get the level three daggers, I think the deck I think the damage is falling off on them. I'm not killing things like in one combo like I was before. I can't reach this still, can I? No, I need dash. Okay, mark it. Mark the cherub. We gotta come back. Did I have, no, I didn't have double dash before this. And put a roadblock here, I guess. And I guess Roblox here. Just because you need. Well, if I get dash, I'm, I guess that's not Roblox. I'll do have to come back here, anyways. I don't think I can reach this right now. Right? Is there another one? No. Okay, I can. I can do this. I don't think it I don't think it matters. I don't think it leads takes me anywhere in special. Yeah, it all connects. Okay, just start the quest. Got the key. I think I have to go into the dream state again. Yep, okay. We can skip all this dialogue though, with how much rep repetitive dialogue happens in this room. We still have to watch the dove escape though. The mirror never will make oh. cast. Dove. There it goes. <laughs> like, so anticlimactic. 
I have no idea where that is, actually. I can't remember. It's not the, uh... It's not the water temple. First dove. I didn't earn that dove at all. I deserve... I should have a boss before that. Uh... Yeah, and then you go through here. Yeah, I remember. That's where you get double dash. Or, you get dash. Air dash. Everything else is pretty much done. A lot of... A lot of here I can't do. Uh, that's just connect this area. There's a few things I can do. I have double jump now. I can go collect a few things. I can go get another nun, see if I can upgrade the nuns again. It's four in the morning. I really should get off. <laughs> There's so much to do. Yeah, just take the warp over. What do I have? I have a kiss, a knot, a vial. Yeah, I can get a lot of power. I can get a lot of upgrades right now. Maybe just cash everything in. Get get all the collectibles that I can with these up with these power-ups. Cash them in and then maybe call it quits. I got the dove. That's what I wanted to end on. And it's only been. Oh, you can't tell the time from this. It's only been four hours, based on the- actually, less than four hours. Three hours and fifty-seven minutes on my recording. I can take this off. I can put... that on. I can actually put two. Actually turn this one off. And there was a cherub here that I didn't grab? There we go. That... was that one I missed before? Maybe not. That one seems like a gimme if I actually looked around. Okay, this leads me to... a nun. Oh, jeez! Where am I? Okay, I need to go down. Oh, come on. Do it again. There. Heal up, because I lost a lot of HP on the way here. Yeah, she's whispering. There it is. I don't know how many that is. I think that's my fourth. Uh, market, market. That's an exit. Can't go that way. I can get whatever is down here. And then finish off the map. Yeah, I can finish this whole area. I might as well. Whoa! I can't go back to the start of the game, get those collectibles, because you need the rings. Or the cherub... The cherub rings. I don't know what you want to call it. But being able to summon cherubs. That's the ability I'm thinking of. Secret here? No. And just keep going down. Down, I said. Might not even be worth coming here. Should have been worth. Might want to come back when I had double that. When I had dash. Air dash. Ooh, one shot. Secret? Oh, it is. Lullaby. Mark that off. Maybe I didn't collect that one before. Uh, keep going right. Another chalice. Okay, I'm going to get so many upgrades when I go to the chalice, lady. Mark that off.
all the way down. No spikes, okay. Oh, there's a bunch of stuff I can do here. This is all related to the sword. Oh, I can't do everything though. Oh, it's just for cash. I guess that's not worth it. Fireball. And mark that off. I don't think I need to come back for just cash. Oh, I never did this room? Really? Okay, don't don't touch it, I guess. Oh, I'm way too far back. I, like, don't even bother with the guilt at 26%. Uh, I didn't do everything. I did a lot, actually. But I have to I have to get that for 100 percent completion. So uh, I'll put a roadblock for now. No point. You can't go this way yet. I didn't collect everything here, and that's fine. You need you need air dash for that. Uh what can I do? Probably a lot I can do. Unfinished lullaby, fervent kiss, knot, chalices, two knots, wax seed. Yeah. I got a good chunk done. 62% of the map. And I can get air dash when I go this way. And a lot of roadblocks. A little bit of finish there. Yeah. Is there any obvious things I can double jump and get? I'm just... That. That's the only thing I can think of. But I, well, I have to go back anyways later. Uh, There's a person there? That had to be a cherub. That's a mistake. I have to also build up my guilt because I have to cash the guilt out to get an upgrade or get an item. That had to have been a mistake. Yeah, that was a cherub there. I think, yeah, that should have been a cherub. Let's see if I can do this now. Yeah, build up my guilt, cash it out, build up the flowers, and see what happens when the flowers max out. I think I did everything here, didn't I? Yep, that's done. So turn that off. I can do this. Think. Yep, I can break the floor. Okay. Break like three layers. There, I'm in. It's just for ca it's cash or a mark. That's it. I can't even do all of this. It's a dead. Oh, it's not a dead end. Oh, my lightning. Where does this take me? Look at that lightning fly. Oh man, my lightning. There. Oh, okay, I know where I am. I guess it was worth coming here. Okay, break that. Break this. What? It's right on it. I don't know what's over here. Oh, while I'm here, I might as well go talk to the, the honey man and upgrade my... my one statue and fix it. Oh, got him a half health. Okay. It was totally worth it. And I guess chain lightning only works when it's uh, full charge. Oh, don't waste on these guys. 
They're two shots. Hey, I got the oil. Uh, let's mark it. We got one there, one there. Ah, uh, no, I know I'm coming back this way, so there's no point. I think there's even a nun that I can get if I come back. Lightning kicks it now after they're already dead. Half health. Yeah, never. Don't even bother playing sword in this game. Just go daggers. You're gonna have a much more fun time. Okay, what do I need to do? I need to give them items. Probably get a few slots open for this. Much time. You must more Just cash out. The she, he keeps fell. talking, but it's fine. Give him the tool. Let him keep talking. Luke, how's it going? This is Blasphemous 2. The file, no. If you heard of Blasphemous 1 with how, like, all the pixel art about it. Behold these beautiful oil paintings. Know that you have my gratitude. I gotta cash this out. Oh, actually, I need to fix this. First, I need to sneeze, though. No, this feeling went away. Uh, no, here it comes. No, make more slots. The altar here. That's only one slot, isn't it? Yeah, crap. Okay, I need more. Uh, stun power. Loss reduces variable that's lost. That's actually slap that on. That's that's really good. I need to fix this. Okay, that's all good. Don't I need the oil for something, though? I feel like I'm forgetting something. Uh, I'm gonna reload. I didn't save, so... Yeah, it's only been three hours and five minutes, 50 minutes. It's only been four hours on the stream? Yeah. Yeah, I don't think I want to give him the oil. You need that for something else. Unless I'm thinking of a different Much item. Time you must know more than a fall. The remnant never could. Okay, don't hand the tool. No, I want increase master. Or increase the pieces. Open this. Here. Slap on that one. There. May the now I'll have lightning 24-7, I think. <laughs> But yeah, Luke, this is the game that, well, this is the sequel to the game that got famous for the pixel art of its enemies and cinematics. Because it's all done with, like, gothic art style. Okay, cash in all this stuff. No. I can suit myself up before the next boss. Bring me. Now. There we go. I shall wait. Bring me. I could do the arenas now too. Get two arenas done. Give get even more upgrades before I start my next session. I don't know what my next session will be. I'm thinking. Can I get that now? Maybe. I'm thinking Tuesday is when I'm going to be able to stream again. Might use tomorrow just to take care of a few things. Uh, can I reach that? I don't think so. Yeah, no, I need... Double dash. Can I buy anything off her? You put. A lot of statues. So many statues. Uh... I buy a mark. I don't think I need a mark from her. Just buy her out. There we go. Here among Two marks left. I don't even need them. 
Where do I need to go now? What items do I have? Two knots and a kiss. Yeah, okay. Skull of the Elder. What's this for? Oh, okay. I know which one that is. Uh, Cloth of the Old Woman. I have both. No, I need to go and get more upgrades. So, cash in the knots and get the... Uh, cash in the knots, get all my beads, take the beads. Well, no. There's so much I can do here. Cash in the knots, get more slots, put the beads on for more power, go give my kiss to get more mana, then go to the arena and then just blow through those. Do you have rope now? And actually, I found all the knots now. So I missed that one. That was the one I was missing in the first playthrough. Your rosary. Okay, give the next one. Do you have rope now? I'll get an achievement for all knots, and I can see what happens with her when she gets them all. Your rosary is now complete, penitent one. When you feel there's the achievement, and the sky bears no stars, press your rosary close to your breast. It will bring you comfort. Oh, she doesn't say anything else. When you feel, yeah, she's tapped out. Okay, uh, that's all the slots then. What do I want to do here? Increase... Who am I fighting next? I think Mystical will work... Not Lightning. Mystical is probably the best thing for her. I don't need Flames. I don't think I need Flames for the rest of the game. Probably two Lightning. I don't have increased Defense, do I? No. Okay. Okay. Cash in my Kiss. Get more mana. And I think the arenas, I get one chalice and one flask. I think that was, I think that's the first two rewards. I think one reward is a, a statue and that's, that's worthless to me. But with my uh, lightning blades, I should be able to just mow through these enemies. The first waves, at least. May those who... <laughs> yeah, I only got two. Miracle penitent, find my only... May the bell... I didn't know it was her daughters. And I thought we, we were killing her sisters. Okay, yeah, I gotta build up. Oh, my lightning! No! The lightning's not working! I'll get it off urns, I guess. Yeah, these first waves are not the greatest. If it's is it just gonna be all aerial? I think there's one one big enemy. The parries built my light. An owl lady, really? There's one big guy at the end. There it is. I don't even think this is the last big. Chain lightning. There we go. Half health. That was good. Oh, there's more. That was enough to kill? Yeah, chain lightly is only when you have full stacks. It's not just one. Oh, you get a statue now? Crap. The next one's a flask. I thought it was one flask and one chalice. And I hate how it boots you out. I wish I could just do the next arena now. Okay, it's 4.30 in the morning. Wrap this up. I'll get this chalice, cash it out. And then just do the next boss next session. May the I did half the game, basically, tonight. 
We can actually check on the main map, it, on the main menu, it says your completion of the game. I think I definitely, I think I got half the game done. Oh, I start with my lightning too. Oh, it's got two hits. That's where all the damage is. Dash, got him. Don't multiply. Don't, okay, good. Don't multiply. Why is he taking so much? These ones have increased defense. They have to. Oh, crap. Okay. Not the best time, especially with this guy showing up. And little guys! Okay, take them all out. Is that it? No. Build up lightning. For this guy. Doesn't have a chance. No, yes he does. If he hits me once, I'm dead. Okay, heal up. Done. Blades are too good. Luke, thanks. I do my best. Especially at 5 and the 4.30 in the morning. I actually thought I no I no I didn't I I was like I, had to, I thought I would be done the game I'm like no I didn't this game's longer than that first playthrough took me about ten hours so I'll probably have this done eight I'm thinking eight uh what did I get on chalice right what did I get I didn't pay attention was it a mark I think it was a mark. Crap, I didn't pay attention. Spell? No. It was a statue or a mark, one or the other. I need the next level. Uh, what do I want to do now? I can't go this way, that's a dead end. I can't do that, you need dash for that. I think I'm done for the night. The next area I have to go is up here. You enter here, you climb all the way up. Really cool boss fight. But you can't 100% it because you need one ability here to get this area done. So once I get air dash, I can do all of this. I can probably just do a victory lap through here, 100% it, and do this. But I think you get the air dash up here. Yeah, and then with air dash, I can do pretty much everything else. No, I can't do everything. But I can at least get the map done, I think. But I really thought I was going to get a chalice off killing that. Or did I pick this up? I don't really, I, I didn't pay attention. Okay, I'm going back to town. Let's fix my... No! Wait! I need... I know, I forgot to fix my... Where is it? Uh... Is it here? I think this is where he lives. <sighs> How do I want to do this? I have to get there. There's no warps around him. The best option is to wait until I hit the upgrade to teleport between save points and then just walk over. But I don't think I have enough. I, no, there's no, there's no way I have enough. I think I'm good. I think I'm just gonna wait. I think you need six sisters to get the upgrade, and I think I only have four. Is there anything else I can do right now? This area is done. Collected all that. Got so many collectibles in this region. I didn't do everything here, but you need air dash for it, so there's no point. This is basically end game. No point doing that. Air dash, halo. Well, I guess cherubs is what you want to call that. I didn't collect that. One. I couldn't. Yeah, this is all air dash. I need air dash. For, I need the tribute for that coin and I can go somewhere else. This will take me 
all the way here. And that'll take me to one sister and one upgrade. So yeah, there's not much else I can do side stuff right now. I have to commit. Can't go that way either. Yeah. At this point, it's just get to point A, go to point B, then point C. Once I get air dash, I think I can collect a lot of stuff. So yeah, I think I'll call it quits there. I got a lot done. I got my daggers. They're amazing. I have the dash attack. I have an aerial with them, but it's not that great in my opinion. It doesn't deal that much. It does almost no damage for some reason. Uh, okay. I need... Got the oil. I have this new spell. I didn't get the spell the first playthrough till the end. Where am I going? Where was I... Where was... What was I doing? Work my oil. Okay, we're going up to like maybe the most fun boss in the game. I can't warp there, unfortunately, so I'm going to have to use the warp normally and then... I can't warp through save points right now. So I got to do this manually. And I, oh, and I still have to, oh, I didn't have to go in, but I have to also corrupt myself to talk to this guy. So I'll probably have to just force myself to die a few times to fill that gauge up. I got my double jump. I remember how to parry. So yeah, things like this. I need to get this ability and then I'll be able to just go bing, bang, boom through a lot of objectives or collectibles, I should say. Uh, gotta warp all the way. Might have to turn it down my end, it's kind of loud. Like, that bell alone was pretty loud. And already going the wrong way, great start. I don't have aerial dash yet, no. But yeah, I can use these guys to remember how to play. Remember how powerful the daggers are. I got double jump so I can skip all this. Oh, does he have anything for me? Cast your eyes upon our... Uh, one item, but I can't afford then, it. What a I do need that spell to get one cherub later. Like when we go to like the water temple, whatever you want to call it. I, I consider it a water temple. Actually, we do get double jump. We get the air dash here because there's a lot of dashing that needs to happen in the next boss anyways. Is there a secret here? Nope, okay. Okay, I got the lightning going. Yeah, okay, you need air dash here. Oh, did get the parry. So I gotta build it all up. Get that lightning going for real damage. I forget where you get the... Do you just get it here? No? Okay, just keep going. That is the next objective, though. Can I get any of this? Oh no! I killed! I killed with the non-daggers. I think you get it here. Here it is. Now we're just going to be flying all over the place. Mercy of the wind. Okay, we know all this. Good to go. And there's going to be a few paths I can bl open up with this too. Especially in like the forest. There was a lot of chains to get through there. But I don't want to go all the way yet. There's a few things I can do here. Or at least open up the map. Or not. Okay. Uh, okay, I can take this one off. I could go up and just do all of this. Yes, there is a chair I can get with this, actually. Or I think I already got this one. Yeah, that chair is gone, but I can get the dash of the wall here. Get a few upgrades before going to the, uh, the tower. Okay, kill another sister. Or daughter. I forget if they're sisters or daughters. But now I can zip around this whole map. You basically have like double dash to run around now. Like that. It's so effective. Okay, there's a few things I have to do here. Mainly just bust open some paths. 
But I just think like some of the abilities should be bound to the weapons. Like the air dash, it should be like you have to have daggers equipped, you kind of thing. Oh, wrong weapon! Crap. But like daggers give you air dash, sword gives you, I don't know, ground dash? I don't know. <laughs> Something like that. There we go. Because once the Penitent one has all this stuff, he's just he's just a powerhouse. Double jump and air dash just doesn't seem right with him. This was the upgrade I was thinking of hours ago in this run, too. I thought this upgrade was like way down here. Okay, I can take this one off. It's pretty much everything collected here. I will put a person here just to... I could put a skull because it's a dead person, but just to let me know like where I've been with an actual contact. But I think I'm good to go fight the next boss or at least get to that, do that whole tower. There's one room I can't get to and that's one of the candles you have to light anyways. How'd I get that? Oh, okay. That's how. A mark? 1200 bucks. Okay. There shouldn't be any enemies along the way for a bit. If I heal up, they will show up, but that's okay. I gotta get my lightning going. I can't if they hit me, though. Oh, yeah, I get that little extra hit, too. There, lightning's going. Now nothing can stop me. Okay, I think that's increased defense. Is that three points of defense? Oh, it's magic, okay. Probably want magic against this boss because her spike drill things hurt a lot. I think it counts as magic. It's definitely not lightning. There, made it. It's a trap. I got my lightning though. Oh, I lost my lightning. All is lost. There we go. I'll heal up off that. Oh wait, I do need to ring this twice, I believe. If I'm remembering it right. No, nope. there's one that's like, it's like a puzzle. You have to ring it twice, then run around fast. Wait, check this wall. Okay. Oh, I wanted to open the path. There we go. Hey, sometimes you have to get it right in the center. Or not. Okay, now I'm good. Okay, that's not enemy. These, this thing takes a while to die. I can let it build up some lightning with it. I don't think it chases. Yeah, there's another one anyways. Am I going the right way? No, this is the wrong way, and that's what I want. Because I want to collect every collectible. Lightning's going. Oh, he got away. Secrets? Nothing. Can he go through walls? Yes, he can. Yeah, so I can't go this way without the cherubs. So I might as well put a roadblock there. Yeah, I think this is where the, the one sister I needed to get them all. You have to come all the way back to kill one child. It's so easy to kill those with the daggers. Yeah, I think this is the one you have to ring twice. There. And there's the, I never have to do that again. Okay. I think I'm already at the boss, actually. 
Oh, I gotta check there. Now, once I do do this boss, you have to go up the elevator again because there is one cherub in the room that you kill her. This is a really good boss. Might change my uh, beads though. We don't have to listen to her talk. We've already done all this. But yeah, I will just this for the sake of magic. I'm pretty sure it's magic. I'm just going to put tons of magic. De there we go. That should be enough. But the plan is get lightning and then just lay into her. Oh yeah, she does the ghosts. Problem is if I get hit, I lose my lightning. Just two drills, yep. Ow! Yeah, I shouldn't try and fight those. Whoa! Oh, they came back. Still can't get lightning though. Again with the ghosts? Come on. Give me that sweet, sweet lightning. There we go. Again? Oh! Come on, I can't attack you! Chain lightning doesn't even stop those. I just want to use lightning. I have to play it safe. That was not safe at all. You don't even get lightning for those. There we go. Just wait it out. Oh, crap. Not doing great. Wait, no, you have to come this way. There we go. Uh, I can't get the hits off that I want. Come on, get that lightning. Oh. Like two more hits would have got me it. It's not enough. Especially when she's a mile away. More ghosts. Yikes. She's gonna cut the wire soon. Nope, the other side. Wait it out. There we go. Yikes. Okay. This part's okay. Now that I understand it from the first playthrough. <laughs> Oh, look at that damage. She should not have attacked it. Come back. One more, one more loop. Crap. Oh, no. Oh, so, so fun when the lightning gets going. I didn't know she can attack it that far away. I thought she had to go up to it. It was the perfect spot, though. It just... That was like half, not a half, maybe more than a quarter. Oh yeah, then we gotta watch the dove thing again. Well, after the dove, get to this chandelier elevator again. Go all the way up, one chair up at the top, grab that. Collect the one path that I didn't check, and then we can leave.
Never have to come back here again until I get the last passive ability. You can skip all the dialogue here. The miracle a symbol. Here comes the here goes the dove. Dove. <laughs> Gone. <laughs> Now we get to go to the water temple. Which I think is where you get the chair. No, you get the. I think you get the chair of ring ability at the, uh, the wax tower. I think. I don't remember. It's either water tower or the wax palace. Okay, so take this all the way up. I still have lightning. I don't need it. There it is. I think this is the 20th? What am I at? 20th, okay. 13 more. Mark it off on the map. Put a dead child there. Uh... I guess I can just take the elevator down. There's one path I need to take for one item. Wait, where am I? Oh, the map didn't update. Okay. I have to go all the way up for this path. And then never have to come back here again until I get that upgrade where I can teleport between save points. That's all I need just to make it faster. Yeah, I gotta climb the whole way. Hey, something did hit me there. I've done all this already. The parries! Oh, killed them both, okay. I didn't think it was gonna kill the one that attacked. Uh, keep going up, a little bit more. But yeah, there's just no point in... This is the room. There's just no point in exploring yet and fully exploring until I get that one passive. Oh, right, they're enemies. Okay, what'd I get? I'm feeling, okay, right, self do that. So I'll mark this off with green. I think I mi I don't know how many missing lullabies I had. I have to go up. Oops. I have to loop around this whole place again. Watch out for the spikes wherever though. There they are. Heal up just to be safe. I don't think I'll, I think I killed everything along the way anyways. Now the thing about there's a lot more just art in general in Blasphemous 1 compared to this. Like, a lot of these paintings are just covered up or this, they're the same one. I remember a lot more in, like, near the second half of Blasphemous. Okay, go down. Oh, right, enemies. <laughs> Did I kill all these on the way? Did I just run past them? I can even just travel to the city, actually. Travel to the city, take the elevator down, then work my way across. I have the dash. I can get this cherub now, actually. As well as... Actually, yeah, it's just that one. And then this little bit of the map. So, yeah, back to town. I'm not even going to bother giving items to people right now. I don't have any, like, big items like chalices or, uh, blades. And hopefully none of them are time sensitive, like you have to give them before X boss kind of thing. Keep going. There's a few things to do in that area, but I need uh, the cherub upgrade to grab hoops to do it. There we are. Uh, just for cash? Well, I guess a cherub. We're doing this for cherubs. There you go. 21. Turn him into a skeleton. There we go. Uh, 
Yeah, good to go. And now I can do the double dash. It makes it so much more easy to get across this stupid town. The only thing you could have done better is if you just give him like a, a run button and then give him the super super charge like Metroid. Uh, down left, yep. Keep going left. I'm missing a bit of fervor. I don't really care. I'm not using that many spells. I could have joined that boss because she does get out of range a bit. Okay, we can make this now. Yeah! Then we have to fight this one guy. Not yet, though. I think it's coming up. Fight these mermaid. Mermen. Zombie mermaids? I don't know. Okay. Maybe the audio will work this time. Oh, my lightning! Ow. It's, it's so good! I just love hearing that lightning impact start. I don't think he summons help until the actual boss fight, too. Lost half my fervor now. Crap! Big swing! I shouldn't be in the corner. There's the swing. Oh, I shouldn't have landed inside him, though. When's he gonna leave? There he goes. The music worked, but I don't think that's his boss music. Yeah, they take two shots with lightning. Four shots, full combo. Oh! Wow, okay, if that works... If I fight the boss and he summons four and I dash attack with lightning, that might just make them all one hit. Combine that with fire, I could just kill them all instantly. Okay. Can't reach it now, but... Oh, that spell works. Mark it off. I did not think that was going to work. I do not remember this guy here. The ancient never did I pray you cast your eye. Uh, I will take your cat magic. Until I don't need marks, right? Actually, do I? Do I need to upgrade anything? Oh, I'm still looking for level three of this. Okay. I'm going to be flying through enemies once I get level three daggers. If you think they're powerful now, just wait till you have three marks of lightning to work with. Oh, sh she still has so much defense even against daggers. Uh, I think I'm going a little too far. I feel like I'm forgetting a few paths here. This is a shortcut. This is the exit. This is also an exit. Okay, guess I was going the right way. Ink monsters only take one hit. That's good. And it attacks them in the water even. Daggers are too good. It's not even the day, it's the lightning. That's the key thing here. The daggers are nice, but once you get one proc of lightning going and the 
<laughs> night and day. Secrets? Nothing. Actually, I want to check something. Yeah, I didn't finish this area. I know something's up here. How did I do that dash right into attack? There, just farming lightning stacks off her. How am I doing that little... Oh, right, it takes a mark. Okay, that's how I did it. Dash attack isn't always the best thing because you lose your stacks. Or if you have a stack, don't do a dash attack, else you lose your stack. Secrets, nothing. Magic. Half health. That's, I don't want to go that way yet. First, just want to take care of everything. Yeah, I don't know if that's worth using. Once I have three marks, maybe. <laughs> I might just want to keep hot, keep lightning going as much as possible. Don't risk losing it. I don't know what this takes me to. Ooh, not the upgrade I want. I'm not going to use it. Did I miss the dagger? I don't think so. There's no way I missed the dagger upgrade. I definitely need it though. Uh, do I open the map if I go this way? I think so. I think this is the shortcut. Hey, a cherub. It was worth coming this way. There. And you get you get your health back with cherub. That to me is the biggest change in this game. That's gotta mean something for speedrunners. Just get a free heal. If you know where all the cherubs are. Like, hey, go ham on a boss to just heal up and go. This is a trap room, that's okay. Once I get the lightning going. Which is now. Now they're trapped in here with me. Okay, nope. Boy, oh, you still have it. Okay. Nope, we got a problem. Big problems. Now I'm trapped in here with them. Oh, that's a bad enemy to deal with in the corner. Okay, crap! I guess he hit me. <laughs> I didn't get the shortcut open either. Oh, I got a save point. Uh, I didn't open the shortcut. I'll work all the way back up. Oh, yes I did. Perfect. I'm back. I guess that poison guy hit me. There we go. And don't stand too close to this guy first. That's how I l took so much damage at the start. Yeah, this is the guy. Oh, he still got me. Okay, much better. Bounce off of him. Oh, I could have done... How do you do the cross slash? Oh, you need a mark. And there's a child. Okay. Is it with the cross slash? Yeah, okay. The marker's showing that it needs it. Oh, wait, mark this off. There we go. Uh, I guess I'm going back up. I don't think I need to collect cash right now. I'm not going to buy anything major for a bit. By the end of the game, I did need a little more cash to buy, like, the one item left in the shop. It wasn't a make or break for the run, though. Oh, he got me! 
Oh, now he gets stunned. Probably want to go back and heal. Bounce off of him. Can I just get over it? Yeah, there we go. I don't get the crits, but I get the lightning. In the end, lightning probably works better anyways. Oh, he did turn around eventually. Okay, don't get surrounded. You're getting surrounded. Go to the next room and heal. Roll back in though. Oh, you need the rings anyways. Okay, not much I can do here. Actually, where's the wall? Oh, it's coming from above. Okay. There we go. I am out of heals. That hit me twice somehow. Okay. Not a great state. Ah. Uh, I go down. I think that opens a shortcut. Problem is, in a, I'm in a very terrible situation. I got magic. That does, like, really no damage. Oh, good. Okay, should open a shortcut. If I die now, it's fine. That's a long way for a heal, though. Didn't I kill everything this way? Actually, it might be worth dying just so I can get more guilt going. I think I'm going to be at like 33 with this. Now I just cash it in. 50! Okay, that's... That's really good. I can come finish this whole area. If I get more deaths, great. And then, uh... Cash it all in at the priest. Since you probably get something for 100% of that thing. Gotta remember that this is not the shortcut yet. We go for the fish. Up and left. How'd the lightning wear off already? I just got it. Yeah, okay, made it. Oh, right, they last a long time. There she is. Okay, pick this. But you don't stun many things with daggers. I think that's the one problem with them. You get lucky to even see one in like an hour, I think. Unless level three changes everything. Oh, he still got me. Okay, can't go up. Put a roadblock here for now. Because we're going to need the little cherubs to get up there anyways. Okay, then just get over and then lay into him. There. This is coming out of the Wax Palace. And there's cherubs that rings up here, so I'm gonna roadblock that. I'll go right first, open shortcuts, just in case. Hey, wait, nothing came out of the first puddle. I shouldn't have done that, maybe. Boss is over there. I don't know if I want to do that, because I'm still doing some exploration. There's a little bit of backtracking when I have to do. I can do that before the boss, but I don't think going back just for one chalice is worth it. I 
Actually, with the fact I have the lightning surge, this boss might be a lot easier now because I can take out all the swordsmen or the spearmen before they even come near me. Oh, it still got me! Oh, okay, just there's a delay to that one. Yikes! Gotta keep my lightning. Uh I'm forgetting something. I feel like there should be more in this area. Warp. Open that, then you go down. Okay. Then you loop out both ways. Okay. Whoa! Yeah, so you open up the basement, circle around to the Wax Palace, then you can cut through both exits. Now, if it does glitch out and I don't get the audio, I'm gonna close the game and turn it back on. If I get no audio again. Okay, there's audio. He's already starting with lightning? Okay, bad state for me. Maybe not, just build up lightning now. Oh no, my lightning! Got a crit. Ow, my face. The big swing. One. Oh, he got me. He got one, got me too. I should not have healed there. That was a terrible hit. More? Oh. A little defense spell. Where is he? Oh, he's still over there. Oh, right. There's two loops. More little guys. The big swing. Aw, the little swing. That's so much damage. <laughs> oh no! I'm out of heals! Whoa! Nope. Oh, jeez. Yeah, that was bad. It was a good first try. I got to hear his theme now. So, uh, win, win, lose. But, I'm gaining that gauge. 52%. Okay. Make it as hard as possible just so I can pay off all that stuff. But now that I remember what he can do, it should be fine. Plus he didn't start with lightning this time. Ow! Oh, that reached. Whoa, that didn't hit me. That hit me. Big swing.
I should not have stood on this side when he's bringing little allies over. Oh! Oh, I thought that looked so good. Why am I always near him? Oh, jeez. All oh, the little guys. That was a good hit. Oh! <laughs> Spikes everywhere! Oh, that's the wrong spell! I'm in a bad place. Heal. Oh, okay. Oh, jeez. Now I'm in a bad spot. Terrible. Oh, they do have a limit. Didn't know that. He's walking over. Oh, you can't even hit him when he's in amongst them. Oh, he was alive still. I thought I could just lay into him before he jumped, and I thought the little guy died. So I should be at 54? 50, okay, you get like 2% per death. Just farm it up. Oh, jeez, the big swing! Oh, there was half my health. Okay, that was, that was dumb. I should parry that actually. Get a few extra hits on them. Or not. Whoa! Actually, one more hit, I'm dead. And that was a waste of a heal. Whoa! Oh, you can parry it. Actually, I'm in a terrible state now. Ooh, that was that was nice. I got a crit off. Big swing with water. Okay, good heal. He's coming. That didn't kill? Oh jeez, he's coming. What killed the other guys? Oh, jeez. Yeah, that's how you get rid of them. Line them up and just let the lightning do the work. Big swing. Big swing? Nope. The lightning gets, still gets through. No, what the? Okay. They just have high defense. What have I done?
I could have finished it. Oh, there we go. That's a very anticlimactic death compared to some other ones. Really, it looked like he could have survived that. Got the key. Cash in all this skill. It is worth going back to town just for that. Like it's spring. Let this all play out again. Duff. Then he prays and leaves. Yeah, so go to the Wax Palace, get the Cherub upgrade, immediately go back to the start of the game, and then just start 100% of the map. Well, every region we can reach. We still can't finish it, but at least get it all wrapped up every other area. Oh, and there's a whole world down here, too. It all connects. I do want to go back to town. Look for any secrets. I guess I still have to watch out for stuff in the air. Actually, I'm wondering if I can even finish this region. There's the little shrine I can take care of. I'm just wondering if there's any... Okay, well, get that first. Just wondering if there's anything I can't do here, unless I come from the other side. That was a good way to stay in the air. Compass? Does the compass... No, I'm thinking the bell that tells you where secrets are. Oh, I could have made things a little easier by not having magic defense here. Uh, okay, slap that on. Miasma, who am I going to next? There is some Miasma, but I think it's fire damage I'm going to be dealing with the most next. So forget magic, just go fire. Because there's like the, the, the slug priest, priests that shoot fire, the heartburn guys that shoot fire. All around, just a lot of fire coming up. Even the boss, but the boss isn't that big of a threat, I'd say. Wait a minute. I feel like I shouldn't come from this direction. Oh no! I'm worried that if I break it up, I heard like an earthquake, and I'm worried that's going to affect the uh, shrine that I'm trying to get to. Even if she dies, though, I think you just collect her head and then bring it to the palace. Or the shrine. Collect everything around here. Actually, I forgot to mark items. Crap. No, nope, that's green. There's an item over here that I forgot. I think it's here. Yeah. I think it's only those two that I forgot. I, I, I don't need to go back yet. Get a few more items that I might can use for upgrades. Yeah, unless I die. But if that's the case, then I fill up more of the guilt. So it's not a bad thing. Take out the bat. It's just cat. Oh, it's a mark. Okay.
I don't even think I need to mark down the map. Oh, I thought I could reach the other side. Stuff like cash and marks, I'm not gonna mark. It's not needed. Luckily, there's no achievement for finding all 40 marks or collecting 40, because then you have to grind some of them. Take this guy out for the sake of secrets. Beautiful. Okay. I can't do that yet. I need to activate this. And then quickly run back. It's for a spell. Usually those are what's in those. Why did I double jump so early? Crap. Hurry up. There we go. Pillager. Oh yeah, that's why I need marks. I need to get more statue slots. It's the only need, the only need right now. Oh, kill the bat. Forget the crits, just go for the lightning. Safer. The shrine is right over here, I think. There you are. Stop. My name, the miracle. Blah blah blah. I'm too big. This is my penitent. Penitent. Penance. Blah blah blah. <laughs> Holds it up. Please find the shrine. Penitent one. Each. I know where it is. Isn't there a path like right around here? Unless it's a one way. Yeah, it could be a one way. Doesn't even show up on the map. Okay. I know where it is. I'll get it eventually. I think you have to go through the wax area. Even if I do, I'll look loop around. And hopefully I find a save point. There we go. Perfect timing. Okay, there's the Wax Palace. Not going there yet. I'm gonna just stay in the air in case of cherubs. Nope. Okay, yeah, this is where all the fire starts. Oh, I missed completely. Wow, they take forever to die with that. Once the lightning turns on though, then it'll be different. There we go. Oh, my lightning. One more hit and I get it back. The next boss isn't much of a problem either. Once you know what the skeleton head does, then you're kind of set. There's that final head, like when it turns into pure lasers, but that that's okay too. Once you understand it, then you just avoid the flame and dash through it. Whoa, kill the bat! Oh, I didn't get him, okay. Yeah, this shrine is over here. Like, a little below this area. There's a cherub. Mark it. Shrine's right here. Then it collapses on the other side, she dies. Here it is. Then we go back to her, pick up her head, and then bring it back here. 
and then we're done. Oh, I did lose my lightning. Get that bat out of here. Okay, heal up. Got a mark. Don't really matter. There we go. Oh, th the secret isn't even like open the ceiling. It's actually hit a wall. It goes all the way up. I remember in the first game you could attack floors and secrets could open. There she is. The end. Bear the counter, the statue. Okay, take the head. Okay, wait. Wait for her to die. Okay, got it. Then I got to start the hunt for the wax seeds, bring six seeds over. I think you do all that just for one statue. Most of the, actually, I have one seed already. The most of them are in the wax palace almost. The one I can't reach right now, I think you need to have the air dash. There's the tribute, okay. There's a few things I can do with that. That's a one way. Why did I come this way? But I'm glad I didn't get the glitch on the boss. Just so I can finally hear his theme song. Pretty much the whole area and there's nothing. Oh, I picked up an item. I forgot to mark it. There we go. But yeah, name of the game is just get that last passive. Get that, go back to the start of the game, then just do everything. Oh, it killed the bat, that's good. I thought it was gonna survive. I'm gonna, I have to do that. Uh, no. I remember having to backtrack for this anyways. I'm gonna do it now. I don't, I don't remember what's over here, but it has to be done. Made it. All for a spell. Okay. Mark it. No, I could have done like blue circle for represent a magic spell and a green for an item just to put a little differentiating in the map. I think it's too late for that. Just stick with green means item. Or green means collectible, basically. Okay, here's the palace. I'm not going there yet. Might as well finish off these caves. And I can't because you need the cherubs. Okay. Put a roadblock here. If the map's not a good enough hint, might as well do it. Is there a cherub here? There it is. And I got a free heal. Okay. Mark it. Yeah, not looking to finish this place, just looking to get that one ability. And maybe even a nun so that I can get the teleport ability. And I think I went the wrong way already? I don't think so. The parries! Half health. No point killing him. There's part of the lullaby here, actually. Yeah, you gotta get those two hits. Get the two hits, that spell is actually worth some damage. Okay, 
That did like no damage to him. They, have, they may have the highest defense in the game. And it's just a guy, a corpse in a bed. There we go. Uh, secrets? No. I have to open up a path anyways here. I feel like they should breathe more fire. They they spew out less fire than the, the fire, the heartburn guys. That hurts because you get on the other side and they just cancel. I'm gonna try a slice on them. Half health, okay. Shortcut. Yeah, that's, I think that's the safest way of dealing with those guys. If need be, I can respawn everything right here. Oh, it's a speed test. Okay. Actually, if I take one more hit, I might die. Oh, well, it's a good thing I got a save point right outside this room. Okay. Uh, what's my guilt at? 30, 36? Why'd it go down? Probably because you grabbed the spirit? Is that 50? I want to go back up. Oh no, I had lightning. Oh right, they have double hits. How did I cancel that into a normal attack? There, the music just started again. I didn't even notice it was off. Okay, daggers are not good against the heartburn. Then he turns around, there we go. That was a decent shot. Anyone else? Yep. There, look, figured I'd get a few extra hits off on him too. Imprint of Scalcompendra, something, something. Uh, I guess I'm just gonna have to kill myself a few times for the the guilt. Pretty much no enemies for a few rooms here. Secret? I've already checked this wall. Yeah, they throw more fire if you stay on the same side. There, that, that's perfect. This guy on the other hand. So much HP. Secret wall! Come on, there's like a crack on the wall even. Why is that not a wait? Okay, no secrets at all. So many cracks on walls. There is a cherub here. I forget what's on that other side. This is a lullaby, isn't it? Yep, yeah, okay, there it is. We require lullaby. Oh, I think that's... Is that finished? It is. Written by a mother, indeed, to soothe the cries of the innocent. Okay, I can take that to her now. Mark that on the map. So that's one thing I didn't finish the first playthrough. 
Actually, put a roadblock here. There's a few things I can do. Oh, dodge the wax. I don't know if I want to activate... Yeah, activate every save point. We're going to be warping through them anyway soon. Okay, the boss is in there. Oh, he got me! For once, and he did like half health. He got me again! Okay, back to the usual tactic. Magic? Oh, right, you can attack up with these. Oh, how much damage does it do to attacking upwards? That was a lot of damage for one up attack. Oh, I parried too soon! Warp. Do I need the warp yet? No. I might as well wait until I have the... the ring ability, and then I can leave. I have to come back here anyways with the tribute coin. So that's when I'll finish off the boss. Oh, bad placement. Yeah, I like to think these are just mini versions of that one cool boss in the first game. The one that was just a parading corpse. Yeah, I think this is where it is. Yep. Like, it was just a corpse that cast spells and hands kept it afloat. There, I got the rings. Mark it on a map. Use... Hey, let's just go green. It's a collectible. It's just a collectible you can't miss. Actually, no point doing this yet, too. First, take out all the baddies. Actually. Okay, never mind. Okay, mark him off. Come back to him later when we get the seeds. How is that not hitting the little guy? Oh, the wax got me. There, now I can do everything. The parries for half health. Oh, that guy actually reached. Uh, do I want to go up? No. Yes, this is the exit. So I can leave, take the tribute coin, warp back from the top left, come down, then just take care of the whole area. Ow! Almost killed me. No point really fighting those. This guy, on the other hand. Isn't there two? Yeah. I think this is opens a path. Yep, okay. Uh, this works. I can take that path now, so... What can I do? Get the marking there. I'm at 36. What do I want to do? I want this. So this path would send me over. It all connects, and then I can just walk back, collect everything. Yeah. And the tribute coin needs to go... here. So once I can teleport between save points, just do that. Okay. Unless I die right here.
Oh, I got one crit off on him. Oh no! Oh, so much damage! <laughs> I was too close. What's my percent now? 38 is my guess. 56! Oh, okay, that's that's a good chunk. Okay, uh, I can do the boss. That opens up this path and I can just connect it all. And then just come down. Yeah, okay. Since I'm here, this boss isn't too bad. Come on, get the... Plus, if I die, I just get more guilt that I can cash in. I just gotta watch out for the nun. She can heal. And hopefully the daggers can deal enough damage when she's healing. Oh, right. I forgot that. Oh, jeez. Yeah. This, this is the most annoying spell. And I still get hit. This might not be a good fight for the daggers. I can heal up. She's gonna transform into just spiral flame. Crap. No, wrong. <laughs> we were supposed to be in the air. I already forget the mask does. Oh yeah, okay. I remember now. Almost like don't even bother trying to attack him. That was a bad place to heal. Actually, I should have put on the fire. Would this be fire or is this magic? Oh, right, he's got other spells. There's the nun. Hey, no healing. There we go. You can stop it. I am going to change the spell here, because I feel he does fire damage. It, it's gotta be fire. It could be mystical. But the... The male... The human head shoots fire. I'll put on mystical, just to be safe. Put on all of them. He's not dealing physical here. Uh, Miasma? I don't have a better one. Yeah, this one. Slap on this. Okay. I'm not even going to try to attack here. This is it's just a bullet hell. Again? Ow. I probably could dash through him too. Don't heal. Hey, I said no healing. It's gonna be the next, the next head's gonna be the, uh, I should not have came this way. Crap, I, it was the corner. Why would I go to the corner? But all that guilt, 76, okay. Need to go down. Down? Down to the right. 
Okay. Finish this and then immediately go cash in that guilt. But now I know the daggers can stop. Stop the nun. Whoa! If I need help, I'll get my corpse, but, uh... That would reduce some of the guilt. Get out of the corner now. She's about to transform. No healing! I told you last time. I don't even know if that was worth even casting on him. Yeah, never go in the corner against that. Actually, I, one hit I might die with how much guilt I have. I have to take that into account. Ow! A little bit of a heal. Okay. Can he switch masks, please? Thank you. Anything with that mask. <laughs> hey, no healing. That barely does damage. Mask already? I'm tempted to pick up the spirit now. Just wait it out. Come on, switch masks. Oh, man, more? Thank you. Oh, I'm trapped. Got no magic. Yeah, it's better than being trapped in the corner if he does the fire spell. Okay, after this, she should it turn it should turn into the abomination. Oh jeez. There it is. Now we wait. Whoa! Oh! I grabbed on too soon. Okay. Dash. Pick up the... What happened? Okay, don't grab it. More guilt. 80? 96! Okay. You, you could, I couldn't pick up the spirit, even though I pressed it before jumping. And it was just... The ring was in a bad place, so I couldn't just land while attacking. Plus, I took some cheap shots because I was grabbing on too soon. Whoa! Okay, just get out. Or transforms again. No healing! We've been over this. That spell sucks. I keep thinking it's gonna change with an aerial enemy, but no, it does minuscule damage. Maybe I missed the tier 3 upgrade for daggers. Have to go find them. Oh, jeez! Whoa! Aww. 
There's the nun. No healing. Only I may heal. Go back to the old man! I'm tempted to pick that up, but I know it's not worth it. There's the old man. I'm not going to left. I don't want to get trapped. Okay, that spell's perfect. Oh, hey, you can't immediately switch the abomination. There we go. Didn't even use anything in the mask form. I'm not picking that up. Use these marks to get more statues. Then we gotta do story time again. Now I finished a lullaby. I didn't do that in the first playthrough. So I found one extra note or line, I don't know, verse. We've heard all this before. I've watched the dove fly away. Dove. There it goes. Okay. I'm not going to go to that mirror world yet until I do the whole map, find any upgrades. I'm not going to pick up this uh, spirit either because I need the guilt. I think this connects to the start of the game even. Oh yeah, right there. Uh, wax seed, I need that. Uh, I guess I'll buy that off you. I think he's only got like one item left when you meet, meet him at the end of the game. We have pray. I think. Here's another item. Okay. Mark that off. Yeah, like all these souls I can pick up. I'm not doing it. There you are. I know there's more, but I knew there was one in the starting area. Okay, time to check off stuff. Might as well mark that. Surprisingly, this is not a secret. I'm so surprised that wasn't like a tutorial to let you know. This is all for cash or a mark. Either way, it's not that great. One mark, yeah, it wasn't worth it. Oh wait, 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 uh, no, I don't need to mark that one off. A marker cache is not worth marking. Cash in all this guilt, see what happens. See if there's anything worth doing. Oh yeah, a little bit. I got 100% the map anyways. Oh, he hit me twice. I've done this. Right, I did all this. Yeah, uh, I don't need the Roblox then. That was all for cash or a mark. That's nothing great. All for some cherubs. Oh, for a cherub? Yeah, okay, that's worth it. Mark it off.
He took a beating, even with... Well, I need to... I need to find the last dagger upgrade. That's what I'm missing. Maybe I did miss it. This all looks complete. Too early. Like making a few bucks off these guys, that's about it. I came back for a cherub, that was worth it. I think I can just 100% the whole town. Okay, here we go. See what happens when you give him 96 guilt. Is it 96 still? 96. That your penance of silence and do you wish so be it? It's expensive. The sacrament, your guilt has been now. You have to probably come back, like give enough guilt to max it out, like a hundred. It's just little flowers. Welcome the flower, but the beauty of each. I feel like it should be more after giving him 96% already. What if I come back in? No, okay. 96% is not enough. Okay, I know where this goes. There. I forget what's even in here. Spell. Okay. Mark it off. And give her the chalice. It's a good visit back to town, basically. And if I die a few times, who cares? Just keep cashing them in for the guilt. One chalice. No. There we go. I shall wait. Bring me. Uh, talk to the nuns. Hopefully, I have enough cash. I know the next upgrade is just to max your fervor. Oh, I have enough. Okay. It's pretty cheap. Five. Okay. Uh, three, five, four left. I had more than that. Uh, I might as well just start doing the whole world. Just 100% the map of areas. Yeah, I can do everything now. I can do this. Yeah, okay. Uh, do I want to just walk my way across? Yeah. But the sewers probably connects from the only the bottom. So I'm probably going to teleport. I have a kiss anyways I have to cash in. Actually, I have a kiss and an arena to cash in. Or go up and get the arena that's way up in the top right of the map and then just do them all at once. There we go. I quickly gotta check something on my end actually. Okay. Uh, where's my stream? There it is. Feet mine. Uh, I don't have any knots right now. 
Oh, I have all the knots. Okay, I haven't been using this. Uh... What do I want then? Probably increase cash. Yeah. Because we're going to be buying some big things later. Especially from the dead man... Dead man shop. I don't even remember what this item is. Oh, okay. That was worth it. Just leave this guy. Oh yeah, I can get tons done with these little cherubs now. I think I have to go all the way up. And then it's the impact that does it. There we go. All for a mark. Not even cash. Okay, that's done. Let's see if I can do anything there. No, I think I marked that just because... Yeah, I don't need that. Oh, that was just for cash too! Go through this place. I forget why I used a blue gem. Check that when I can warp between save points. Oh, little guy's running at me. Yeah, so work my way up, check this, talk to them, give them the items that they need, get their uh, statues in return, and then just finish off the little bit of the map. And if I find a cherub, great. One that I didn't find before. Keep climbing. We got Beyblades. And, oh, it even detects them in the, in the web. Okay. I didn't do this area before? Ah, okay. That's why. I got that, okay. So, ring the bell. Don't even need that platform. Clearly a trap room, but that's okay. Once I get the daggers going. Oh no, not the little guys! Actually, bring in the good spell. I need the good spell for them. Oh no, I want to equip it. Burn them! There we go. The parries! Didn't do any damage somehow. Whew. Oh, it got me. Chalice? Okay. Cash that in. Yeah, I think if I don't have anything marked on the map, it was like... By the end, I should only have like like 99% of the items are going to be on the map. Or at least marked. Not like each symbol means something, but at least the green gem indicating there's an item in this room. Oh, sister. Seekest not to deceive me with your detached expression. That serene indifference that becomes thee so well. I know you hear my words. Even though the look you return to me arises from the depths of the shadows themselves. Welcome, visitor, to this table of reproach and intrigue. My name is Trifon, for that was what my parents so desired. Pay us no attention to my sister's words, nor her silences. 
but just by looking at her withered face when she <laughs> sends her malicious smile. No, I am no longer interested in your confabulations. Thine understanding has long been governed by a dastardly imagination. I remember when you had that old blue-green headscarf. <laughs> it was so soft. You kept saying that it transported you back to other times, to distant memories. If you held it now in thine hands, perchance you might cease with the constant accusations. You would never I have lost the item. it if, just for once, you had stopped rummaging through my affairs. Right? There it is. I've never heard this dialogue coming up. Yes. This is my sister's headscarf. Castella now seems immersed in her memories. Where have you gone, Castella? In which dream from which you do not wish to wake have you taken refuge? The dark sockets. What memories? Okay, I need the old lady to spawn now so I can give the other- Oh, there she is! I no longer- I do not believe- Is this another? I know- I do Yeah, and you can't- this. You get the other- You get the other item from the shop way over here. You can't get both for some reason, if you have both of the items for them. Okay, I gotta finish this whole area. Somehow I overlooked it. Can I make that jump? Nope. It should connect from on this side, then. A cherub! Mark it! With a dead skull. They're everywhere! Burn them! No, oh, come back in the fire, quick! There we go. Can't have them running around. Dagger's one weakness. That didn't block it? Okay. Oh no! Whew, made it. Another trap room? Okay, well, fell for one trap. I know one spawns on top with a Beyblade. There's gonna be more of the puppets. There always is. There's the Beyblade. Oh, I got... Oh, it turned the other way. Ooh, I can just bounce off them. That might make things easier. Okay. I haven't got one of those in a while. Uh, mark it. That's this whole area. So take the elevator, talk to him, because I think that one statue is broken. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, okay, it's broken. Okay. I gotta see what happens when you break it enough. So he turns completely into honey. Boy, the little guys. Oh, secret. Oh, another one. Uh, that fog is suspicious. Okay, For, I hear the whispering. Again, the, the music just kicked in. Okay, there's someone here. There's a nun. Can you drop down? Oh, okay. I definitely didn't get this one the first playthrough. Mark that. That one I definitely missed.
this point, just get out of this house. You have to go all the way around to get there? That was a waste of a mark. Just kill everything to bring back the lightning. Okay. So go up, get the it repaired, break it again, proudly go back to town, get the, uh... What do you call it? Get more statue slots. Cash in my health upgrades. There's a lot I can do right now. While I'm here though, I might as well go all the way, explore everything, find everything. So that I can confirm I never have to go there again. Yeah, so he's right there. Hey, what hit me? When did I lose my lightning? Well, that's probably how. Heal up. I think the next upgrade, my heals are like full health too. Okay. Let not. Got it. And then just keep breaking it. Take it. See what happens. I gotta go all the way up there anyways. Give him the next tribute. But if I do that, they send me all the way back over here. I can work my way down. 100% this, 100% that. I don't know why I put the blue there. I forget what blue meant. Or... I, there's no point going up here until I can teleport from, from save points. So I'll save that for last. So I can do all this, work my way up, 100%. Tribute, go over, take care of it. And plus the tribute will take me to another nun. And that nun might be enough to get me the next upgrade I need to get the teleporters work. Oh, I thought that it would go a little further than that. In case there's another cherub hiding amongst the leaves. Hopefully not. Because that's just annoying. Yeah, didn't do this before. Oh, another nun. Okay. Didn't even hear that one whispering. Mark it on the map. Take that off the map. Ow! Ow! Heal up. Is it another nun? No, it's spikes. Okay. Oh, I forgot about that spell. Okay, mark that. Take that off. Ow. Okay. Talk to the Shadow Club one more time. This should be enough nuns to get the next upgrade, too. I think this is for one knot and a nun, and it cuts open the rest of the map to 100% the wax, uh... The wax palace. Might as well mark that. Oh, you can't, no, can't mark it off anyways. Oh, why'd I do that? Oh, I got my leg back, okay. I did not want to take away a mark for lightning. Right here. There she is. 
That's gotta be enough for the next upgrade. First, I'll kill everything. Oh! I thought they would all just die. Oh, there's a big guy. You can't compete against the lightning. Nothing competes against the lightning. There we go. Anyone else? No. Nope. That's just for a mar- Ah, eh, might as well. 100% all secrets in this run. Not really a secret, but... There. No secrets? Nope. I think the nun was enough for a secret. Okay. I can 100% this whole place now going down. Actually, no, I can't. You have to collect all the wax seeds. And it's not even near a si it's near a warp, I guess. Nope, nope, don't have to go that way. Just keep dropping down. Oh, right on top. Fast travel. Okay, there we go. Oh, is it a speed challenge? How do I get in there? I don't remember. I just took a lot of damage. Okay, I need to heal. Oh, come from the back. Okay. Oh. Avoid. Oh no! Fire. Yeah, that's what I needed. That's probably enough cash to get the upgrade from the nuns, too. Wow, he didn't even move for... Okay, that works. This guy, on the other hand, I'm not even gonna bother. It takes way too long to kill those guys. There. Another tra... Okay. Uh, if I don't win this, though, that's pretty... Wa well, if I don't win, I can cover more guilt. That's always good. Ugh, I hate you. Oh, it's still procked a little. Barely any damage to them, though. Is it only a chance that it procs, or...? They don't move! How is the lightning not constant? Whoa! Chalice? Receptacle Chalice. One or the other. Mark it off. And I got 100% that, okay. I think I can leave this whole palace now. I can just say I can just warp from the save point. Down to the right, okay. Yeah, keep going down. Oh, I took two hits from him. I was gonna get out.
But yeah, I'm hoping, I'm thinking and hoping that I can 100% the map tonight, get the real ending, good ending, whatever you want to call it, and then next session, either tonight or tomorrow or Saturday, just work on getting the last few things on Rise. Like the few situational achievements. Like, I gotta find all the secret emblems. I have to, uh... What else was there? There's Cherub. Okay, find the secret emblems. I have to do that. I have to get to the second boss in under 30 minutes. I have to do the curse challenge, like the curse letter, whatever it is. Gotta do all that. There's a few things I still have to do, but this is at least, like, the final playthrough. Everything after that is just situational, or I can do it all in this file. So I'm really hoping I find every chair of this run. The ones that I missed from the first attempt. Might as well get this, too. Since I'm here. That way I don't have to backtrack. Aw, oh, I missed. It's all for one item. I forget what it is. Oh, it's all the wax seeds now. Okay, market. Roblox. How many seeds do I got? I need two more. Okay. I know where one is. The final one might be in a shop. This whole area is done now, yeah. Palace. Wait, the palace connects right here. I have to go back. Ooh, that was a, f that was a nice place to dash. Man, I connected the shortcuts, didn't I? No, this is not the room. That connects. This connects, I'm pretty sure. Or did it? No, it comes out. You go through here and it circles back. No, I'm... I'm thinking here. No? I'm pretty sure I'm right. Secret wall? Aha! I knew I was right. There we go. Especially for a cherub. Four left. Mark them. Then we can do this even. Hopefully nothing attacks me. Is this for a cherub too? Nope, it's a shortcut. That might lead to a cherub, I don't know. I'm close. Four cherubs left. Four cherubs left plus two areas I haven't even explored yet. So maybe I did find- oh, now someone comes out. So maybe I did find the ones that I missed. And they die pretty fast now. I think I missed the last dagger update somewhere. Could be up there even. This area could have been easier with that upgrade. Unless it's in the palace. It, it could be. Wait a minute. Did the crits chain to the other enemy too? It looked like it. Hey, how come that didn't work? I lost my lightning for a second there. Oh, 
I don't even need the last one. This is all from cash? Uh, mark, I guess. That's still not worth it. Uh, everything done here? Unless that's a secret room. I think I can go all the way down and just fast travel back. Oh, uh, I didn't do this. A lot to do there. I can do that once I can teleport. So yeah, I think I'm gonna go back to town. I probably can get the upgrade now. I'll kill what I can along the way. All the way down. You have to go all the way. Okay, don't kill me. Well, actually... Do I have anything to gain from staying alive? Yeah, just die. You take me to a save point, I build guilt. It's, it's the fast travel method right now. There. And go talk to the nuns. Cash in all of this. Allow? No, I need more. I definitely have enough. I can max this out right now. Even with the last one costing 10. There. Totally worth it. Your altar. Now, what do I want to give it? Increase stun. Yeah, that could work. Can I make it better, though? Okay. What does that give me? Strength. Perfect. Okay. Keep that on. And then. Stun power increases. For, no, I don't want that. Stun power enough. Dodging. Blood pack health. Damage buff on boom. This one might be good just because daggers are that effective. Uh, fire miasma mythical critical coal. Fervor's at its maximum. Damage of prayers. Is damage inflicted when the guilt level is low. I want mine high, so that's worthless to me. Physical, yeah, I think I'm just gonna go with. Oh, that's at maximum. They don't really combo though. Fervor generated. I don't really need that. Stun power. Yeah. No, no real combos here, but that's fine. Talk to the no wait. How much guilt do I got? Twenty. I can give it. So so be it. Twenty. Okay. The difference between twenty and ninety-seven is four thousand dollars. Is there gonna be more on the floor? No, not really. I think it's just gonna come down to me like purposely dying three times to get like 30. Four, four, eight, one left. Now I can teleport. Five. Yeah, there's one left. One left in two areas I have to check, so it's working out. I'm gonna go to the one sh uh, I don't have much cash, actually, to make it even worth my trip. But I have a lot of Chalice stuff to cash in. 
Like, come back when I have like 30,000 and it's dropping the cat store. Now I shall, I shall wait for. No, there's more chalices. I shall wait. Now. Bring me more. I think there's like one more in every in the last region. With this, only the miracle shall know. How. Yep. Okay. Bring me chalice. Big. That was a good upgrade. A little bit of everything there. Next is I can now warp anywhere. Should probably check what that is. And since I'm here, I might as well check the store, see what I can buy out of her. You put. I can't afford anything. Okay, I was right. I need like forty thousand before I can talk to her again. Okay, so check the mark, and then I'm just gonna explore the rest of the map. Problem is, I don't have any marks. In case I do find it, then I won't be able to cash them in. Oh, it was this. Okay. Uh, okay, nearest save point is left. Chalice in the air? Nothing. Okay. Okay, travel. All the way to the top right. We get this one child in a bed. Yep, okay. I'm going the right way now. Three hits for daggers now. This will 100% the region, too. There. Would this count as a person, or would this count as a collectible? I think it would be a collectible. Mark that off, and then all the way back. I think I'm just done with this tower completely. I need to go... I need to finish this region. And I can probably get enough cherubs here. I can drop down and grab that item, too. Okay. A few things I can do. That thing, this thing takes forever to die! Even with all these upgrades! I don't even know how much health that gave me. Or how much cash. Oh no, my ride! With lightning, it's fast. Okay. Map-wise, 84% done the map. Other option is I go to the final boss, die a few times to him, and then cash in the guilt. There's no way I collected everything in this purple region on my first visit. There's a lot I can do here. Uh... Okay, yeah, just finish the blue area. I'm already here. If there's anything here. Spikes, that's what's here. I have to go down anyways. Uh, can I do this? 
You have to be able to do it. If I do it right. There we go. All that for a little bit of cash. 2,000 bucks. I will buy nothing in this point of the game. Oh, I forgot to do this even. He still takes forever to die. Even with all these upgrades. Oh, this... Okay, I know what this is. First, take out every enemy. Because this part gets annoying. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. There we go. Oh, it's for cash! Not even a cherub. Okay, mark that off. Work my way up there. I think that's a cherub. Or I'm thinking that room that has nothing in the corner. Oh, I was home with the parry. There's another bell in this room. Uh, there's gotta be something in this corner. Like, you don't ring a bell for nothing. Yeah, here it is. These don't multiply, luckily. There we go. I think I just need to explore this region, see what there is. It's definitely not for this. I already got this one. That's a big loop for nothing. There's no secrets in this corner. Unless it's all for this, there's... This bell's gotta be for something. I don't know. There's no metal around there. Oh, it got me. There was a cherub here. And I can say, well, I can heal. Keep going up. Yeah, this run we're gonna get try and get everything done before the boss. Get to the good ending. Yeah, sh attacking up seems to just deal more damage. Okay, there's that chest. That's no problem to get now. It's a wax seed, I'm pretty sure. Nope, it's a leg. And I take a hit. Great. There is a wax seat around here, isn't there? Cherub? It's a trap! It's a big guy. And a little guy. Oh, it got me. I thought the lightning would hit it once and I wouldn't have to worry about it. 
Too early. Ow! And these guys are facing the wall now. Ooh! Angled dash. That's probably a glitch just because I'm against a wall. Another? More? I don't know how that counted as a parry. Yeah, that is that move is not worth it ever. Unless I'm doing it wrong, but all it's a two hit slash. What else is there? Okay, mark that off. Get these two. Oh, I think blue meant a collectible like that type. This is the last seed I need. There it is. This point, I think I'm done this region. Ooh, behind him! Didn't even get a chance to attack. Okay, I can leave now. Uh, put a mark here. Nearest. <sighs> Might as well just go here, too. Might be faster to warp, though. Yeah, there's no enemies this way. Okay, a little to the left. There. I think this is just cash. I think. Yeah, it's just, a, it's a cash or a mark. It was 100% map, I guess. That's why I'm here. But when I do go for getting to the second boss in less than half an hour, I have to basically do all of this. How did I not do that? But I have to do all of this, get the mace, and then don't even worry about the boss. I have to go all the way back and then just start doing this region to get the daggers. I think that's where the daggers are. No. You have to work your way here fight your way, get the daggers, then work your way back into here and get all the way down. Like, no point to fight anything, just run. And since I'm here, I might as well go straight across and do that one mark. He's gonna blow! Oh, I have to go up? And that'll probably be the last, like, play, quote-unquote, playthrough I have to do. Everything else can just be done in this file. I thought I did this part already. I'm pretty sure I knocked this down all. I did all of this. I got the double jump and came back. Maybe I just didn't save after. Yeah, I did all this. Why? I guess I didn't save. I must have collected them and just turned it off last session. Uh, okay, let's see. A lot of this is done. Map is 85% done. Hopefully I didn't miss anything. I still have some of the map to do anyways. But I can warp here, take the cherub up, at least connect here to collect the item, then work my way across. Zigzag and get that cherub, these roadblocks. 
Hopefully that's another cherub. And then just start the last area. And I still have to go back and collect the the arena rewards too. So much damage. Also, I gotta find the dagger upgrade. I'm missing the the third dagger. Okay. Some of these cherubs are not even a good spot. Like, I can just double jump over them. Like, minus four cherub to count, because some of them could just float to the top and done their job again. Oh, I get another reward. It's probably a mark. You don't need to pan down, just cut right back to me. I don't need to watch all that. The path to the do not allow it. Like, see, you just skipped like five cherubs. One mark. Two marks. Hey, this could have been one cherub, and I just have to jump to either way. They got lazy there. Cherubs aren't doing their job. I, oh, that's the coin that increases defense by a good chunk. Okay, mark that off. Collected. No point going that way yet. Now go down. Am I going the right way? Yeah. This is just connect the map. Oh, never mind. It's an item. And there's the Hoyle. Okay. Mark it. One cherub up there. Better to just use the save, save point travel. And there was a cherub here. I, w I definitely didn't get that the first playthrough. I didn't even think to do like a trust fall. Up, oh, warp over there. A few things to collect. I'll stop to kill this guy. Yeah, I definitely didn't collect this my first playthrough. New spell? Okay, yeah. What is this? Mark it. What's it? What is it? We're using the damage of traps. Ah, uh, that I don't need. Significantly increase the tears. I can slap that on. Elemental, elemental fire. No, got nothing else I need. And hopefully there's one cherub, it doesn't relate, it's not related to the guilt. Like you have to max out the guilt and then a cherub just spawns or a new room opens up. Whoa. Hey, he turned before I was even done. Uh, I lost my lightning. He knew I was jumping over. Okay, here's a cherub. Number 30. So at this point now, I'm at the same amount as I had last playthrough. And there's a lot of the maps still to go, so I definitely, I think I'm on track. Like, there's two regions left that I haven't done. Oh, jeez. This, I think, loops around. Yeah, here we go. Start with this way. There it is, okay. I'm gonna get souped up.
I don't have marks on- well, I did just get like f four marks. Okay, do this right. There we go. There. Unlimited power. Probably get a third lightning stack. Maybe increased damage speed, combo speed. Okay, put all points. I got 16. I can definitely soup this up. Base damage, the third. Boost your silver cross. Ooh, hopefully it does real damage with this. Silver stone consumes all available indicators to power up. And how much to finish off? Where? What spell is this? Silver storm consumes all available indicators to power up. Silver storm. R1 and square. Okay, it's the right spell. There. Maxed out. Ready for real damage with this. And hopefully some of these spells are actually effective. Or some of these skills. Can't test it on that thing. It's... Unless lightning stacks. It's <laughs> doing a lot more damage. Is this taking me to a chair? No, it's an item. Okay, that's worth it. Mark it. Take that off. Okay, 86% on the map. This is area's done. I can... Is there anything else I can do? I got a lot done just now. Uh... There's a little bit of the map here. I can't think of what was there. If I go back, I can cash in the arena. I can do two some arenas. I don't think I have them all. I don't have all the items for this either. Like, I think I might as well start here before doing the boss, come back and upgrade. Wait a minute. Oh no, never mind. I thought I didn't mark a cherub. I gotta see how much damage the cross slash does now too. We can test on this guy. Whoa, okay, that, it's worth it now. That is a good spell. <laughs> okay, I'm going to... How much cash do I got? 22? It's not worth it. Might as well just go to the next region. I gotta watch out for the lasers here too. It's a trap. First, the trap room. Yeah, these are the multiplying guys. Ow. Hey, you're supposed to be dead. You had no HP there. I don't know if they can multiply after they've multiplied. I really don't want to test it when he's that far out of reach, though. Is he coming down? I think he's going to multiply again. Ooh! Take the hit, it's fine. I could cross slash. And miss it completely. Okay. Any more? No, we're done. Dodge the lightning. Ooh, that was a waste. That was okay. Where's that save point? I know there's one near here. Stop blocking. 
200 for just that guy. I know there's a save point in this place. Oh, I thought it was a secret wall. One, I don't even need this. I have max daggers. I have max, max daggers, max statues. I don't need those anymore. Might as well just finish this whole row first. Okay, that was too close. There we go. You know, cross slash is good now. It's like half health if you land that. I gotta see what the rapid slash deals. I need some real enemies though. That's a real end. I just lost a hit though. They, they die too fast for me to even try. Oh no! Oh no! That was a waste of some. Oh, there's one guy above still. Yeah, this. These things are great. Now, oh, unless a little guy shows up. The one weakness to daggers. Just burn them all. One guy waiting in the corner. Yell up. There's more? That deal still dealt no damage. Hurry up and get rid of the lightning. Ow. Cross slash. It, it hit at least. Is that it? Are we done here? Yep. Yell up. Okay, connect the connect the map first. This is the exit to the whole place. No point going that way. Okay. That that's a terrible start to the region. Yeah, once the lightning perks with these level 3 blades, they're fine. Aww. Oh no! Okay, stop doing that. You're wasting energy. Ow! <laughs> Terrible. Get me out of here. See, that's such a waste. I don't want to... Can I turn off the dash attack? I don't want it. It's going to use up lightning. It's not great damage unless you need more stacks. I'm too stationary for too long with that. And there's another lightning guy. Oh, come on. Whoa. I need one spell out of this room. Don't bug out. Okay, didn't bug out this time. Can mark that off. I don't know, sometimes you'll just do that fa fall onto the traps and they don't open. Like dead center, it doesn't even work. Hey, okay, drink the water. 
Ritual of the Night mode now. Or Symphony of the Night mode. Well, both of them, I guess, but. Hey, no, I want daggers. Enemies don't attack you during this. I feel like I'm forgetting something about this room. I'm gonna wait. Sphere kissed by the storm. Isn't there more to this area? There's the defense item. Ah, uh, okay. Mark it off on the map. Secret walls? Nope, nothing. Just let that lightning soar. This room's basically done now, too. Yep. I think you have to fight stuff along the way first. Okay, no enemies. I, oh, I'm thinking when you go left, there's a trap room they have to work you fight your way through. This is just for a mark. I don't even need this. Yeah, don't bother. There's no need for more marks. I have everything I need. Okay, here it is. They don't even have the chance to multiply with the lightning damage going. Whoa! What? I didn't even see what enemy was in the ring with me. There is one part to this that I might have to loop through again for. Because there's one item that you kind of have to loop or turn around with the teleporting mirrors to work on. Oh, he got me. Yeah, I have to circle back to open that path. And with that path, I get the one item that I'm worried about. But first, I'm just gonna finish this whole area. He's going the wrong way. That did like no damage. There is a cherub. Heal up. I can see the cherub. Put it on the map. It's like... Put it there for now. Unless I can double jump and reach it? Blammo! Got it. Two left. Put that skull on him. I need to go through this, come up, and then loop around, break that. Then I have to come back, trigger this, and then loop around the other way, just so I can pick up one item. It's annoying. Oh jeez, I should not have went that way. He's still walking around. Oh right, he shoots that. <laughs> I 
Can I take out everything else before the big guys? I need to heal anyways. I need to save, actually. There's definitely more in that room to do. Okay, here we go. There's still at least one more nun somewhere. There she is. Penitent one. We approach she was dead last time. The lady. My spear is not ready. It needs one last blessing. I need your help to find the holy oil with which I shall anoint my ornate spear. Then the lady's untruths will be weak to the thrusts of my spear. Do I have oil? Yep, okay. Now you won't keel over in the fight now? My lance already shines with the oil's glow. I feel my search coming to an end, mistress of lies, craftswoman of evil shadows. I know you dwell in these galleries, behind treacherous mirrors. My spear is now ready to carry you to your one true grave. Penitent one, you are free to accompany me or continue in solitude. Will you join me in the yes. blast? There you shall meet me, and in communion we shall fight. Okay, bye. Yeah, I definitely didn't see her alive there the first playthrough, and I... Uh, don't break the mirrors here. I don't want to start the boss yet. But she was just a corpse when I got here the first time. And then the, here's a little mark. No, I'm thinking the upside down world. There's a marking behind one of the mirrors there. Two cherubs left. How come you didn't break? I need my lightning. He would have been dead by now. There we go. Oh, not the bedridden. Oh, parry that guy. Do not let them alive. There we go. Those that look. These hags you can leave around. They're fine. They're not a real threat. It's everyone else in this room. Secrets? Nothing. I know there's still lots to do in this area, though. Oh, he got me. I get, what's in here? I'm not doing that yet. First clear out this path. Missiles! Okay, the lightning guy's a problem. Everything in this room combined is a problem. Okay, take him out first. I got a crit off. Ugh. There. I'm not dealing with the big guy right now. Right now, I just want to kick out the new enemies that are in this room. Uh, I didn't check down here. That's fine. I'm going to loop back anyways. I'm not going to break the mirror yet, though. I want that to be the last thing I do. Even though I know I have to backtrack to come back and do it. Oh, he broke? I thought he had a few more hits on him. Again with this guy. I'm at max stacks. And I wasted one doing that. Secret walls? Nothing. Okay. He almost multiplied. Ow. 
heal up. I think this is an arena room. Or not, okay. Oh, he did multiply, crap! First clear path for this whole region. Oh no! I forgot what weapon to use. Oh, through here. Yeah, do not break that. Actually, that's not even the right mirror. There's another mirror. Yeah, this is where you're supposed to go. Just don't break the mirror. Remember that, that's important. <laughs> okay, there's the mirror. Well, I didn't break the mirror though. That one melted. Where's the one you have to break? It's upside down and everything. It's right here, isn't it? Where is it? Okay, first go back. I guess I triggered it already. I thought it was a room with just a giant mirror in the upside down world they have to break. I know here's some little symbol there or something. Oh, I'm not going to make that. Oh, I did. Okay. Yeah, this will connect. This is what I need. Plus an item. Oh, that's the last one. Okay. Now I'll cash that in. Get another statue. Mark this off. And this opens up, so now I can get to that one item that I need. Okay, everything's dead. Good. Uh, am I in the upside down world or the right way up world? That connects. I think I'm forgetting something. Come back, switch that. I might as well connect the other side first. It's a stupid path you have to loop around on. I don't like it. But I'm pretty sure that mirror that you can't interact with, that you can see your reflection, I think that's the one you need for the curse, like, the curse letter thing. And probably a mark. One mark. I don't even need him. Why is she taking so many hits? No secrets? Nope. I thought he was going to spin before he died. There. Now it's all connected. Oh! One more hit. There we go. There's one guy over here.
Yeah, lightning kills these. Without lightning, the, the heads take forever. Ow! Okay, this is the room. So to break this, first I have to take care of this puppet. You have to position this in the right spot. Then you have to go through the mirror, loop around again. Well, go through that mirror, come out another one, loop around, then drop down. I, I hate it. It's the one, maybe the, the most obnoxious item to get in the game. It doesn't require a quest. You can block magic even? There's a whole bit of the map I haven't checked too. Uh, okay, go down. Actually, which way do I go? I went through there. What am I forgetting? Unless you have to finish this area first. Warp through there. The switch is there. You can't go up if you do that, so you have to come this way. And there's no way for me to loop. Plus is there. And then it drops down and then finish that region somehow. Or oh, I didn't go down and activate the switch. Okay. This is why I hate this puzzle. You can't get through with double jump too. You need the platform to move on. Take, drink that water and then go down. Almost got me. What time is it? It's been three hours, so just hitting the seven hour mark. I can definitely finish the game in eight hours, but 100% it in eight. Or 100% the map in eight hours. I gotta hope that this, these two cherubs are somewhere. Oh, here's one of them. One let it's got to be in the final area. Little skull on that. I'm going to first collect this one item though. It annoys me. Secret? Nothing. You holding anything? No. I don't even need to fight that. Just drink the water. Got woke all the way back. Now I was hoping the dagger is like with max lighting. I thought it was gonna like giant AOE around you or something. I was hoping for something grand by the end. I think this is just for like one spell or one item. I don't even remember. I have all the wax seeds, I don't need that. It's I think it's a spell. Could be a bead, like I don't know. Nope, wrong way. We have to do all this backtracking for this one item. I don't even remember what it is. I think it's a bead. For something of relevance, that, that's like the only thing I can think of. I only have to go through this loop one more time too. I can fight the boss. 
There. Finally. No, it's a it's the final kiss. Okay. Mark it. There. Now get out of here. I can fight the boss, cash in the items. Go do the arenas, because I have to finish those off. And that'll probably give me the last chalice or receptacle so I can do everything. But one cherub left. I'm on the right track. I don't know which ones I've missed, but we're close. And see what's at the top of the tower. Oh wait, do I have to take that? Like climb the tower, see what's at the top. I don't think I'm going to be able to get lightning during this boss fight. She moves around way too much. Actually, no, if you stun her, there's that one chance you can stun her. Okay, made it. One of like three bosses in this game that aren't human size. I forget what she does though. She has the laser. Oh, this spell, I forgot, yeah. Okay, switch, switch these beads. I am not dealing with this again. Uh, I don't need my asthma, I need lightning. Even cash in a bit. She does no physical. Just more lightning. Oh, okay. Forgot about that spell. Got a crit. Decent damage. I, this. Like, don't even bother going near her. Again? Uh, there's no point in even me casting spells on her. I'm gonna be a sitting duck if I do it. Oh! She show- That's a terrible time to show up! Oh, again? Ugh. I hate it. Well, I guess just get through it and she misses you completely. Ow! I'm gonna die just to that, probably. Again. It's, it's an annoying spell. Are you gonna do lightning again or not? <laughs> yeah, I guess just loop on the other side of her every time. Completely forgot about that phase too. Lightning? Again? I might die. Get one hit off, that's about it. All I can do here. Verva has only shown herself once this time. Twice. Ow. I thought she was doing it again. Oh, what? Even after, eh? 
Oh yeah, she gets faster. Crap. Things aren't going well now. Just goes right into that spell. I got some crits off. Oh, I got hit. Verba, you threw off my timing to dash! Again? Okay, just wait for her to do it twice. Oh no! Crap. Whew. Well, third time, come on! Never seen it three times. Okay. Verva threw me off with her little timing right between the lasers. It's okay, I got guilt. It's the one pro to dying in this. Of course, it's a very slow boss. Okay, terrible timing again. Oh no, crap. I should not pick that up, I'm dumb. Straight into that spell. One crit. I feel like the only time you can hit her well is after lightning. The problem is Verva is not helping. She's making it worse. Unless there's a way to control the loops here. It just seems so repetitive with the lightning. That was a good one. I dashed in on one. Lightning? No. Oh, again? I'm not getting the dash off. She's going to do the lightning, isn't she? Yep. I made it. Twice. Okay, yeah, just stay on the opposite side of her at all times. Don't even try and attack it. Oh, no way was I making that. Go to lightning. Nope, she's not doing it. Straight to lightning. Crap.
Verva, where are you? Thank you. Oh, she actually got the final hit. That's worth it. For lore, that's a good reason. She gonna talk to me? Yep. The body of the lady lies before our victorious feet. Her curse and the curse of this place are lifted. My promise has been fulfilled by dint of your help. Dint? Penitent one. Before continuing on your journey, first take this as a sign of our blessed bond. Okay. Farewell, penitent one, on the straightest of paths. Four marks! Completely irrelevant to me. The cash is more important to me at this point, just to buy everything. Okay, let me talk to this guy one more time. At this point, I can go straight to the end. There's one cherub somewhere, though. It's gotta be in the final area. And all the red I go this. Duff. I can do everything now. Missing one nun, one cherub. I can do the arenas. The resting time between the thundering beats of the descending heart. I've already re heard all this. Look at that exit. Secrets? No. Made it. Now, what do I want to do? There is this bit of the map, might be what I'm looking for. Buy everything out of his shop. I don't have much to cash in here. I don't know. I've been doing pretty well with this map. This is 100% now. I think last time I forgot like this corner kind of thing. Like just a corner I missed. And I do have to climb all of this now. There could be some upgrades there. For now, though, I'm going to go all the way... Not that down. This far down. No, here. Here. No. Cash everything else here first. I think I have to buy a key so I can open that door anyways. So I'll do this. That almost killed them both. Didn't make that jump. Oh, my face! How much did I gain? Two guilt, that's it. I'm gonna leave a lot more. I hate when he jumps out of it. See what's up here. Why? Oh, it's the cherub. Okay. I did it. The last cherub got the achievement. So I definitely missed something. There it is. Mark it. That's every cherub marked. Uh, I guess now I can go talk to him, but first I will work my way back. Ooh, with lighting kills her, okay. <laughs> he almost got me. I think I've found every child, so I can probably do all the arenas.
Feel your f mine own penitent. There's more kisses somewhere? Oh, that was Max. I think I found all the kids. I can do all these right now. That's probably the last three upgrades I need for the chalices. Probably one statue, maybe. Well, one statue, two, two chalice upgrades. And I got all the upgrades for daggers, so this should I should be able to just mow these down. And we shall see. Ow! Terrible start. Okay, look away, fine. <laughs> oh, he still got me. There's no music. Oh, you know, there's sound effects, never mind. What is this? What about this? Yeah, barely any more damage. I'm gonna heal up. I took way too much from that. I, I didn't know he was gonna still be act. Okay, stop! These flames are hurting me more than anything. Ow! Yeah, I'm trying to slide under him. There, chain lightning. And I still get hit. Oh wait, my health! When it gets so low! Okay, that was a worth- that was a good hit. Don't multiply! There we go. Got marks, they're worthless to me. I should have used the lightning bolt, maybe. Actually, let's... I can do it right now. Where is it? Much better. <laughs> I should have been doing that much sooner. There, that's probably the last one. I got tons of cash. Take that all to the shop, buy every shop out, and then go to the tower. See what's at the top, finally. It's looking good for 100% completion run with daggers. I still have to find all the statues. Though. That's one thing. I might already have the, the three from before. I don't remember. Actually, how is that one statue that needs to break? How's that one looking? It's broken. Good. Okay. Oh, he's still hitting me. Okay, one shot it. That's good. Aw, oh, the big guys! And fire! And two fires! Barbecue him. He still can hit you. Heal up. Whew. Okay, got him. I got lighting, it's fine. Nothing's stopping me. Except maybe that guy. He's, should be dead before he even gets to spin. Okay, this is looking good. Things are, oh! That was the first execute chance of the night. That's how rare dagger, st ch dagger crits are, or dagger stuns are. I 
Don't take too many hits from this guy. I can heal up, actually. Oh, you missed! Crap! I want to see what it looks like when it's charged. Okay, last thing has to be the blade. And now 100% the challenges, the, ch the chalices. And the arenas, I guess, too. But first, I need to go get a heal. I don't have any more vials. There. So, there is no cherub in the final climb. I don't know which ones I missed in my first playthrough then. May the bell. There we go. So there should be all the upgrades. Well, there's another kiss and somewhere apparently. Sing. Ow! Keep forgetting how fast that is. Yeah, heal up. Already looking bad. Still no lightning. She got the hit off. Crap! My lightning! Oh no! Not you! Anyone but you. I forgot he even shows up in this. Oh, oh, the pain. Ow. Whew, okay. The rest are just little guys. I don't know what they were thinking. It's just the wagon wheels. Like, why a bunch of wagon wheels at the end for the final arena? Oh, I didn't kill him! Foxy, how's it going? How's this Saturday? Unless it's still Friday based on your time zone. One statue. Oh, you get one of those ones. Okay. So you have to do 100% the, uh... You have to 100% the arenas to get the statues. Now you with the, with the, with the full sleep. Well, I already read all this before. Now it looks like the Zalgo checker was kicked in, too. I was worried that the stream, the Steam bot... The stream bot wasn't working recently. Someone posts, like, four emotes, it's like, you, you're muted for 30 seconds. <laughs> I was like, it's four emotes, who cares? Okay, travel. Going up. To this? Yeah. Oh, I can cash in all of- I can cash in so much right now. Here, take everything. Pretty sure I have two tools for you. The fun Yep. Do I have three? No. Wow, I do. Do I have to come back in and out three times, though? No. Or is he just gonna be gone? Oh no, he's painting it now. The now. Uh, nothing I need to do with him. No. Are you still trying to get the Zalgo going? No. Do I have to walk all the way to the right and then he'll leave? What about in here? This is worthless. How much guilt do I got? Two. It's worthless! Cash in this, I guess.
Oh, she's finally getting under the skin. I'm doing okay. I got the. I had dinner. I had like tons of Reese ice cream. I, I'm good for the rest of the night. This 100% her no. collectibles. Although my. No. There is no. With this. No, it's like finish the TV series today. I'm gonna 100% this game tonight with the cherubs. It's gonna be a good, successful Thursday. I think she's completely done, right? It's just a woman who's been peeling her skin off. That's all. See, now she's pure bone. Ooh, more health. No answer. Yeah, she's done. Don't worry. We don't have to talk to her anymore. It's just a woman who's been peeling her skin off. You give her more chalices, more skin comes off. You give her more receptacles, more skin comes off. They don't explain why. Uh, I can buy her out. For some reason, this mark menu, like watching this mark takes forever. I can't skip it. You can't just click, 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 go. It's no, you got to watch it. You have a Actually, I should have went to the other store. I might have just wasted a lot of cash on that. Actually, it's midnight now. I might need to take a quick break. Go check on a few things. Yeah, I oh, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna take a break before I get to the tower and see what's finally at the top there. Okay, give me like five minutes, go get a drink, check on what's going on around here, and then just come back, blast through the rest of this game, see what's at the top of the tower with the cherubs, then go for the good ending, I guess. I think that's the two big things of the night that I need to do. So give me like five, ten minutes, probably just five minutes, and then I'll blast through the rest of this. Okay, good to go. Got a drink. Wait, why is it not working? Box. Ah, oh, is there a cat? I can't think of any cats in this game. I'm trying to think of any. There might be one in the background of the village. I am not sure. Where is it? There it is. So going to the very top. I don't even. Ah, I probably need to kill this guy for the sake of cash. Until I go to that final store. Here he is. I don't know why we have to watch this. This area, this tower, this whole area actually reminds me of Jump King. Why are there... Why are there three rings I have to jump? Why, why not just have another cherub there? Why? Why? Why would you need that? Penitent one of uncompromising will. My brothers and I are grateful to thee. See how they rise, as if the weight of their bodies had been taken away from them, and with it, their sorrows. The road is now complete. The highest point of this garden awaits thee. Okay. I don't know why there's a ring. Three rings you have to do. I was thinking like, oh, maybe it's that you can't get up there until you have all the upgrades. But I'm like, no, you need the you need the upgrades to even get the cherubs. It just feels. Oh no. Why require rings? It's it's a cherub baby thing, yeah. More of a cherub than giant baby. Wait, what was that? Oh, there is a glitch here. There should be a chest here. But why the rings? That's weird. And then just two more chair. Like, why? Oh, what I get? Four marks. Giant rattle. Do I give the rattle to the giant? Oh, wait, what's here? 
Ah, secrets in the secret. Gregal. Gregal. Market. Market. Anything else here? No other secrets? No. Then just fallen all the way. All the way. All the way. Oh my god. Come on, just let me fall. There we go. Oh, okay. Okay, baby wants his rattle. Your deeds fill us with joy, penitent one. You shall always find a home in this garden. We surrender ourselves to your charity. Oh, it's for a statue. Okay. Anything else? Your deeds, you shall always we surrender. No, okay. 94% done the map. Climb this should be the final 100. And oh, and open this door. That's probably the final bit. Okay. Uh, I need to go this way. But that's the fourth statue I need for the four with the cloth. So that's definitely a secret there. Uh, I need to go... Uh, gotta go equip the statues now. Maybe she's... Go maybe he's gone now. Good, he's gone. Okay, pick this up. Marks are irrelevant to me. She shows up. Talk to her. Penitent, my knife made them following. It is as he. Go in here, and then she starts doing her own stuff. I. Hand over more statues. And I have to go back to the honey guy too. I have carved a new figure. Okay, let's see. How many do I got? One. Two. Three. I don't have four. It's right there. Okay. The missing items. It might be in the final area. And now I can uh, equip here. Okay, things are looking good. What else do I need to do? Ah. Uh, What else is there? I got that. I can take that off. I can check out items, actually. So, I have to do the guilt. Guilt will probably get me these. Oh, I have to give the seeds still. And talk to the honey man. Okay, yeah. There's a few things I gotta do. Okay, honey man. I don't know how many times I have to talk to this guy. The bees of the miracle advance, creating more hollows in this honey pot that is now my body. Let not your spirit be grieved. The honey will repair all the damage done to my gift. Eventually, it will be permanent, hopefully. I think I just have to keep killing this guy. Take it. And behold, it's restored splendor. Okay, bye. Are you gone now? Oh! And on, I shall be one with this miraculous honey. And then my soul will be forever sweet and golden. Yeah, I guess I have to do it one more time and he's gone. Is there anything else I need to do around here? Wasn't there an area that was like a shadow that I couldn't jump to? Did I not do that? Like over here? Yeah, the owl, owl always comes from the bottom first.
Yeah, there's like another cave that I didn't do. He's already half health. That's how strong this is. There it is. Okay. It's a nut. Oh, it's the last one. Got the achievement. Okay. I knew there was fog somewhere. Okay, mark it. Like, I remember the one that you need the bell to ring. But I was like, there's shadows you can jump to. Uh, I want to go back to town. Not that town. This town. I gotta see what happens with the nuns now. And then I have to kill myself a few times for that guilt thing to happen. There you go. I have enough. I don't have much cash though for the shop though. It's another statue. Sisters forever grateful. You gonna do anything? Johnny. Oh no. Yeah, okay. All you get is a statue. Anything in the corner? No. So that's... That's every nun, every knot, every cherub, all in one playthrough. Oh, all the seeds. Oh, the lullaby. I have to take a lullaby all the way down. Okay. Yeah, there's still a few things I can do. I have to cash in these seeds, even. Six bucks from both of them. Okay, here you go. Here's your lullaby. See what happens when you do this. Sleep, my child. Cry loud. My voice sings to you. My girl was running along the clear shore under black leaves, under long branches. What did you see, my child, in the reflection of the water? What took your laughter? Who stole your soul? Sleep, child, your silver dream. I will watch over you until the dawn breaks. Sleep, my child. Sleep. Don't cry loud. My voice sings to you. Ah, uh, yes. Travel to the dream. Is it another arena? Oh. Oh, okay. Uh, moving arena. I'm making money here too, which is good. You got me. If I fall in the pit, is it just game? It's probably like you'll respawn, but if you touch the flames, it's game over. Wait, what? How did I do that? Oh no! Oh no. Ooh. 
Don't like this. This is not an arena. Ah, uh, okay. Whew. Is that it? <laughs> you probably get probably get a statue off this. Oh, they're dead. Oh, it's a spell. Okay. There's no happy endings in this game. Uh, what's this spell do? Uh, I should have read it. <laughs> uh, summons the presence of the Thorn Dame, which protects the Prendant One from all evil for a short. Ooh, is it like the angel in the first game that just looks like it's parrying attacks from like Street Fighter 3S? hope it is. Uh, altarpiece. How many of these do I got? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. What's he do? Oh. Crap. Missing eight statues? I know what this one is. But I don't know how to get it. I know what that one is too. That, I've had that one before. I'm missing these. There's another one in the chair? Then who's this? No, that's the one in the chair. Who's this? Okay. I'm missing a few things. Uh... Oh, I can talk to the him. That's where I need to go. I have no money though for him. That's all expensive stuff. Okay, I guess do this. Start the climb. Make the money from the enemies. Crap. How am I missing so many statues? Wait a minute. Actually, where are my items? Scroll the... I have the Elder, so I can't even talk to that guy. Oh. Do you have statues? You do. You're you're what I need. Okay. I need six thousand bucks. That's the statue I need. I should get it by the end of this area. I don't know where this is going to take- wait, what? There we go. One item. 5,000- perfect! Okay. Mark it. Wait, no, that's not even an item, that's just cash. Go back, just buy the item. Feast your- there. Now I need to equip all four. And that should open the door to the right. That's right beside us. You know they're in the spot because they're glowing. Okay. Uh, and then I want to attach my broken one. The rest I don't care about. Actually, what do these even do? I didn't even read what they did. But this door should open now. Yep, okay. Essence of Envoys. That's it? One room? Ah, uh, charred remains of the figures of the four envoys salvaged by the embers. The ashes shall mark as worthy of the skin of the one who performs the ultimate sacrifice, thus returning to the heavens. Okay. I'm 
And so I guess I can turn them off now. Put on some good stuff. Oh wow, they are gone, gone. Okay. Didn't expect that. Uh... Oh, now they're all over here. Okay, that's good. Uh... Reduce, increase the window of time to form a block. Increase this time with strength, okay. I'm keeping on this one until I max that out. What does she do? I'm actually generates. Ooh! Tempting. I uh, reduce the fur cost of encoding in the war. Sensor all light. Generate when attacking enemies. No. Okay. That's all just boosting damage. Okay, that's fine. Deuces and loss to one hit. Yeah, I'm keeping on that for the rest of the playthrough. Increases physical damage inflicted. Yeah, they don't combine. Do any of these combine? Wait, inc me mm. this increases lightning damage, and I have lightning 24/7. Stun power. Stun means nothing to me in this playthrough. Uh, nothing combines with this guy, right? Come on, something. Anything. Nothing. Okay. Uh, that's just a good one standing one. Effects of bio flasks. They don't combo, but their passives alone are pretty good. Okay. Final climb. If I do this climb, I should 100% the map. He still takes forever to kill. Though I think I won't 100% the map until after I kill the, the second last boss here. Because that room counts as 1%. Or whatever fraction of a percent to do it. Oh, so good. Everything falls apart against this. Like, increased lightning, increased damage from daggers. It's just all around a good combo. Like, those guys, you'd take me a long time to kill. And why did I jump so soon? Why did I try and parry in the air? my face it's not my head because he's got the helmet on definitely gonna heal right now okay good to go there wasn't enough of this kind of area where you have to duck there wasn't much ducking in this game needed I forgot they do that. Oh, I didn't know it was him. So much damage. Never use the sword again. Well, unless these guys show up. Oh, the, the combination of lighting and the dagger damage. I can get them done in one loop almost now. I know there's an item over here. There it is. Ooh, 
One, it's a mark? I didn't think it was gonna be a mark. I thought it was something relevant. My spells are worthless. Like, this, this is a dagger run. This is not a mage run. I could have parried that. I knew he was coming. Ow! Okay! Almost died to nothing. Oh, jeez. This goes down, I think. Oh, he got me! Okay, lightning's on. Whoa! Parries! You again? Surprised he wasn't the final thing. There are only two hits. That's how good this is. You want to go down here. There's like another path to loop around. I, th I don't know if it's for a mark. I really hope it's not a mark. I'd be okay with cash. Because I do need a few things. It's a mark. Crap. I'm not making enough cash for what I got to do. Oh, he got me. It's okay. Lightning wins every time. Uh, I need to go left for the sake of items. I don't know what this is. Five thousand that's not enough for what I need. I have to buy out a whole shop. I think that's where all the statues I need are. Cause what else? There's the wax seeds, that's one statue. There's the honey man, he probably gives you a statue. Eventually. Probably on death, like everything else in this game. But if there's more after that, I don't know where they're gonna be. Okay, heal up. Took too many free shots there. I don't have lightning. Yes, I do. I lied. That's a good hit. For all your marks, though? Yeah. Any other enemy, that probably would be dead. Okay, yeah, that that's better than the the other attack. Yeah, that's cross slash is definitely the better move than using all your marks. Ow! That barely hurt. Just lay into him. It's beautiful. Am I going up or to the left? Left. I have that, but I don't need it because I can warp from the save point. Okay. 99%? 99%. So the final percentage is up here. So go through here, warp up. That's it. Uh, wait! How did that happen? Okay, go back. 
don't have to do any of the arenas, at least. Oh, from behind. Just get the lightning going, that's all you gotta do. Oh. I a second to scratch my head. Savrock, how's it going? You, you made it for the end. We're at 100% completion of cherubs and everything. We found all the cherubs. I found the required items to get the good ending. It's all coming together. Oh, why'd I do that? Why'd I do that again? Heal up. Almost a full heal. Yeah, I don't know which ones I miss like the first playthrough, I missed three cherubs. I don't know which ones they were. But this time, I just marked everything as I kept playing. But it's all coming together. Oh, it's this stupid path that I didn't touch all the way. Yeah, you have to go down. There. Got it. Okay. That's all the map. The only thing left, this is the final bit of the map. 100%, I have to go out in there. There's nothing else I've missed. But I don't want to go there yet because it broke. Okay. Now I have to go talk to the honey man. What's the best way to get there? Where are my spells? Talk to the honey man. This should get me one more statue. From there, I think I need a lot of cash to get the rest of what I need. This boss might get me the cash I need, but it's not gonna get me enough, I think. Okay, here he is. Let not your spirit be grieved. The honey will repair all the damage the precious done honey. to my gift. The unwavering one, and it's gold too. Take the figure, and behold its unmatched, dazzling golden radiance. And on I shall, and then. Okay, if I leave and come back, he's probably gone. He's gone. Wait, don't you get anything from him? Well, it's a man that's been slowly deteriorating. There should... Is there something else you have to do with it? It's gold now. What does it do? Oh, I can't wait. I can read it. Increase the critical chance of striking with a weapon and attack damage. Okay, that's much better. Wasn't he supposed to give you an item? Oh no, wait, he's dead. I probably have to go talk to the other shop. It might be there. Okay, uh, travel. I need to go over here now. Basically, we're just checking off everything on the on the list now. All the collectibles I'm sending over to people. I might as well kill along the way. I need more cash. Holy crap, I'm getting so many crits now. For only 10% bonus. One more up. It's okay, take the hit, it's fine. Okay, talk to him. Give him the seeds. 
<laughs> I have to do this six times, unfortunately. Cool. I've already done all this before. But you get a statue. I need that statue. I thought when he died, the honey man, he would drop a statue. Like, memory of whatever his name is. Okay, this should be the last one. Then I leave and come back in kind of thing. There it is. Blessed. Okay, uh... He's getting closer. What else? Oh, I have this. There's a few things I can do. Scroll the Elder. Actually, where's the, the cursed letter? I don't even have that in my inventory. Okay, cash in this statue. I am I get another statue. I have come. How many left? One, two, three, four, five, six. Six. May the myth and for some reason I don't have one that I no, I've gotten before and I have the item to get it. I don't know how you activate it. Uh... I have to go to this shop. Travel between... At this point, the run- this file is now like eight hours in. So I can definitely beat it right now, get the good ending. But right now I want to see if I can get every single item before getting that ending. But I feel like I'm missing some items. I may have. She's on grave wounds. I can't buy at all. Go. Wasn't there a key? Didn't you give a key or something? It didn't work. What you want? Or do you have to buy everything from his store? I think. I feel like I'm forgetting like a chunk of stuff. But I need like twenty six thousand bucks to buy the last two statues off him. There it is. That's what I was looking for. I have come. May the mirror. Ha! Huh, crap. Okay. I feel like I don't even have all this. I'm missing a key. Creates a bear of thorns and inflict my asthma damage. I'm missing a black key. A letter. Oh, I forgot to give... I forgot. Uh... Fastest way would be... This one. I have to take this head back to the altar. And that'll give me another statue. Yeah, yeah, just keep falling for now. Take a little bit of damage, it's fine. I'm pretty sure she just gives you another statue. Or like, a remembrance of statue.
I'm gonna heal up just to be safe. But yeah, I'm not sure what I'm gonna be streaming next. I might play Nine Years of Shadows off stream and do some like video editing with that game. I'm not sure yet. Okay, let's skip this. Another statue. Actually, just confirm. Yeah, yeah, she's done. Well, like, I have nine years of shadows, another Metroidvania. I'm waiting for my free copy of Elden Ring Complete Edition to come in. Uh, where am I going? Right. Like, that's gonna be the big game that I'm gonna be playing for like a month or more, probably on stream. I am. I have come. Max capacity. 31 marks means nothing to me. That one, I, like, I've had that one before. I don't know how I missed it in my first play, how I got it in my first playthrough. Oh, no, one you get for beating... Wait, where is it? This one you get for beating the game. Or the next statue. Or the next boss, you get that one. I don't remember how I got that one. One, two, three, four. Four left. That's not bad. May the but they might be tied to that cursed letter and the, uh... That key. I forget what was it. I forget where that key was. Okay, I'm just gonna fight this boss. This boss will at least get me some items. But I gotta put on the right stuff to get some defense going. Just to get ready. Paula, how's it going? How's the Saturday mi What time is it? Midnight? Yeah, it's one in the morning here. Oh, Paul, I don't know what you're saying there. Okay, I gotta cash in some upgrades here. Actually, no, these are all... Uh, this has been working for me. I don't need to change that. I need to change... I need to change... I'll put this on. But I need to put on... Crap, what am I forgetting? Defense, that's what I'm doing. I don't need cash right now, I need defense. And I don't think I got the high defense item. There it is. He's all defense damage. Let's so just slap it all on. I'm pretty sure I know the three items I'm missing here. Okay, I'm good to go. I'm gonna have to skip all this dialogue again. This waiting. You can't skip it, I forgot. This endless waiting has been my penance. The original penance. As old as the Doing this should get me the 100% map. It appointed me or it's the next room, actually, the final boss. Perpetual by its grace. Perpetual in awaiting you an eternity. My miracle. Heed my prayer. Grant me thine blessing to fulfill thine holy command. And this defense should be so high. Dress my body in wounds. Lacerate the tattered parchment that clothes my flesh. Okay, there it goes. I am the first penitent. First phase is okay. And you Yeah, sorry, Paul. I don't know what you're saying, the Portuguese. The last. I don't have a translator installed for the bot. Actually, I forget what he can do. Fireballs. He can do fireballs.
Oh, I forgot the lightning. All my defense is for physical. Is he doing the spirit bomb? Yeah, he's doing. It's good music here. All the damage. There we go. Yeah, I didn't understand you. Now the real fight starts. Now let the Crimson Bindings finish what they once began. My penance is far from... Once the lighting gets going, this should be really fast. Or he might kill me fast, I don't know. He's, I should have died right there, actually, with the explosion. <laughs> oh, no! Okay. Completely forgot what's going on here. Oh, jeez, come on! I know how this works. Okay, that's okay. That's that's okay too. That's not okay. Whew. Oh, jeez. I forgot. I thought I was going to do it a little later. Jeez, he's already on. He's doing these a little sooner, isn't he? Oh, crap. I dodged it. I feel all oh right. This is the best part. Oh. Heal up. Oh, what? Lightning! It's so good. Are you learning English yet? So far, it's fine. I can understand what you're saying. That's a very gentle slice. Especially the, the sword doesn't even have like anything right inside it. I don't know how he stabbed people with that.
Okay. You get any cash for that? You get 10,000 bucks. That's not enough. I need more than that. Now I get her statue. It's an actual remembrance too. I have to go cash it in. The child, the clan, thus. The child, the clan, thus. Okay, so from there, there are three statues left. Two statues left. So I'm going to get both endings right now. I'm going to beat the game with bad ending. See if I get some cash for it. Reload the file and get the good ending. Uh, do you deny this, right? But yeah, we'll get the ending, see if I get some more cash, take the cash straight to that shop and buy him out. Hopefully get the key, that'll domino and get me the next item I need. Yeah, were you referring to the three cherubs there, Anna, Paula? I've already read all this. Oh, right, lightning. Okay. Once my lightning's going, it's much better. Oh, jeez, right, it comes back. Oh, that was bad timing. Okay, half health. Oh, not the flowers. There. Oh, oh, I dodged the other side. Too soon. A lot of crits. Ready? Cross slash! Beautiful. There you go. So that's one ending. See if I make money off that. I don't think you get an I don't think you get anything off this. Yeah, I'll let the ending play. Now I understand. And for this, I offer thee my humble thanks. This pain is my baptismal sacrament that will unite us in communion to make it flesh. Thus, we will be reborn as a new symbol incarnate, overflowing with devotion. The beginning of a new era for the miracle. <laughs> Penitent one's like, no! <laughs> Okay, so that's the bad ending. We can blast right to the good ending now. 87, 92 though? How do I have 92 on the ending that I didn't have everything? What am I missing? In like five hours less, but I'm 5% What? How much am I missing? That might be some percentage right there, but no, there's... Statues, maybe? I don't know, unless I buy items. Travel. 
Actually, I can just travel to the city. No, that's the bad ending, Paula. We'll get the good ending in a second. Right now, I'm just cashing some stuff in. I am. I okay, that's another statue. I have come. May the man. One, two, three. That's all that's left. But I don't know. I had this one. I don't know how I didn't get this playthrough. Got the older. Yeah, there's the old man. There's another old man. Uh. Okay, I can get the other ending right now. But, there's some items I can buy. But, I don't have everything. Where can I get cash fast? It can't be fighting my way up there. It's gotta be like, here. This is where all the money would be. I want to buy out that shop. Because I'm pretty sure if I buy out the shop, he gives me a key, and I can use that key into that one door to get another item. That gave me 120 bucks. That's not enough. Oh, half health. All for all my marks? No, that's not worth it. That wasn't worth it at all. Uh, I have a lot- those games, like, the only horror games I really enjoy are the Resident Evils. Like, I've played every Resident Evil there is. But like, I have Outlast, I just haven't gone around to playing it. And I have Amnesia, but my idea for Amnesia was like, I wanted to wait till like, VR was more normal. And that way I can just play it in VR. For like, maximum effect. But like VR just isn't up to snuff for me to like, I was like, oh, I'll buy a headset. Ooh, got the parry. This isn't making enough money. This is too slow. I need fast money. Yeah, I, like, VR was just too experimental still, like, you can find a few, like, what's, not even, like, demo, like, VR f food simulator kind of thing. Or, kitchen simulator, fast food simulator, just simulators. It's not real video games yet. And even, like, the Half-Life VR game, it was too short. We're not at the stage where VR is normal yet. Or you're getting real products out of it. Oh yeah, I don't doubt it's expensive in Brazil. <laughs> oh, I got one! I'm not even gonna bother hit tagging that guy, just... Keep moving. I wish I can cash in these marks for cash. It's 200 bucks for these guys. And as long as I play well, everything dies pretty fast. But how did I miss whole items? Ah! 
No, I'm I'm here in Canada. Whoa! I'm making some cash this way. It's not enough. It's not fast enough. Are the Americans, but it's not American. Ow! That hit me twice? I, this isn't fast enough for cash. How much did I make? Like eight thou? No, I think there's like there's a need for the differentiation. Is there a secret here? No. Yeah, I can think of two items I'm missing. How did that happen? I have no idea. I went over this game with a fine tooth comb. I'm getting 50 bucks for those kills. Not even worth it. How much for these guys? 120. I'm going to be able to buy one item. That's it. Oh. Hmm. Wait a minute. That's what this is the one I was looking for. This is the item. So I bought it from him. Uh Do I only need two more? I'm going to buy that first. Go. Because with this I can find out where hidden items are. I don't need it, but just in case. And I know where the last two items are. How much more I need? I may. 2400. So 13. 13,000. <laughs> There's no more bosses. And let's check here. 1 2 3 There's three statues. Three statues, but he's selling two of them. So there's one statue somewhere I didn't find. Oops, that is the wrong thing. There's something else somewhere. Unless killing this, this, the final boss in the good ending gives you the statue. That's my only guess. But I feel like this should give you a statue. Like a better, another statue. Oh, unless, hmm. Ah. Uh, what are my options? Finish the game, see if I get a statue. See if I can get that key. See if that gives me a statue. Do the cursed letter. See if that gives me a statue. Yeah, there, there's no place that's perfect. We 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 can all agree on that. Ah, uh, it's the one statue I wanted though. Okay, I'm gonna go for the ending now because that'll give me the 100% map completion. That's one achievement. Get the good ending. That's another achievement. Actually, wait a minute. I was up there. How come? 
Something's wrong. I was up there, but I didn't get the achievement. So, am I missing something? Unless it's a secret room that I overlooked. <laughs> there! I forgot to do this way. We're going back. Luckily, I found it fast. This might be the last statue I need, too. Hopefully, like, at least give me the achievement for 100% map, so I know that's finally done. Because that way I can at least tell, like, okay, I've done everywhere on the map. I've seen everything. There. This should give me the achievement. It's a... It's a warp! There's something else! What have I missed? Crap. I found all the cherubs, but I'm missing part of the map now. How did I miss it? There. Okay. It's a good thing I'm finding these fast. And one of these might go to that item that I'm missing. Down and to the right, yep. No, they weren't hiding apart, like I just missed it on the map. Like, you can see, like, there's a tick of the map that's not, like, that's open. That just means something I missed. But, like, there are rooms that you had to, like, slap open, hit the wall to open the path. And I'm hoping I didn't miss any of those. Because that'll, that'll make things hard. But if it's just an open area I forgot to check, that's fine. And I'm hoping it leads me to the item I'm missing, too. And hopefully it just dominoes and gets me everything I need. Plus, I do have to do all this backtracking for the money that I need, too. No, I didn't get the achievement. There's somewhere else I didn't look. Unless there's secrets in here. That gave me a lot of cash, though. Uh, I'm at 99% still. What have I missed? I really hope it's not like a secret door. Crap. Wait. What if... Oh no, it showed up on the map. Crap, okay. What have I missed? What... It's either a secret wall I'm overlooked, or there's a tick I haven't checked. Crap. The only thing I would have to slap on the bell and the bell will chime when I'm near the secret or where I'm near the wall that's breakable. Oh, I know. I know what's happened here. So there are, there's a quest that I can't do because I don't have it right now, but it opens up secrets. So like right here, it opens up door here. And I can't start that quest because I'm missing the letter. And the letter, you have to do a series of child quest, mission, hint, puzzles to open it up. That's what's happened here. And that's the missing room. And there's probably other secrets that open up other rooms. So I can't do it unless I find that letter. But I don't know where it is. 
I can at least finish the game and get the good ending. We can do that right now. I think we just have to fight the same boss. No, I didn't do the puzzles before. I didn't know what they were do I I didn't start it in my first playthrough, basically. But the problem is I'm missing the item to start them. That's what I'm missing. Corporeal and inscrutable fathers. I am the heir of your all encompassing light. I'm letting this play because there might be new dialogue. Devotion itself, embodied in weathered flesh and gilded filigree. Your magnum opus. Though I am crowned with your glory, why do you censure my presence alongside you? What is this obscure darkness of unanswered cries that prevents me from understanding the purpose of my birth? Are the same crimson clouds that heralded my welcome the grave omen of your judgment? If this confrontation is proof of thy dignity of your glory, then so be it. Now we're going for a different ending, Paula. You have to do it again. Hopefully there's some new attacks. Wait, oh. Okay, this is a, wait a second. Why? I need the right spell here. These don't give you lightning stacks. That's a new spell. Ow. Aw, oh, man. You up twice. That hit me? Come on. Okay, I got lightning now. Oh, I didn't land. Oh, come on. My, don't lose the lightning. Oh, I'm playing like crap now. Okay. See if there's another phase now. See if I get any cash for this ending. It's a little too easy though, Paula. Like the second last boss is harder than that. Dost thou respond to my pleas with pain? Pain in the flesh, yet your very flesh I am. Pain in the heart, 
Yet your heart itself I hold. My punishment will be your sole legacy. I like how the lightning's still going on the blades. And I shall die. I shall die reconciled with the mystery of my birth. The devotion of the men oh, was made incarnate and suffered pain. The affliction cometh to an end, for the icon falls, and with it the miracle's designs and its will so capricious. And so you shall ascend, both in body and soul through dreamed kingdoms to the holiest of places hey to the cradle I know some of these people all blessings safe under our watchful eyes and once there you will be captured within the ancient canvas of light and time the penitence is thus complete Got the ending. Ending A. Yeah, that's the good ending, Paula. Do I get anything for... Is it gonna be a better title screen? Oh! <laughs> that one ribbon, okay. My only guess is the ribbon, the rhythm, the ribbon is, uh... What's her name? Ka Kandra? Cassandra? 